American Comics, Psychiatrist, Cut Who Wonder Gwen, Author, Simple One, 151. Sky Legion, Overlord Legion, Godzilla can fly. Following Su Yi let the dancer speak out. So the dancer was helping Su Yi wash up, and at the same time reported to Su Yi about the expansion of the Legion, the Kingshin Legion, the Overlord Legion, and the new grand plan. Su Yi rinsed the water, then spit it out. Finally, she said after accepting Mei Ai's hot towel applied to her face. I see, continued to record, continued to report. Don't look at this as a big deal. In fact, the reason is very simple. It's just a big foundation. Need to expand the army. At the same time, the demand has also increased. More transport ships are also needed to go back and forth to collect resources. It's like playing StarCraft. Cybertron is the first main base. Then the second base is going to be built on the opposite side of Xingang. There are two bases. Definitely need another legion to garrison. So with the development of civilization, general expansion is normal operation. The shapeshift in King Kong civilization is getting stronger and stronger, but it can't just stay on Yeboten right? Certainly not enough. So don't be surprised, kid FK. Correct. At this moment Su Yi remembered. Has the little guy grown up? If it reaches 500 meters, it's time to become a war monster in the King Kong army. Singularity Godzilla does not go to the universe to fight. What's the use of staying on earth? Go and see. But before that, Su Yi sent a message to Gwen to see if she woke up. After all, Gwen University is going to study similar studies. So it's good to take her to see more. Su Yi, Gwen didn't wake up. I'll take you there. Has the little guy grown up? If he grows up, he will be thrown into the universe. Finished. So Yi put away the phone first. Afterwards, I went to the oversized wooden bowl bed in the small universe to see if Wanda woke up. At the moment Wanda became a big move again because there was no sun. But her right leg was falling asleep in a yoga stretch. It seems that the dancer recently taught her yoga is not bad. But look at Wanda's bright red lips. So Yi chose to cover her and talk fiercely. That's all. Wanda woke up. She couldn't help but best at Suyi for a while. Then it opened. Suyi smiled and said, I heard that princesses are awakened by kisses. 18. Wanda smiled happily. The one who woke her up with a kiss must be a handsome and charming prince. Can. Compliment each other. Then the two tangled for a while. Then after parting. When Wanda went to wash up, Suyi Kai said, I'm going to take you and Gwen to see the little guy in the morning, and if he grows up, I'm going to send him to Cybertron. Wanda tied her hair up and got ready to take a shower. So fast? Is that fast? So Yi spread his hands. It wasn't long before I saw him last time that he was going to reach 400 meters. So it's about the same time. Well, okay, I'll go after I wash up. Wanda nodded. Then he took the twin dancers to wash up. Cack. At this time, the door is opened. Gwen came in through the door. Only then did Su Yi react and took out his phone. Gwen's news for a while. Gwen, here we come right away. The time to return to him is less than 5 seconds. And then it wasn't even 5 minutes away from those 5 seconds. So you looked at the time. Fly over here. Yes. Gwen nodded happily. I changed my clothes in 2 minutes, said hello in 1 minute, and then flew over in the last 2 minutes. Strong. So Yi gave a thumbs up. This speed is really fast. Faster than his car time to go to work. At the same time, Su Yi also liked Gwen's attitude very much. He just likes women who are not in ink. And Gwen Yuanqing is the most beautiful girl so she doesn't need makeup at all. Wanda is about the same. But if she puts on light makeup, puts on the corners of her eyes, and puts on some lipstick, she will be super charming. And with the help of dancers, it doesn't take long to wait, Parter. No, Wanda has already come out at this time. Okay, here we are. So you looked at it and clapped his hands. Then let's go early and come back early, and we have to go to Gwen's house for dinner at noon. Snap Tilda. Next moment, the three appear on an invisible yacht. Then the next moment, the yacht teleports with the three of them and then disappears. Then came the Pacific Ocean. Then the cyber yacht starts to drive. A moist sea breeze blows. Gwen happily raised her hands and waved them in the air. Wanda leans against the fence. He stretched out his jade hand and put the red hair that was blown by the wind behind his ears. To be honest, the more this kind of action. Suyila felt that she had a mature flavor. This kind of temperament. Demeanor and habits are difficult for most girls to have, and Su Yi likes this. Cough cough cough. Off topic. After the yacht arrived in the Pacific Ocean, Su Yi released a trace of Phoenix Force, and then waited for the little guy to arrive. Okay, wait for the little guy to come. Appeared with a breath of Phoenix Force. In the deep sea, a 500 meter high behemoth with an obsidian appearance suddenly opened its big truck-like eyes, then it excitedly swam towards the place where the breath came out. At the same time, maybe this giant beast doesn't even know that there is a special energy being used in every gesture. This makes it swim very fast. It seems that there is an afterimage dragging. Dot. On the yacht. Together, Gwen and Wanda guess where the little one is coming from. Gwen pointed to the entire north side and said, I guess the little one comes from here. Since Gwen guessed north, that Wanda folded her arms, tilting his head to point to the south. Then I guess it's south. So Yi smiled when he heard it. After a while, a huge fin of several hundred meters swam over from the west. Gwen is 180 degrees north. Wanda is 180 degrees south. Godzilla is 90 degrees to each station in the west. 
just swimming along the center line, it can be said, it perfectly avoids a guess. After it swims to the side of the yacht, wow Tilda, with Godzilla sticking his head out of the sea, its larger body than before drove more seawater to rush down from its head. Wait until the water is gone. Gwen looked at the obsidian-like armor skin on Godzilla and said in surprise, little guy, you are really going to become a black warrior. Wanda looked over, it's the obsidian warrior. It's the same. All in all, the little guy is really different all over. I said it before, newborn Godzilla is just gray and black. Then it becomes almost completely black in the middle. But it's not all black. Its skin is getting darker and darker like a full body armor, and it is getting closer. So in the end it became the armor skin like obsidian now. Looks so handsome. Not bad. Su Yi also nodded in satisfaction. Godzilla is so handsome. When the time comes, who wouldn't say that his master is more handsome? Do you know how to show off? So you watched Gwen and Wanda play on the little guy's head. So he unleashes psychokinesis. Take a look at Godzilla's overall height. 520.1 meters. Okay, not only did it exceed the 500 meter altitude given by Su Yi, by the way, it has grown to a nice height. Definitely. It is impossible for the little guy to be at this height in the future. Maybe you will see it again this afternoon. It is already the height of 521. And Su Yi didn't know exactly how tall it could grow. If I'm not mistaken, there is no limit to the growth of Singularity Godzilla, right? It seems as long as food and energy are plentiful, can keep growing. So the little guy is actually restricting it on Earth. If it goes to the universe, that's a space monster. Well, come back. Su Yi said after seeing the little guy's height. Little guy. You are 500 meters long enough, and I will send you to Cybertron in person later. Godzilla was taken aback. Then who, who Tilda I was also at a loss. It doesn't know whether it is better to leave or not to leave. So, in a hurry, it unleashes a little of the energy of Sui a singularity Godzilla originally. Um, so ye felt this force. He looked at Gwen and Wanda. Wait. You two come down first. Wait until the two women come down. So you looked at the little guy and said. You don't use atom breath. Try to see if you can use energy. Godzilla? Godzilla doesn't understand. But Godzilla obeyed. Does not use atomic breath. Then use the energy in your body again. So Godzilla started brewing. Immediately afterwards. Bake. It's like using a gas stove. Godzilla's body first exploded with a mass of energy. Then pushed the yacht far away. So Yi waved his hand. The yacht directly fixes the space-time node. Then he said to Godzilla. Go on. Don't stop. Godzilla continues to brew right away. Immediately afterwards. Baking Tilda. A larger deflagration occurred than at the beginning. But just for a moment. However. The surrounding sea water was pushed away violently, then clattered back. Godzilla is still brewing. At this time, Bake Tilda appeared with a small roar. It was like a buzz Tilda. Immediately afterwards, Godzilla's whole body was burning upward with a red and blue flame. Godzilla was taken aback for a moment. It looked at its two little claws. Its tiny claws are on fire, but it doesn't hurt at all. At the same time, I feel that I have endless energy. Godzilla is looking down. The energy passes through the sea water. But sea water has no effect at all. Just push it out slightly. Wow Tilda. Gwen was surprised when she saw it. Why is the little guy so handsome all of a sudden? Wanda was also very strange when she saw it. What are these fires? No, it's not fire. Otherwise the sea water under the little guy's feet would burn. Let alone Wanda. Even Godzilla himself doesn't know what happened to him. What? How can I catch fire? But Su Yi is very clear. He could feel the energy that the little guy had unintentionally released just now. A core reactor was formed in the little guy's body. You can call it a small black hole. Or simply call it the arc reactor. In short, this thing is like the dungeon in cultivation of immortals. Once this thing is formed, henceforth, Godzilla can never eat, never breathe, never drink, etc etc. Because that little black hole can give it everything it needs for life. As long as the small black hole is filled with energy and not destroyed. Then Godzilla is always alive and kicking full of fighting power. So Su Yi explained briefly, you should know that the reactor in the little guy's body collapsed into a small singularity black hole. From then on, the life of the little guy only needs the energy in the singularity black hole, and it will have a deflagration mode, or whatever you want to call it Super Saiyan mode. In short, after turning on this mode, the little guy will accelerate the burning of the energy in its singularity black hole. But the little guy's combat effectiveness will be improved by leaps and bounds, and the bigger the flame burns, the higher the combustion efficiency of the little guy and the higher the combat effectiveness. So, in a nutshell, Godzilla has a Super Saiyan blaster mode. Once turned on, doubling the energy consumption, but doubling the strength. Maybe an atomic breath blasts through the continent of Erskid, or spray directly through the Earth. Correct. So Yi thought of something and added, its function can also allow it to travel at an accelerated speed in the universe, and it can also fly on the Earth. Huh? Gwen was delighted. Try flying one. Wanda also looked at Godzilla. Apparently she also wanted to see how Godzilla flew. So you looked at the little guy and said, you can fly, just try to pull yourself as far as you can. You don't have to worry about energy consumption. The energy you have stored during this period is enough for you to use for a long time. It's really impossible to go to 973 with more Cybertron energy, so you can eat it wherever you want. Joke. The shape-shifting King Kong now has three infinite gems, 
Okay, infinite gems are each theoretically full of infinite energy, so the little guy can grow up with buff energy absorbing just under the age of just holding a gem in his mouth. And Godzilla heard Su Yi's words. It also started preparing to fly. Um. Pull yourself with energy. What means? Apparently Godzilla doesn't understand. Su Yi's phoenix force came out, so he waved his hand. A video in his mind was projected live. And the protagonist of the video is, Captain Marvel. Ah yes. That Captain Marvel with a double star ability. Her ability is very similar to Godzilla. Even the Super Saiyan form is exactly the same, and the content played in the projection is exactly how Captain Marvel flies in the double star state. Ho ho tilde. After watching the projected content, Godzilla nodded to show he understood, so its two little paws started to look for this state in one fell swoop. No, so Yi sighed when he saw this movement, there is no need to imitate the movement. You have to use Nen Huang. Gwen and Wanda laughed and trembled when they saw it. Such a big Godzilla. Use two chubby claws to draw in one stroke. It's fierce and cute. After listening to Su Yi's words, Godzilla lowered his claws. Then he began to use energy to pull himself up and fly. It's different from Iron Man's use of external energy. The steel battle suit needs energy injected from footsteps to fly. And having energy in the body is another way. Wow Tilda. For a while, the flames coming out of Godzilla are even better. The surrounding sea water was gradually pushed away. Then under the watchful eyes of the three, Godzilla Godzilla's body appears to have lifted a little from the surface of the sea. Get up, Gwen said happily. Wanda looked over. Although the speed of getting up is slow, it is really flying. Gradually, Godzilla gets up faster and faster. 100 meters from the sea. 200 meters from the sea. 400 meters from the sea. Then with a crash, it completely left the sea. Fly straight to the sky, Godzilla. It really took off. A monster of more than 500 meters is flying in the sky. When this Ultraman comes, he will be scared to death. How can such a big monster fly? Fly away. Wanda and Gwen happily clapped their hands in celebration. So did Su Yi. Godzilla can fly, which is very powerful in the universe. But at the same time, in the reclusive Tony's house, there was a sudden alarm in the lab on Friday. Alert! Alert! The satellite detects that a supergiant creature is flying over the Pacific Ocean. Alert! Alert! Tony was drinking coffee early in the morning. It was said that he was holding coffee in one hand, and turned on the real-time video captured by the satellite with a wave of the other. So Tilda, boom! The coffee fell to the floor. Tony's voice of disbelief resounded through the lab. Water fake? Dot. 152. Tony wants to learn magic. Go to Gwen's for lunch. In Tony's field of vision. Photographed by satellite. A giant monster about 500 meters in size is flying in the air. Is this acceptable if a normal person sees it? What kind of monster is this? Water fake? Godzilla used to living water. So ye made it best not to be exposed. So Godzilla basically didn't go ashore. Even if you go ashore. You will go to the north and south levels to have a look. And the ocean is so big. The two levels of surveillance from the north to the south are useless. So except for Godzilla breathing energy, almost no one and no equipment can find it. What's more, the reactor in Godzilla's body is shielded from sonar or radar scanning. Then it's even harder to spot it. Only, Tony looked at Godzilla in disbelief. What kind of monster is this? What if this monster attacks the city? The main thing is that it can fly. But suddenly, Tony remembered what he asked Sue not long ago. A burst of energy in the Pacific Ocean. Is it possible? That's it. Think here. Tony immediately ordered Friday. Friday, call Sue for me. Okay, Doctor. 21. On the yacht, Su Yi, who was watching Godzilla flight at the moment, also received a call. He picked it up and took a look. It's Tony. Then he already guessed what it was. Hello, Sue. Do you know that there is a giant monster flying in the Pacific Ocean? I know. Mine. As long as you know, I'll just wait. Yours? So you looked at Godzilla who was strolling in the sky. Yes, I raised a pet in the Pacific Ocean a long time ago. Don't worry about it. I'm going to send it to the universe today. That's good. If it's your pet, I'll... Wait, how do you send the card beast that is 2,500 meters away from the parallel universe to the universe? Magic teleportation. What age is it? Who still uses pure science? As soon as Suyi spoke, Gwen and Wanda on the side couldn't help laughing. Tony. On the other hand, was silent. Woo 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 tilde. Today's Tony technology is pure science and technology. So he was really hit. After a long silence, Tony sighed, but asked suddenly, Sue, I remember you sent Wanda to study in Magician. I know that, but can I still learn now? I can start as an apprentice. What Tony said made Su Yi very satisfied. Especially the last sentence, I can start as an apprentice. Yes, no matter what you did before. But as long as you come into contact with new things, no matter what you did before, you must abandon distracting thoughts. It is right to start as an apprentice. Stephen all started as apprentices, and Su Yi also said it. He's repeating it to Tony now too. A true master always has the heart of an apprentice. Tony, you're right. You should know where Kamartage is. Fly yourself and land nearby and walk into Kamartage. Just report my name when you see Sorcerer Supreme last. Upon hearing this, Tony nodded immediately. No problem at all. I can go there tomorrow. But do I have to prepare anything? 
Money? Gifts? Just bring your brain. Learn. After hanging up the phone, Su Yi looked at the phone and smiled. Wonder understood Su Yi's small expression. That's because I want to have fun in my heart. She walked to Su Yi's side and asked, Su, you must be expecting something. Upon hearing this, Wen pricked up her ears as she watched Godzilla fly. Yes, Su Yi nodded and put away the phone. I want to see if a genius scientist can become a genius magician and whether this is interoperable. Wanda and Gwen thought about it. They all shook their heads uncertainly, because everyone's ability is different. You have high ability here, but not necessarily low ability there, unless you're an all-rounder. But, Tony actually became a Sorcerer Supreme in the comics, and a technical version of the Sorcerer Supreme. The magician armor he built later can cast spells instantly without singing, and also with smart lock cast. There are also automatic analysis of weaknesses and attribute restraint etc. It's safe to say that version of Iron Man is pretty fun. Wrong. Because it's going to be fun to say Iron Man who turns on the transsequence armor. What kind of battle armor can have? Spend more than now. Okay, back to the topic. Flying in the sky with Godzilla. It may be happier and happier as it flies, and it refuses to come down. So Yi clapped his hands. Papa, little guy, come back. After Godzilla heard it, it turned back decisively and plunged into the sea. Boom tilde. The 500 meter giant fell into the water. I don't know how Lu Aya would choose if he encountered this thing. So Yi thought about it. Although there are many people who will lose their pole and run, but it is estimated that many people will choose to go to the giant fight with it. Clatter Tilda, Godzilla dives into the ocean and emerges again. At the moment it had turned off Saiyan's status. So Yi nodded with satisfaction. With this state, you will not be bullied when you go to the universe. The hardness of the tank plus the damage of the magician plus the body of the warrior plus the agility of the assassin. Except for being big, Godzilla doesn't have any shortcomings now. Not bad, Su Yi nodded, and then said. Then I'll send you to Cybertron now. You're grown up, it's time to join the Legion. Raw Tilda, Godzilla nodded and let out a soft growl. Su Yi stretched out his hand and snapped his fingers. Crack. Next moment, the three of them plus a giant monster disappeared at the same time. Then came the planet Cybertron. This is once here. Gwen saw the super large starport parked outside the planet Cybertron. There are also two Legion battleships divided into red and blue, and there are countless intelligent robots transporting energy and supplies to the battleship, and the surface and interior of the planet Cybertron. There are also countless conveyor belts that are working on a fully automatic assembly line. So fast, Gwen said in shock. The shape-shifting dudes are moving so fast. I said it before. The development of the shapeshift in King Kong is almost the same day by day. Player Unknown's battlegrounds from the beginning to the back of the planet transformation. Then expand resources. The last legion strikes. So far, shapeshift in King Kong has done in a few months what many civilizations could not do in a lifetime. No. The vast majority. Almost all of them. Wanda looked at the planet Cybertron. Although she doesn't understand these machines. She knows that the shapeshift in King Kong civilization is already very powerful. This can be seen just by looking at it, and after Godzilla came into the universe, it was a little confused at first, because this feeling is so different from the Earth. But Godzilla soon found out, as long as you pull yourself with energy like you are on the Earth, then he can still fly in the universe, soon, because Godzilla is too big. So it was discovered by Cybertron as soon as it appeared. A fighter plane flew over in the distance, but after getting closer, he found out that it was Su Yi. They immediately stopped and said respectfully, the creator, Su Yi nodded, then snapped his fingers. Crack. Immediately, the shapeshift in King Kong and Su Yi who just flew over all arrived on the surface of the planet Cybertron. After all the elders, collector and twin dancers saw Su Yi. They all said respectfully, the creator, owner. Su Yi nodded. Then he turned around and introduced to them. This is Godzilla. In the future, it will go out with your legion on expeditions, and it will be called only for the needs of fighting. It will become a warrior with you, or it can be called a war behemoth or a monster. It will grow together with you. By the way, infinite gems can also let it dry. In short, from now on, Chuzilla will be your teammate. After hearing these words, yes, creator, all the elders express their understanding. As for the question of loyalty, that doesn't need to be considered at all. Which of the units sent by the creator is not absolutely loyal? The twin dancers are the best example. They are stewards and messengers here but the elders knew, their bodies serve the creator beside the creator, this is a great honor, it is also novel for collector to look at this cosmic monster, this is another creature it has never seen before, the Tangent group collector has seen it all, and there's more than one, but Godzilla he really saw for the first time, how powerful is this creator, same, Godzilla also looked at these elders curiously, those shapeshifting King Kong descendants are about 15 meters, which is average for it. But each of these veterans has a file size of 10,000 meters. Godzilla's height of 500 meters can only reach the height of the track under their bodies. It's like you're standing downstairs with more than a dozen floors. But it doesn't matter, they adapt quickly. The veterans seldom attack, and generally serve as the core work of Cybertron. So far two legions. There are only about 10-20 veterans dispatched at the same time. 
But Collector asked at this time, will Godzilla join the Optimus Legion or the Bashan Legion? Ah yes, now the shape-shifting King Kong civilization has two legions. So which one to add? So ye thought about it? Which legion collects areas with a high risk factor? It will go there, stand by at any time, and switch at any time. That is, it is not fixed. Where is the danger? As for the question of death, so ye can solve it. Even if Godzilla dies in battle, so ye can get it back. Collector hears this. He knew that Suyi was not a kind person. So ye could feel Collector's heart. But that scrap. How could Mercy choose to let the shapeshift in King Kong develop wantonly, collect resources infinitely, and even half coerce to get back infinite? What about gems? If Suyi evaluates himself, then he is neither an evil man nor a good man. He is just a person with a bottom line and loves life. Next, after placing Godzilla, Suyi said to it, This will be your home from now on little guy. Godzilla looked around. Then he turned his head and nodded to Su Yi. I used to play alone in the sea. Most play with animals in the sea. Now there are so many shapeshift in King Kong. It looks much more fun than in the sea. After seeing Godzilla familiar, so Su Yi nodded, turned to Gwen and Wanda and said, dot then we're leaving. Gwen's family is about to eat. The two nodded. Su Yi snapped his fingers. Crack. After one sound, the three returned to the living room at home. I just saw Hala and Tanmai getting ready to go out. Seeing that Su Yi and the others came back, Hala reached out to report. We're going to play with the big guys. Wanda said after hearing it, Hala, Godzilla is no longer on Earth, huh? Where is that? On Cybertron. You and Nata go to Cybertron to play with Godzilla. Su Yi said. Go to Cybertron. Oh yes, Renata. I haven't brought you to Cybertron to watch it yet. Hala suddenly remembered this. So he took out the transmitter and took Ganata's hand and said. Then we went to play on Cybertron. There was a click. Hala went to Cybertron with Kanata and the other side. So you looked at the time. Plus 11 colon 05. Time to go to Gwen's. But he just left Wanda at home and followed Gwen to her house. This seems a bit bad. Wanda saw Su Yi's hesitation. And Gwen knew that the time was up but he didn't know how to mention it. She could roughly guess what it was for. So Wanda took the initiative to let go of Su Yi's hand. Then he gently pushed Su Yi and said, Isn't it just this time? You guys go quickly. Remember to go early and return early. Even so, but Su Yi knew. The two of them left. Wanda looked at the empty home. That's either going to grow roses in loneliness, or practice spells alone. Is this really good? This is not good. Su Yi hugged her, and then he glanced at Gwen first, then smiled softly at Wanda. We're gone. You won't cry. Will you? No way. Gwen roughly understood the look. So she booed from the side. We're leaving. Wanda must be hiding under the covers and crying under the quilt. Or oh, I miss Suyi too much. So I just pat myself on love in the bathroom. When Wanda heard this, she immediately became angry and wanted to hit Gwen. Gwen ducked. Wanda couldn't get out of Suyi's arms. Suyi, Kionmas, hugged her tightly at this time and smiled. Well then, I have an idea. Wanda, Gwen. What? Ahem. So Yi coughed twice. I kept Wanda's presence to a minimum so that she could speak in front of your parents and your parents wouldn't feel Wanda's presence. Then Wanda will modify your parents' subconscious mind to see you, and let your parents know that Wanda is my sister. In this way, Wanda can not only travel further, but we can also eat and chat together, which is great. As soon as this statement came out, Gwen and Wanda's eyes lit up. Gwen was about to say yes, so Yi reminded again. But there is also a downside to this, that is, Gwen and your parents have been influenced subconsciously which is a bit bad, so Yi thinks, after all, it affects the subconscious mind, and the object is the parents, which is really a bit bad, but who knew that Gwen said immediately, it's okay, it's not modifying any memory, it's just a temporary effect, Gwen smashed her eyes, then he looked at Su Yi and Gwen and said, and wouldn't it be better for everyone to eat and chat together, look, what is the layout, only the world where Gwen's parents were hurt reached, Gwen tilde, and Wanda hugged Gwen emotionally, then I forgive you for bullying me with Su before, Su Yi, 11, no, is this a good deal? Oh, by the way, it seems to be the first time in Xik in town. Su Yi and Gwen almost broke Wanda together. Okay then sorry. Su Yi also stepped forward to hug the two girls and said, Then let's go, time is running out, we can go out to play at night after dinner. Good. With everyone getting ready, Su Yi randomly took three bottles of relatively good wine from the wine cellar as gifts, then hit straight. Next moment, the three appeared near Gwen's house. Gwen stepped forward and opened the door. Mom, George, I brought Sue and his sister to a house for dinner tilde. 153. Gwen's web browsing history. Perfect for a potluck. Following Gwen's call, Mrs. Stacy and George Stacy both came out. It's just that they walked out to look at Sue Yi and wonder for a moment. The depths of their eyes turned red. Then wait until it returns to normal. Great. You guys are finally here. Come in. Lunch is already being made. Excuse me. So Yi nodded. Then go in with Wanda and Gwen. After arriving at Gwen's house, So Yi looked at George before speaking formally. This is the first official meeting, Mr. George. Definitely. That time doesn't count. George smiled and shook hands with Su Yi. That time was the time when he didn't know Su Yi. Mrs. Stacy was surprised when she heard it from the side. Have you met before? Definitely. So Yi smiled. George quickly said, I didn't know Su at that time, 
but he gave me a very good impression when we first chatted. For Su Yi, he must be satisfied and couldn't be more satisfied. One golden age, only less than five years older than Gwen. Two noble profession, doctors in the United States are high income, high knowledge, high social groups. Three perfect appearance, both appearance and attitude are very good, and she is also very good to Gwen. And Gwen also said that her tutoring was done by Su Yi. This also makes George think Gwen can get such good grades. That must be due to Su Yi. So after the overall conditions are combined, George also had a chat with Mrs. Stacy last night. Out of 100 words, the evaluation given by the two is 1000%. Next, Gwen and Wanda chat with Mrs. Stacy, and then go to the kitchen to chat while cooking. And George put down the scarf in his hand and then took Su Yi to chat near the sofa. Su Yi looked at the scarf he put down. I know that George probably cooks by himself at home. He couldn't help smiling. It's not that men are afraid of their wives when they cook, but men are actually more attractive in cooking. Women have two stomachs. If you are satisfied from top to bottom, then it is easy to be satisfied. But at this moment, when George saw the red wine that Su Yi put down, he was taken aback. Then exclaimed directly, My dear, it's Romani Kanti. George looked at Su Yi in surprise. Su Yi knew what he was worried about, so he waved his hand and said, Don't worry, my family send a bunch of them away. Wine tasting makes people happy, and a relaxed mood can make people more happy mentally and spiritually. So it's a good habit to drink a little wine when you have nothing to do. George's eyes lit up when he heard it. He showed an expression of approval that all men understand and agree with. I think you're right. You must say the same to Gwen's mother later. She usually doesn't like me drinking. Su Yi nodded and made an okay gesture. 660 inches is no problem. George sees this, so I was very happy to go forward to check the red wine. Some people in the United States will open and use the gifts from others in person. This is respect for the giver, rather than being disrespectful. So George opened the wine seal in front of Su Yi. He was still surprised immediately. It's Canty Grand Cru Garden, because of the three bottles of wine that Su Yi sent. The two bottles are wines produced by Grand Cru Vineyards with an annual output of less than 5,500 bottles. There is also a bottle of wine from a Grand Cru Vineyard that has been discontinued. If only the first drink could be obtained as Sergeant George, he really can't get the second kind of wine. This can only use relationships. Then get someone to do it. But the price is definitely expensive. For spending so much money on drinks, George is sure not to drink. One thought here. George felt his mouth go dry. The mouth seems to have been baked dry and there is no saliva. Think here. George turned and looked into the kitchen. Then he looked at Su Yi and whispered, Let's drink the best bottle first, otherwise something bad will happen to it at home. Su Yi laughed when he heard it. Can. I can hear it. George happily put away the first wine. Then immediately grabbed the wine opener and glasses and start prepping. Su Yi watched from the side, and wanted to help. Who knew that George immediately pushed his hand away and said, No no no. You can't move, you are our guest today. Please do it now, and then we will taste this bottle of red wine together. Su Yi sat down helplessly. Then George, who was very serious, started drinking. He first sterilized the tools. At the same time, feel the temperature and taste. Then wipe the wine bottle clean, and wipe your own hands clean. Finally started drinking. After a while, with the sound of boo, the wine bottle is opened. At the same time, there is a hint of wine aroma. George approached the bottle. Then loosen it with your hands. Immediately the scent became stronger. George took a sip and said intoxicated. Hatilda, this kind of red wine is too rare. After getting drunk, George began pouring out the red wine to sober up. The purpose of sobering up is actually very simple. It is to make these wines that have been settled for too long live. The purpose is to promote the oxidation of the wine body. I have to give you another metaphor. It's milk powder. It is definitely not good to drink a milk powder when it is agglomerated but you just beat the milk powder well before drinking, that must be delicious, that's pretty much it, that's all, about half an hour later, eat Tilda, as Gwen happily brought the dishes to the table, she saw Su Yi and her father sipping a bottle of red wine beside the sofa, wow Tilda, don't call me when you drink secretly Tilda, Gwen said it right away, scared, George spilled a little of the red wine in his glass onto his hand, then he quickly lowered his head and sipped the wine, this kind of wine can't be wasted at all, unless it's on the ground, and after sipping the wine, George immediately made a shush gesture to Gwen, Gwen pouted, he glanced at the wine with his eyes, after seeing it, George could only look at Su Yi, Su Yi took another sip, then nod, and at the same time stretch out your finger to point to half a glass, meaning Gwen can only drink half a glass, George nodded in agreement when he saw it, then he beckoned Gwen over, he he, after seeing that I can drink, Gwen trotted over immediately, and George could only pour Gwen half a glass, Gwen took the glass and took a sip, it smells like a thick jam, really, George and Su Yi nodded, the bottle tasted like a grape drink at first, but immediately there is a bit of astringency. Then there is the strong taste of precipitation. Gwen sipped. It is also eye-catching. It can only be said that it is indeed Romani Conti, one of the best wines in the world. The three of them drank secretly here, and sobered up the wine that everyone wanted to drink later. But after a while, Gwen didn't return for a long time. In the kitchen, 
Wanda and Mrs. Stacy yelled as they prepared the dishes and brought them out. Gwen, this is mum. Gwen waved to her mother. Mrs. Stacy looked at it, and she just wanted to say a few words. It turned out that Su Yi was also drinking together. Think about it or forget it. It's time to eat. Don't drink so much. Come quickly, George. He was ready to be said a few words. It ended so softly. How is this different from before? George looked at Su Yi and nodded. No doubt. Definitely because of Su Yi. Next, George put the sober wine on the table for everyone to drink together. Mrs. Stacy was surprised when she saw it. To drink so much? A lot? George counted people. Five people drink together. Does Gwen drink too? She's an adult. Let her drink a little. So Gwen was allowed to double this time. Then everyone took their seats. Su Yi was arranged to sit next to George. Then George is surrounded by Mrs. Stacy and Gwen. Besides Su Yi is his temporary sister Wanda. This seat is also exquisite. Same as Eastern countries. Those who sit in the innermost are the masters of the house. And Su Yi was arranged in the same row. So George and Mrs. Stacy think that Su Yi is already the talker of Gwen's family. It can be said that a lot of respect has been given. Then Gwen poured wine for everyone. Wait until everyone has a cup. George raised his glass and said, celebrating our first family reunion that went perfectly. Su Yi also raised his cup. Cheers. Everyone raised their glasses. Cheers Tilda. After clinking glasses, everyone took a sip of the red wine in the glass. George sneaked a big mouthful. Su Yi saw that the red wine in his glass was finished in one gulp. Mm, Tilda. And Gwen's mother took a sip and said in surprise, smells so good Tilda. Right. Gwen smiled happily. Sue was given a lot of this kind of wine by the customer, and was even directly sent by the customer to deliver the goods. George. Hearing this, George's eyes lit up. He has a plan. And buddy, no build a good relationship with the son-in-law. Then everyone's in a well family gatherings or asking Gwen to bring home a bottle of cough cough cough. Su Yi was Phoenix Force. He definitely sensed what George was thinking. Su Yi smiled, looked at Gwen and said, I can't finish a bottle of that wine a day. Gwen, if you have nothing to do, you can bring a bottle home. Gwen nodded, okay, George. George's eyes lit up, but Mrs. Stacy asked again. But is it okay to drink like this? Is it too much? I mean I'm worried about Sue's body. George. The light in George's eyes went out. So Yi smiled and explained after hearing this. There is an old saying that small wine is good for you, but big wine is bad for you. And according to tests by authoritative medical institutions, people who consume an average of 501000 milliliters of alcohol per week will live a few years longer on average. It also reduces cardiovascular disease and makes you feel better. So I also have a drink or two in the evening when I'm free. Mrs. Stacy asked in surprise one day. Really? Definitely. Gwen's mother thought about it, and she believed in Su Yi's words. So he nodded directly. That's really nice. Thank you. Su, you're welcome, George. Here, here. The light in George's eyes lit up again. He looked sideways at Su Yi, then nodded with gratitude in his eyes. This is the look that all men understand. Su Yi raised his eyebrows, shrugged his shoulders and said, It's a small matter. And George was just about to ask Su Yi for help. How can he be less stressful as a sheriff? But when you're stressed, drinking a little wine can make you feel better. But the position of the sheriff also destined him not to drink during the day. You can drink it at night. But you can't suppress it. But Mama Gwen didn't like his drinking very much. So George could only secretly drink a little. But from now on, George knew he could have a drink in two or three days. Although it is only for a short time, it is also the light and hope of life. George was overjoyed. But Mama Gwen was talking and talking about Wanda. She looked at Wanda and asked suddenly, I feel like you're a superhero. George also looked at Wanda upon hearing this. Then he nodded strangely. It's kind of like that. These two sentences made Wanda nervous. She was afraid that the two of them would recognize each other and then they would pass on. Gwen was quite speechless sitting beside her mother. She really had a desire to speak directly. Mom, your daughter is a superhero, and so is the one on the opposite side. We belong to the League of Goddesses, you read that right. But in fact, the two were just curious, not to mention Wanda's origin magic power. Su Yi's presence shield makes the possibility of being recognized as a superhero directly zero. So Mama Gwen immediately said again, Su Chang is so good looking, and my younger sister is so beautiful as expected of a family. Then how pretty will Gwen's baby be? George nodded in agreement. Good looks make a family taller. Su Yi is so handsome, and his temperature control is so good looking. He could already imagine how good looking his future grandson or granddaughter would be. Mama Gwen thought so too. Wanda couldn't help laughing when she heard that. She looked at Su Yi and asked gently, Big Brother Tilda, when do you plan to have a baby with Gwen? Here Wanda say Big Brother. Su Yi's heart skipped a beat. Make sure she calls Big Brother all the time tonight. It's just that he hasn't answered yet. Wanda. Gwen glared at Wanda blushing. But she was quickly stopped by her own mother. Gwen, why are you staring at Wanda? Don't you want kids? No mother. Gwen covered her face and said, But I'm about to go to college, 
and the soonest I have a baby is to graduate from college. Mrs. Stacy thought about it, too. In order to ensure Gwen's studies, her graduates are the best. So Mother Gwen said decisively, then you must be pregnant when you graduate. Mother Gwen couldn't stand it. Everyone laughed out loud. That's all. Harmonious and friendly dinner was finished happily in this way, and it wasn't long before George finished eating. He was called away by the police station. Mother Gwen said helplessly after seeing it. He's like that. Sometimes he gets woken up in the middle of the night, depending on what's going on but sometimes he has to be there, otherwise the newspapers and reporters don't have his camera in front of them. All right, it seems that the position of New York Sheriff still needs to be conscientious, not as comfortable as Su Yi's private studio. Next, in order not to let Mama Gwen wash so many dishes, Wanda and Gwen mainly said that they were going to wash the dishes, and then they cleaned everything up with magic. Then Gwen said to take Su Yi and Wanda to visit the small bungalow where she grew up. The three of them wandered from the first floor to the third and fourth floors but there are very few practical rooms. To the end, only then did Gwen take the two of them to the room that she wanted Su Yi to see the most, namely, her room. Gwen opened the door nervously, clang clang clang, then he dubbed himself and stretched out his hand to signal to visit. Su Yi and Wanda walked in. I have to say that Gwen's own room is really not small, 50 square meters, right? Gwen, Wanda also said, your room is almost bigger than the house I lived in when I was a child. Gwen shook her head indifferently, but now your home is also my home and my home is definitely your home. Both of them were moved by this sentence. When Su Yi walked to the computer desk, he found that the computer was still on. So he reached for his browsing history in Google Chrome. There is a question that keeps Su Yi curious. That is, what's in the girl's browser history? And Gwen, who was being moved, also felt heart palpitations instantly. 154. Wonders Web Browsing History. Deadpool Gwen. The moment Su Yi opened Gwen's Google browser, when Su Yi clicked on the history browsing, Gwen, who was hugging Wanda, felt a little uneasy for a moment. What does it feel like? This is Gwen shocked. Gwen turned to look. So Yi just happened to open open the browsing history. At the same time, no tilde. Gwen widened her beautiful eyes. So Yi had expected it. He said softly. Wanda hug her. I'll wait for you to tell you. Wanda's eyes lit up, and she immediately hugged Gwen. Even used the confinement magic of Y Shandy's book. And put it directly on himself and Gwen. This way we can be imprisoned together. It's just that the casting time is too short. Wanda just cast the imprisonment spell. Pink tilde. As a result, Gwen, who is extremely resilient, broke through it all at once. Gwen came to see Yi in an instant. She pressed her whole body up and waved her hands at the same time. Don't look, don't look, don't look. Then turn off the display with great precision. Go down and turn off the host on the ground for the last time. Hatilda. After these last night, Gwen finally breathed a sigh of relief. But she doesn't know it's just the beginning of a nightmare. After seeing the computer turned off, so Yi stood up, walked to Gwen's bed, sat down and said, First, too long. Besides, Su Yi hasn't finished speaking yet. I saw Gwen rushing forward. Ah Tilda. Stop talking Tilda. She tried her best to cover Su Yi with a pillow to make him stop talking. Su Yi almost laughed so hard that his stomach hurts. 70% of Gwen's historical records searched were partner problems. The remaining 20% are emotional issues. The last 10% is a normal problem. But it's not normal to go anywhere. But these are also normal. Gwen's family was tricked. So Gwen is in a relationship for the first time. Almost everything is the first time. For many of Su Ai's Dong Siguan this is a first experience. And she takes it very seriously. So she searched intermittently for a long time. But she forgot to clear the browsing history. With Su Yi's vision. In fact, he knows everything with just a mouse click and a glance. Gwen oh Gwen. At the moment Gwen blushed as hell. Even the ears are bright red. The tip of the nose is cherry red, very cute. And Wanda also laughed and shrugged on the bed. After hearing this, she really thought Gwen was so cute. But it's also good news. But Gwen shook her head angrily looking at Wanda's appearance. She raised her hand, calendar day. Crack tilde. Ah, Wanda immediately covered Tana and rolled aside to hide. Gwen is crazy. Now see who kills whom. She looked at Wanda, who was still laughing even after covering her back, and said angrily, Wanda. I can't believe you haven't searched. Wanda stopped laughing for a moment. So why do you think she stopped smiling? Under Gwen's glare, Wanda whispered without lying. But I didn't search as much as you. Speaking of which, Wanda took out her phone. Then I don't know what I'm messing with. Gwen watched her move and thought for a moment. Then she stepped forward and took Wanda's cell phone and threw it to Su Yi and said, I hold her down, because you can quickly see what her record is. Su Yi, and this good thing? He caught the flying phone and turned his head to look. Gwen was already on top of Wanda. Then hold Wanda's hands and don't let her move. As expected, after losing the phone, I heard Gwen's words again. Wanda immediately said in a panic. No, Sue, really no Tilda, don't look. So Yi laughed out loud when he heard this sentence. Aren't you playing tricks on yourself? So Yi picked up the phone. Then click on Google Chrome. Finally, click on the browsing history. As expected, Wanda also searched. But the search is much less than Gwen. Let me see. Cough. So Yi cleared his throat. The most recent one is, how can biting keep a partner happy? The second is, 
Is tidal eruption a normal physiological phenomenon? The third one is, what should I do if my companion exibility is too powerful? So Yi hasn't finished speaking yet. Wanda had buried her head in the blanket and pretended to be dead. If you measure the temperature, then Wanda's current temperature is definitely not much lower than Gwen's. And Gwen is smiling very happily now. She deliberately leaned into Wanda's ear and said, Wanda, why are you so tidal? Wanda, you won't? I'll teach you. Wanda, you are so weak. Wanda covered her ears and didn't want to hear it. But Gwen's voice pierced through the palm of her hand like magic. And Gwen put her hands behind Wanda's ear bones and said, Ee hee, Wanda, I can control the vibration and bone conduction sound transmission. It's useless if you cover it. Uh, Hilda. Wanda can't help it. All she could do was to yell slightly and sustain Wanda's voice. This is indeed a solution. It's just to take a breath in the middle. Otherwise it will suffocate. But Su Yi had already turned off his phone. Then he threw it to Wanda's hand and said, Wanda, remember to delete your browsing history just like Gwen in the future. I know, I know. Woo woo woo. Wanda's expression was crying. And Gwen grinned when she found out that both of them were like this. That's why I'm ashamed. But it's okay to lose face with someone. So Gwen rode on Wanda bestering her happily like chanting, Parter. But at this moment, Gwen's door was opened. Gwen, I brought you water tables. Mama Gwen opened the door. Just saw his daughter straddling Sue's younger sister, and Sue Yi watched as if watching a play. Ah this, Sue Yi Gwen, and, or, Wanda? Sue Yi Gwen Wanda? Sue Yi Gwen Wanda? For a while, Gwen's mother's CPU is a little burnt, and I can't get around it. She smiled awkwardly and politely, then put the fruit plate on the table. Finally, he slammed the door shut and went out. Mother. Gwen was taken aback. She jumped up and tried to catch up. It's not that you want to. But when it came to the general Gwen found out. Like. Is that what her mother thought? And is it that bad? For it. Then what's the explanation? Without Gwen's oppression. Wanda clapped and laughed. It's over. Gwen's in mama's eyes. HMPH tilde. Gwen inserted her waist after hearing this. Then what if I'm a bad girl? Wanda reminds. Bad 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 girl. Yes I sighs. Gwen nodded quickly. It's the kind of bad girl who bullies you and bullies you. Wanda. So you looked at Gwen's appearance. It has the same effect as that. Right, right, right. So you went to fetch the fruit plate that Gwen's mother had cut. Then watch the two women tear each other up. As long as it is not a matter of principle. Then Su Yi likes watching women fight the most. But after they saw Su Yi eating fruit, I decided to give up and come over to eat together. What a pity. Su Yi ate a piece of dragon fruit. Then he looked at Gwen's bedroom and said, I have to say, the layout of Gwen's bedroom is really thoughtful. Did you arrange it yourself? Definitely. Gwen happily ate the banana. Then he picked up a piece of apple and fed it to Su Yi. Su Yi opened his mouth and ate it. He looked at this arrangement and guessed. Then you were quite homey when you were in school. Do you like to stay in the bedroom playing computer and reading? Gwen was taken aback when he heard it. How do you know? Su Yi smiled. It can be seen from your arrangement. Su Yi knew the reason. One is that he originally knew that Spider Gwen is the more nerdy of all Spider-Mans. And the only one who can be more nerd than Gwen and who can be counted as a nerd girl, is Deadpool Gwen. Two is Su Yi's layout is very clear. This arrangement determines Gwen's inner character. It belongs to the kind that looks lively, cheerful, and active, but has a private world inside. So, Su Yi looked directly under the bed. I'll see if there's a collection of comic books. He looked down. Sure enough, what's not a comic book in the box under the bed? Ah. How did you find out again? And Gwen immediately covered his face when he saw it and said that he didn't want to see anyone. I just cleaned it up yesterday. What do you say? Su Yi pulled out the box under the bed. Then he picked up a few comic books and handed one to a few with a smile. If you don't look at who I am, Gwen, I don't know too much about you and the patient. Following Su Yi, he opened the small cardboard box. Dot. It contains all kinds of famous cartoons from the United States in the 20th and 21st centuries. As you can see, there are really many things to look at in terms of temperature control. So you looked at the categories. They are all that normal cartoons, which shows that there is no problem with aesthetics. So you laughed. The well-read Gwen. Wanda picked out a manga at random to read and nodded in agreement. And Gwen pricked up her ears. She came over and lay on Su Yi's back and asked, Don't you think I'm childish? This sentence made Su Yi laugh. Childish? Why is it naive to read comics? Gwen thought about it. When I first read comics, my classmates said I was naive, that I was a little girl who didn't grow up. Gwen. Su Yi closed the manga. Then he said seriously to Gwen, Childishness is not an exclusive name, but expresses a meaning. It's not childish to read comics, it's just ignorance and arrogance. Playing games is not naive. It is deliberately destroying the game environment of others. It's not childish to like toys, it's only addictive, and normal people mean they have imagination. So childishness does not refer to a certain thing, but to a certain behavior. So ye said these words seriously, because some things you feel childish. Don't do it, dot 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 asking for flowers. But some things just have a chance because of childishness. Wanda had been listening carefully. So ye was also telling the two girls to form your own subjective consciousness. It's not what society says it is. Others are in 997 roles. Is this the right role? Give me a break. Sooner or later, 
the dike will burst. Gwen also nodded seriously after listening. I understand, Takumi. That's good. So Yi didn't ask what you knew. It's useless to ask. To really understand is to understand. It's useless to ask if you don't understand. But, at this moment, so you looked at the two girls and smiled. Then he flipped it with one hand. Immediately, a bunch of comic books that this world has not yet appeared appeared. For example, Tom and Jerry, SpongeBob SquarePants, Detective Conan, Secret Teaching, etc., etc. Ahem. So Yi wanted to take back the secret teaching, but sharp-eyed Gwen and Wanda reached out and took it away. At the same time, she knew something was wrong when she saw the cover. Then open it and take a look. Wow Tilda. Gwen's eyes lit up. Wanda also urged immediately. Flip, flip. Gwen. Gwen just wanted to turn a few more pages. Crack. In the end, Su Yi took it back and said. You don't even learn well, how can you watch these things? Looking at the comic book that was taken back. Gwen had always liked comics. So she pouted. Well. But Gwen suddenly thought and said. You show me, I will learn the plot and action in the comics, because. Su Yi. Su Yi was taken aback. He thought about it. Then he waved his hand. Here, these are all. Go and see. A comic given by Su Yi. All are cartoons with no green, no cow. Pure love, and happiness. Gwen and Wanda's eyes lit up. Gwen immediately began to put away. And Wanda is still in hesitation. Do you want to see it? Reading it means that I want to learn the above content to serve Su Yi. But if you don't read it. Wanda looked at Gwen, who was smiling and having a lot of fun. She recalled what Gwen said in her ear just now. You are so weak Tilda. Do you want me to teach you Tilda? When he thought of this, he gritted his teeth. What else? Look, definitely not now either. It's still at home now. So the two prepared to put away the comics first. And Su Yi looked at it and said. There are still so many empty rooms at home. Why don't we build a comic collection room? How about moving all the comics from Gwen here, and then buying some noodles from the market with my comics? Of course. Su Yi's proposal made Gwen's eyes shine. Wonder felt flashed on one side. Su Yi knew it at a glance. Then act now. What else? How about building the comic room tonight? Go. Go, go. Gwen rolled out of bed. Then he brought out several boxes of comics that he had hidden in one breath and said, Wanda, you open a portal home. We move there. I'll go down and tell my mother. I'll be right back. After Gwen finished speaking, she hurried out. So Yi and Wanda looked at each other and smiled. That's fine. Wanda opened the portal. Then swipe with one hand. Boxes and boxes of comics just flew by. After a while, Gwen came back right away and said, I'm done. Let's go. Build a manga collection. So the three went home and began to build a comic collection room. At the same time, after Su Yi took out the manga in the universe, at the moment's fourth wall, which is the only real universe. Deadpool Gwen finished picking balls on the bed in a pink Deadpool suit. Are there any new comics? Are there any new comics? If there are no new comics, Gwen will be bored to death. With so many cartoonists in the multi-universe, can't they draw some new and good-looking cartoons? Deadpool Gwen, even though her hair is pink, is howling and rolling at home. But at the moment, she suddenly discovered that one of the multi-universe manga comics had more than a dozen comics at once. There's a manga. Is it new? Deadpool Gwen immediately cheered up and checked the comic books of this universe. Sometimes a new comic isn't just a new comic. It may be an extended version of comics similar to if and parallel universe. And this kind of comic Deadpool Gwen has read countless copies. She is already tired. But this time is different. Etc. Deadpool Gwen flipped through the new comics of Secret Teaching and suddenly blushed in surprise. It's a new comic. It's brand new. There are more than a dozen copies at once. Who invented it? Which universe is this? Deadpool Gwen hastily stopped looking at the comics. Then see which universe this is. Wow Tilda. A new character. Who is Su Yi? Why isn't the one in other universes? Wow. He's amazing. So interesting. 5. 155 practice yoga. Tony goes to Kamataj. The universe in the multi-universe is theoretically infinite, because the multi-universe will expand infinitely. There will be more and more universes and parallel universes inside. Even if you want to see the number, 199,999 universe has it. So in theory, it is impossible for you to know what happened in each universe by yourself, even if you look at it from God's perspective. If this theory does not hold true, then there is no one who can break the fourth wall. After all, the real universe is contained in the multi-universe, but only one universe is. It is different from all universes, and there is no timeline. All other universes are essentially the same. The only difference is that people are different, such as if the world view, such as the crocodile Loki, such as the child, the old man, and the woman Loki. These people are constant, but identity is the same. You see they are all Loki. So Deadpool Gwen was surprised when he found Su Yi. Why haven't I seen him in other universes? Deadpool Gwen flipping through previous timelines. She wanted to read more about the history of this new character. After all, they are people who haven't seen much. It's like you flip through a comic and you see someone you're interested in. Why don't you go back to the beginning of the story and read it again? It's the same way when I read comics. So Deadpool Gwen turned forward the historical line about Su Yi. Scroll until Avengers. 
age of Ultron Ultron appears. What follows is normal drama. So Yi and Banner got to know each other. So Yi and Steven got to know each other. So Yi and Gwen got to know each other. So Yi, um, Deadpool Gwen was taken aback when he saw Gwen. Why does she look so like me? Deadpool Gwen got out of bed and took a mirror to look at himself. It turned out that the Gwen Su Yi met was at least 80% similar to himself, and the entire multi-universe has a lot of people named Gwen. 090 But there is really no such thing as long manga Gwen. Only Spider Gwen and Deadpool Gwen. So Deadpool Gwen was taken aback when he saw Spider Gwen. She thought Gwen in the whole multi-universe looked like this. But now I didn't expect to see a very similar one. Interesting. Deadpool Gwen immediately resumes watching the timeline. Soon Su Yi's Gwen turned into Spider Gwen. Then Spider Gwen found Su Yi. Then began to contact, get to know, and fall in love. Oh 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 tilde. Deadpool Gwen looked excited when he saw this holding his face, kicking his two little feet back and forth on the quilt. After all, the two look so much alike. It also makes the current Deadpool Gwen full of sense of substitution. It's as if this Spider Gwen is himself. But then, Wanda also made an appearance. She also met, contacted and fell in love with Su Yi. Artilda, why is this person competing with Gwen? Then who wins? Deadpool Gwen hurriedly continued to watch. Results to the back. Both of them have become Su Yi's. And both Wanda and Gwen are good to Su Yi. Su Yi also treated them well. Okay, scumbag, I admit you're attractive, but you're such a scumbag. Why don't you just love Gwen? Deadpool Gwen looked annoyed. She's totally into Spider Gwen. So from the third perspective, Deadpool Gwen hopes that Spider Gwen, or himself, can completely occupy Su Yi. In this way, the only one who can love all day long is Gwen. It's just that Deadpool Gwen doesn't know. If she told this idea to the current Spider Gwen, that Spider Gwen would definitely roll her eyes and tell her, you want me to be beaten to death? At that time, let alone the lower body and mouth, those behind can't escape the ending of being a grand slam. But Deadpool Gwen is just talking about it. She continued to look at the timeline. Until now. It's gone. Is it gone? It is a pity that Deadpool Gwen is gone after reading the historical timeline. Because she can't see the future. She can only look at the previous records. So seeing now, it means that she was followed up on the latest chapter, and the future content can only be read after Su Yi continues to live. Tilda. Deadpool Gwen felt uncomfortable immediately. I really want to see it Tilda. But she can't help it. So Deadpool Gwen got up and could only read a few brand new comics that Su Yi had brought out first. It's not like she stole it. Instead, she went directly to see the existence of these comics. Where there is appearance, there is existence. It's just normal. The other side, after the three returned home, Su Yi chose one of them, which was not too big or too small, as a comic collection room. Gwen thought so too. The best places to read comics are under the quilt and sofa followed by other places. So Su Yi waved his hand. Exquisite log bookshelves are scattered throughout the room. Several lazy sofas are placed by the floor-to-ceiling windows. Each one is enough for two or three people to lie down in. Wanda looked at it and then reached out to perform some magic. Scarlet magical energy floated across the bookshelves. As a result, green plants like flowers and vines grew on the bookshelves. And there are vines crawling all over the walls. Wow Tilda. Gwen stared at the stars. Doesn't the interior look great too? Now it is the manga collection room. The innermost wall is a floor-to-ceiling window. It has a great view of Manhattan and New York. If you are tired of watching in front of the floor-to-ceiling windows, you can also look into the distance to see the distant scenery. It's good for the eyes. And one of the remaining three walls is the population. The remaining two sides are bookshelves full of natural flavor. Such a manga collection. Do you like it or not? Not to mention Gwen Wonder who was there. Even Deadpool Gwen saw it on the fourth wall and loved it. Next, Gwen began to put her own collection of comics into the bookshelf. And it's not random. You have to put the same books and arrange them neatly according to 1.2.3. So Su Yi and Wonder also helped put it together. After a while, wait until the last comic is in the shelf. Gwen clapped her hands and took a few steps back to the door to have a look. This scene. It's so beautiful Tilda. Su Yi also agreed. The home now has another room to rave about. This is the favorite of nerds and nerds. Everyone nodded in satisfaction. Then I started to take the comics to the bin bag sofa. Looked up in front of the floor to ceiling windows. But maybe only Gwen is actually reading the comics seriously. Wanda watched it for a while. She squeezed to Su Yi's side to stick with Su Yi. The two squeezed into a bean bag. Su Yi looked at it. I just looked at Wanda's beautiful side face. And at the same time looked at the night scene outside the floor to ceiling windows behind the side face. Have to say, the night view of New York is really beautiful. There may be no street lights in the alleys, but the street lights on the main road are definitely on. Coupled with the internal light of the high rise buildings, it does look bustling at night. It's a bit tiresome, but the beauty is pregnant. How can there be bad oil? Su Yi's hand immediately started to wander. Wanda paused, but still did not speak. As long as Su Yi is not too much, this is at home. Wanda agrees. But is Su Yi an honest person? Wanda shuddered suddenly. Then he pressed Su Yi's hand turned his head and stared at Su Yi. But Su Yi still thinks this stare is pretty. Beautiful eyes stare at you a few times. It seems even more beautiful. Gwen noticed something strange. She looked up twice, 
only to stare at Wanda. Gwen thinks so. That's what Wanda did on purpose, knowing that Su Yi is dishonest. She also intentionally squeezed them together. That wasn't intentional what was that? And Wanda saw herself being stared at. So she turned around and patted Su Yi again. Su Yi said that it doesn't matter, it doesn't hurt, but dare. But at this moment, the twin dancers walked to the door and said relaxedly, Miss Wanda, Miss Gwen, it's time for yoga. Do you need to train tonight? Yes. X2. Gwen and Wanda agree at the same time. Then he stood up and followed the twin dancers. Then Su Yi will definitely not stop him. And he will secretly appreciate it. Why not just look at it? Because it would be embarrassing to look at Wanda directly. So I couldn't make those big unfolding movements. So Su Yi chose to go to the small universe to watch the projection. Under the projection. The twin dancers have to lead the two girls to warm up first. After the muscles of the whole body are active. Then start doing exercises to stretch the ligaments. After the ligament can accept a little. Then do big moves to exercise physical strength and endurance. Finally, do a little more extreme movement to break through the limit. In the beginning, Wanda's two slender and plump eyes could only open 110-120 degrees which was when she was not exercising. After a period of training, Su Yi personally experienced that it was about 130-140 degrees. That's pretty good. Whoever comes up can directly 180 like Gwen, because Gwen's physique is different. Then Su Yi looked at it first. The current Wanda is estimated to be able to drive 150. Just exercise for a while longer. A 180 degree horse is not far away. Oh Tilda. Su Yi smiled happily. Just because the twin dancers can take the two girls to learn yoga well. Su Yi felt that she was worth two. Earned blood. And the scene of at the moment. After exercising for a while. Parter. As soon as the stopwatch time in the dancer's hand is up. Heart Tilda. Wanda immediately let go of her strength and lay down on the yoga mat. It is impossible not to be tired. She now has a thin layer of sweat on Yu Ayu's skin. The long hair around the ear is stuck under the ear. But that doesn't make Wanda any less ugly. On the contrary. There is a unique sports charm. Boom boom. And Gwen on the side jumped on the yoga mat, then looked at Wanda and laughed. You can't drive 180 yet, Wanda. No wonder Su Yi doesn't want to take you to play difficult ones. Wanda rolled her eyes at Gwen after hearing this. Don't. Gwen was stunned, but in the end it wasn't that his legs shook into a sieve. Gwen has one jaw. It's not the same for you. After speaking, the two are about to take a shower. There was a layer of sweat on his body. The two of them will definitely not be able to bear this if they don't wash it clean. But Su Yi can't bear it now. Watch the entire yoga feast. He was so bullish. Without saying a word, Su Yi sneaked past. He waited outside the door until the inside was flushed. Wow Tilda. He opened the door and said bluntly. Everyone here today was either killed by me, or you killed me. The next day, before Su Yi got up, Tony has said goodbye to Pepper at home for a while. I'm going to study magic. I may be away for a month, and I may be back soon. But I promise I won't be away for too long, Pepper. Trust me now. Pepper and Tony hugged each other. Pepper from at the moment also learned about Tony. She knows whether it is for the future or for the present. It would be good for Tony to learn more. It's not to pick up girls or drink to learn to be bad. So Pepper nodded and said. Go early and come back early, Tony. Don't worry, I can take care of myself. Tony wanted to say something more. But he found that no matter what he said now, it's better to keep your promise or come back sooner. So he patted Pepper on the back, then turned and left. And now it's only 6 o'clock a.m. So Yi still slept with his left arm around Wanda and his right around Gwen. After a while, Tony, who was wearing a nano battle suit, took a rapid flight and flew directly from the subspace orbit to the vicinity of the Himalayas. Flight speeds of several mechs in a Tony steel battle suit, thousands of kilometers and nothing more than minutes to him. Inside the armor, Friday, sir. Kamartage has arrived. Tony looked at Friday's position. So he was the same as Stephen when he first came. They all stop at the outskirts of Kamartage first. Then Tony put away the battle suit into the special clothes and pants, and then put on a pair of flat frame glasses before finally walking into the village under Kamartage. One came here. Tony's glasses began to analyze the surrounding environment in various ways, simultaneously scan everyone's differences. Fortunately, he was dressed very ordinary today. He looked like he came from a big city at most. Not the kind of industry elite in suits and leather shoes. So not many people care about him. And Tony just kept looking at his surroundings with his hands in his pockets. Plus the help of satellites in space. A 3D image of the town appeared in Tony's eye socket. Tony looked at the 3D image. He frowned. I felt something was wrong here. That's not right. Tony thought for a while. The town I see is much smaller than it actually is. That is, the real town was bigger than what he saw now. Even much bigger. Where is that hidden place? Why can't I see it again? Tony put his hands in his pockets and looked around. 2.7 But he found that it was useless for him to find someone. Because the people here seem to be ordinary people. And, Tony was thinking too. Even if a magician stands in front of him. Can his glasses see that there is mana in the opponent's body? It doesn't seem to work. What to do then? Tony thought for a while, and suddenly came up with a solution. Friday? Help me mark the different footprints on the ground with different colors, don't let it go. Friday, okay, 
Sir, after a while, various footprints appeared in Tony's glasses, but it's just too much. So Tony continued, cancel the normal footprints of returning home and going out. Next moment, the footprints of normal travel are gone, and this look, only a few footprints appeared among the city lords. Tony laughed now, found you. He began to follow these footprints, but he found that the footprints all went in different directions. Is there more than one gate? Tony looked at where each footprint ended, actually scattered all over the town, everywhere. But their ultimate destination is, a wall? Tony was curious. He followed a series of footprints to one of the walls, at the moment. There are no people around here. Tony looked at the wall, didn't find anything unusual either, because it is an ordinary and normal Kingshi wall. But the next moment, the Kingshi wall opened slowly with Tony's expression on it. Then there was a figure wearing a robe and a cloak on the opposite side, whose appearance was only inferior to Su Yi's. Tony Stark, yes, come in, I've been waiting for you for half an hour, question mark. With doubts, Tony walked in, the Kingshi wall then slowly closed. Dot. 156. Tony Magician, Hala takes Tun Mai to steal food, with the King Shi wall slowly closing. Tony pushed back his glasses and looked carefully. Wait until the stone walls are completely closed together. Tony noticed that there were no traces on it. It's as if nothing happened just now. Stephen stood aside with his hands behind his back. He just looked at Tony silently. Wait until Tony sees it. And when turned around, Stephen asked, Ready? Ah. Uh look good. Then let's go. Stephen said nothing. Just turn around and leave. Tony followed quickly. Walk the grounds inside Kamataj. Tony was watching from side to side just like Stephen did when he first came here. It's close to seven o'clock now. Many magician apprentices have already gotten up and started to prepare for cultivation. They went to the equipment room to pick up the ring, or something like a stick, then practice collectively on the martial arts arena. Tony asked curiously after seeing it, isn't magician practice meditation? Stephen walked without answering without turning his head. How did you know that? Well dot 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 in fantasy novels, Tony is not shy at all and has a thick skin. It seems childish to ask. It also feels childish. But this is not important. What matters is that Tony is learning about the new worldview. But this is what Sui meant. But what is specific is childish. However, Stephen didn't answer him directly, but said lightly, When I first came here, I also liked to ask about this and that, but later I found that it was useless. Here I rely on ability and hard work to speak. Only those who respect each other, have fair ability, and practice diligently are eligible to be respected by others. Tony nodded definitely. He also knows this. But those seemingly childish questions were asked on purpose. I just want to learn more about things I don't know. Then since Stephen said so, it means that all these will be known in the future. Then there's no need for Tony to keep asking. That's all. Stephen took Tony to the Kamataj Hall. Wang just got up and came here. He saw Stephen bringing outsiders over. So I salute first, and then do my own thing. 19. In the original plot, the people from the Avengers Alliance and Stephen knew each other. But under the influence of Su Yi. Stephen didn't know anyone from the Avengers Alliance. Not involved in anything with the Avengers Alliance either. That is, besides the humor, Stephen is now more inclined to the style of Ancient One. So Tony asked when he saw that the people around him respected Stephen. Looks like they have a lot of respect for you. Stephen walked into the hall and turned around. Didn't Sue tell you what Sorcerer Supreme Stephen looks like? Tony froze for a moment, then react. It turned out that the person in front of me was Sorcerer Supreme. That is, the friend Su Yi mentioned. Oh. Tony rubbed his chin looked at Stephen and said, I just didn't expect Sorcerer Supreme to be so young, I thought it was an old magician older than me, Stephen shook his head, in any field, old is never the best, it's best to be old and have ability at the same time, so, the most important thing is ability, Tony wouldn't be Iron Man if he didn't have the ability, Stephen is not Sorcerer Supreme without ability, definitely, unless the two of them rely on mutation, that depends on luck, maybe it's a monster that mutated, and it's not human anymore, so far, regular chat ends, Tony looked around, then said to Stephen, Yesterday I told Sue that I wanted to learn magic, Sue told me to come here, find a man named Stephen, and then report his name, I think that person is you. Hear this sentence, Stephen couldn't help but pursed his lips and smiled, then he nodded helplessly, I knew you were coming for me, but for Sue's sake, I will teach you spells, but no one will teach you, you have to learn by yourself, self-study is fine, as long as there are textbooks, Tony can teach himself, but the problem is, he is very curious, you know I'm coming for you? Tony thought at first that Stephen was waiting for him because Stephen knew he was there, but I didn't expect that Stephen knew that he would be here. And this is two yards. The former is hindsight, the latter is prophetic. That is foreknowledge. So what's going on? It's very simple. Stephen wore the time gem on his body, and he felt that someone was looking for him in the dark. So he saw it in advance and knew it. Definitely. If Su Yi came looking for him, Stephen definitely doesn't know. So Stephen also realized later that it was Su who told him about Tony's arrival. That's the ability difference. That's the wonder of magic. Stephen avoided the Tropic of Infinite Gems and said, I know you, Tony. Stark, superhero, steel, just reclusive now. For Su's sake, 
As long as you cultivate your mana in Kumar Tarjian can enter and exit the gate on your own, you can leave at any time. But once you use Kumar Taj's magic book to practice mana, then you are Kumar Taj's magician, your interests and Kumar Taj's interests will be bound together, I hope you know it well. So do you still feel like practicing magic now? Stephen's words are simple. When you get on my boat, everyone is a part of it. Good things happen to everyone. Everyone has bad things too. For Sue's sake, Tony can have benefits that those apprentices can't enjoy. For example, look through the library in advance. There is also early access to Kumar Taj, provided that Tony will also be Kumar Taj's magician. If Tony contributes a lot in the future, he can also be promoted to a big magician, even second only to Sorcerer Supreme. But no matter what, he was on the thief ship, not. He joined the magician holy place. Stephen also made it clear to Tony. At the beginning, Stephen had no choice. But Tony also has a better life in reality. So Tony can choose. Now let's see what Tony thinks. But what Stephen didn't expect was a little bit. Tony just asked one question. If Sue needs help, will you help him decisively? Of course. Whether it is the identity of the godfather of Sorcerer Supreme, or the relationship between the two before. Stephen nodded affirmatively. Definitely. Then I will join. Stephen was taken aback for a moment then suddenly smiled again. He understood this was another person who was overwhelmed by Sue's charm. Otherwise, who would use this kind of question to decide whether to join or not? Stephen understood just now. Tony certainly wasn't sure about the future of the magician holy place right now, and how the magician holy place helps and hurts him. So he asked the head of the magician directly. That is, the relationship between Stephen and Sue Yi. As long as these two are stable, then Tony thinks this magician has a future. That is to compare magician to a stock. The share of this stock is magician. The representative of this stock is Stephen. So how does Tony blindly see the future potential and market value of this stock? He found out that the representative of this stock had a close relationship with Su Yi. That is, from inside information. Warren Buffett is bullish on this stock. Then Tony is willing to buy it. Stud. I think I should join. Tony held out his hand to Stephen. But Stephen said with a smile, that should have started with my luggage, not my paddle. Tony, if it is broken, come up and take the initiative to downgrade. After he becomes a magician, he has to pack Sorcerer Supreme. Cough cough. Tony had no choice but to cough lightly. Then he looked around to see if anyone was around. After seeing no one, he quickly saluted slightly and recovered. Okay, watching Tony recover. Stephen smiled even more happily. He took one with one hand. A spell creates a mirror. And in the mirror, Tony's salute just now was playing repeatedly. At the same time Stephen showed a happy smile. Okay, you can go to the King Magician just now. He will take you into the Magician's introductory study. Tony and percent m hash s a tell exclamation mark two star. This is the heartbeat of at the moment Tony. Now he knows. Stephen's deepness is pretending, in front of friends. He is a humorous plus prankster. Stephen as long as Tony's status in the future is not shallow, so get the handle in advance. And Tony said that he met people in a bad manner. Sorcerer Supreme actually pissed herself off. Tony pointed at Stephen speechlessly. Stephen put his hands behind his back and lifted his chin. Tony turned to look for Wang. But before disappearing at the entrance of the main hall, Tony turned and pointed at Stephen again. Stephen still put his hands behind his back and raised his chin, until Tony leaves. Stephen nodded in satisfaction. In fact, Stephen probably understands. There must not be many good friends of Su Yi, maybe even counting himself and Tony in front of him. There are not many. But Stephen was clear, can become Su Yi's good friend. That's quality certification. Definitely worth living with. This is one of the reasons why Stephen also blindly believes that Tony will have a good future. And actually, that's true. If Su Yi is willing to make friends, then there must be no problem in his life. Both Stephen and Tony are. Banner also counts. Count the words of the girlfriend. Nagwin and Wanda even more so. And Hala is not actually a girlfriend, to put it bluntly. Hala is more like a mistress who is known by the two main palaces. Well. That's exactly what it means. As for the future, Su Yi didn't want these futures. He has only goals, living in the moment. Like the first time he saw Gwen, he knew he wanted to make this bitch roll her eyes. Ahem, wonder too, that's all. Time came to 7.50 a.m. Su Yi first woke up in the warmth. He opened his eyes and looked. Hala is showing her swallow how she swallows. Su Yi, are this? Su Yi gasped in his heart. But Gwen and Wanda were hugging themselves. So Su Yi took a deep breath, shoes open. Mada as long as the elder brother and the second younger brother are happy early in the morning. What are you doing with so much? He doesn't care about motives and purposes. He only cares about the process and the result. So one tube per person, after many swallows. So Yi took another nap. I didn't wake up until 9.30 in the morning. After he wakes up at this point, Wanda and Gwen were almost asleep too. So Yi just stretched his waist. Gwen woke up almost at the same time. Oh Tilda. Gwen opened her eyes and saw Su Yi right in front of her. She happily got close to Su Yi, then used the face and Su Yi stickers. Okay okay. After posting for a while, Su Yi pushed away Gwen's face that was arched like a caterpillar. Woo. As a result, 
Wanda woke up. She opened her unfocused eyes and looked at Su Yi. Then he hugged him even tighter. Continue to close your eyes and squint. Usually Monday to Friday, Wanda was tossed by Su Yi until she couldn't wake up in the morning. So Su Yi usually got up at 8.30 in the morning and left. And Wanda has to sleep until 10 in the morning to get a good rest. This is also impossible, because Wanda will be trussed until 1-2 in the morning before going to bed. So from Monday to Friday, Wanda couldn't feel Su Yi when she woke up. Only waking up on Saturday and Sunday is possible. Ah uh, yes. It's still possible, sometimes Su Yi's exuberant energy cannot be vented, that will wake up early, and for the size Wanda, then he can only get up early, so waking up like this is a bit hard one for Wanda, everyone rested for another 10 minutes, Su Yi sat up and took the quilt with him, let the two girls reveal a large white greasy, but he just got out of bed, it's almost 10 o'clock, get up or 120 will pass without doing anything today. Gwen touched the phone and took a look. It's really 10 o'clock. So she immediately got out of bed and put on clothes. And Su Yi from at the moment has already left. Greedy? Greed for what? There is plenty of time to be greedy at night. If he is greedy, just now Gwen wakes up and can start greedy. Why now? And Wanda also got up and slowly dressed in an orderly manner. If only Su Yi was here. In the link of dressing, including undressing. That Su Yi is more inclined to wonder. Take your time. Put them on one by one in an orderly manner. Neither fast nor slow. It still looks a little classy. And Gwen's words. Kind of like when you wake up late in the morning. Definitely got to be almost late. After all, if she was already late, Gwen might be in a bad position. It's late anyway. If you are in a hurry, you are still late. After Su Yi finished washing in the bathroom. When I came out, I saw Tan Mai and Hala sitting on the carpet playing games. I saw Su Yi come out. Hala was too busy. So she blinked her eyes and said good morning. And Tan Mai at the moment, who followed Hala and swallowed a tube, was extremely happy. Even if she is operating, he also freed one hand to greet Su Yi. Su Yi pointed at Gwen, then go to the kitchen and ask Nora to make lunch. And Tan Mai saw Su Yi pointing at Hala. Tan Mai asked worriedly in a low voice, You take me to eat snacks like this, Su won't be angry? We'll be angry. Hala nodded, huh? Tan Mai was stunned. But we didn't trigger the problem of principle. Hala winked at Tan Mai at this time and said, The last time Su was angry. I just had a bloated stomach for two days. Here here. Tan Mai blinked her beautiful purple eyes, with her cognition. She didn't know if it was a good thing or a bad thing. After all, it was a good thing for her. Isn't this filling? And Hala patted the front of her body and said, Don't worry, Nata. Since you said that you are my best friend, we have the same blessings and share the same hardships. And you are still my best teammate. I definitely helped you with this little thing. Nata heard it. Almost moved to tears. What a wonderful friend. Give me all the delicious snacks. Yeah. Ganata also patted the front of her body. In the future, if I have good things, I will share them with you, and you will share the blessings and share the hardships. No problem. Hala continued to play the game, and after Su Yi finished ordering, Gwen and Wanda also got dressed and came out. And at this moment, just as Wanda came out, her mobile phone was rang. You must know that there are not many people's numbers in Wanda's mobile phone. So the chances of it being successful are extremely small. Wanda took it out to have a look. It's Natasha Romanoff. So she connected the phone and turned on the speakerphone, and a slightly anxious voice came from the other side. Wanda, does your magic work in the quantum realm? 157. The quantum realm is out of control. Wanda explodes origin magic power. Quantum realm? Does magic work? Wanda thought about it. She didn't seem to know what the quantum realm was. So Wanda looked up at Su Yi and asked temporarily, Su, what is the quantum realm? Natasha Romanoff on the opposite side almost couldn't breathe when she heard this sentence. But when she heard that Su Yi was opposite, she immediately breathed a sigh of relief. Gwen raised her hand and said, I know what quantum is. It is a physical quantity that if there is the smallest indivisible basic unit, then this physical quantity is quantized, and the smallest unit is called the nose. It means the indivisible smallest and smallest unit of the microscopic physical world, but I don't know about the quantum realm either. Gwen was right, but the problem is, Su Yi said, we're going to take out the dishes and put them on the table. From the perspective of modern physical science, Gwen is right, but, at the moment Wanda, Gwen, and Natasha Romanoff on the phone are all listening. Su Yi continued, but the existence of the field of force is the absence of physics, or even science. Don't use the science you say you know to understand the quantum realm. It's useless, because the saying goes, the end of science is theology. Have you never heard of indecision, quantum mechanics? That is, no matter what the problem is, it seems that quantum mechanics can solve it for you. This also reflects the uncertainty and magic of quantum mechanics, not to mention the quantum realm. And Natasha Romanoff on the mobile phone was a little nervous when she heard it. So how do you end the activity in the quantum realm? Can Wanda's magic stop the quantum realm? Wanda shrugged when she heard this. How does she know? Natasha Romanoff, I haven't tried it and I don't know what the quantum realm is. Su Yi also smiled and said after hearing this, Why don't you ask Mr. Tony Stark, a young genius? A middle-aged genius? Here here. Natasha Romanoff sighed there. Tony left us a home number, and when I called, Miss Pepper answered. But Pepper said that Tony has gone out, 
and it will take a few days at the fastest, or even a few months at the slowest. Where did he go? Alien? Oh Tilda, hearing this, so you remembered. Tony didn't go to aliens. He went to learn magic and became a supreme being. In other words, this is still my own influence. After all, in the original book, Tony doesn't learn magic, but Su Yi wanted to see Tony playing magic, and he couldn't live longer playing magic. So he recommended Tony to go. At the same time Tony went with a heartfelt heart. But Wanda asked Natasha Romanoff strangely. Then what's going on Natasha Romanoff, why are you in such a hurry about the quantum realm? So he is also strange about this. Isn't the quantum realm part of the Avengers Alliance 4? Or the Ant-Man 2 thing? Why hasn't Avengers Alliance 3 arrived yet? The quantum realm ran out first. Not a timeline anomaly. Or maybe the multi-universe is starting to have an impact. And Natasha Romanoff also said anxiously. Because there is a van parked in our base. The first generation and man Hank Pym told us that this van is the quantum realm, and now the quantum realm is out of control and chaotic, his daughter has been involved, and now his life and death are unknown, asking us for help. The most important thing is that this quantum realm is slowly expanding, and Hank Pym said that if it is not stopped, it will expand infinitely. Um, here here. So Yi frowned. Is it really the plot of Ant-Man 2? Then why changed? And it's still ahead of time? Who influenced it? So Yi released Phoenix Force Perception for a while and the result, it still has something to do with me, but the main reason is not myself, it's like the butterfly effect in which a butterfly in the Amazon rainforest flaps its wings occasionally to cause a storm, it has something to do with myself, but not their primary relationship, more the reason why the original timeline of this universe started to mess up, for example, Tony lived in seclusion in advance to learn magic, for example, the book of darkness in Xijing town was taken away ahead of time, for example, the female Hulk also came out ahead of schedule. Chaotic chaos. This led to more confusion in the interaction of plots. The previous timeline can still be closed, but it can be seen now. Convergence ability has become weaker and weaker. And after Wanda heard this sentence, she looked at Suyi and asked, Let's go see apostrophe vertical bar. After all, it sounds like a big impact. And they didn't have much to do today, so why not go and have a look? Suyi looked at Gwen. Gwen nodded and asked curiously, Go and see. Let me see what the quantum realm is. Good idea. Su Yi only knew about the quantum realm, but he hasn't seen it either. That's fine. Su Yi nodded and said, Wait until we finish our breakfast. Ha, huh, ha. Huh? Natasha Romanoff agreed before responding, You guys just woke up? That's not it. Su Yi took a bite first. We don't have to work overtime every day. The agent is online 24 hours without a break. Do you understand? Woo 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 Tilda. Hang up with the phone. Both Wanda and Gwen sat down to eat. The sky and the earth are big and the food is the biggest. After a while, wait until the three of them finish their meal. After sending the dishes into the kitchen for Nora to Washington, Su Yikai clapped his hands and said, Okay, let's go. Wanda will open the door. Wanda nodded. She reached out and slid. A scarlet portal opened directly on the lawn outside the Avengers Alliance base. At the moment Su Yi could already see many people standing on the opposite lawn. Su Yi walked over. Wanda and Gwen followed. But Gwen habitually put on the battle suit instantly. But the battlesuit style is different. It's cool cyan sneakers plus black and white pink functional battlesuit. After the three went in, the scarlet portal closed, and everyone also found that Su Yi and the other three had come, so they all nodded their heads as question marks. But there are not many familiar people present. Only Natasha Romanoff and Banner know each other well. So after Su Yi nodded, he came to Banner who was studying and took a look. Banner at the moment is holding the instrument, then measure various state to with a van in front. After seeing Su Yi coming, he just looked up and said, There is no data feed in this van. All known detection methods cannot accept any feedback. It's like a black hole. It doesn't let out any information. Banner scratched his head with the instrument. There is also no way at all. What are you doing without any data? By guessing? Could it be up to me to think? And Hank Pym also came over and said anxiously, Something went wrong in the quantum realm. Our activators and deactivators are all dead. It's not clear yet what exactly happened. But at the moment the quantum realm is on a rampage. This entrance is expanding infinitely. If the expansion continues, the Earth will be over in a short time. Have to. After hearing this, so Yi knew one thing. The Earth is going to end again and again. And this time, it's a quantum realm event. If it wasn't for Su Yi, how do you want it to end? Natasha Romanoff came over and said, We can't do anything. Any existence near the entrance will be swallowed up, it's like a black hole without gravity, but it is still expanding infinitely without swallowing things. Gwen was curious, infinite expansion? That is, this quantum realm entrance will even suck the earth into it in the end? Then the earth all enters the quantum realm, in the end even the solar system goes in? This is too amazing, right? No. By then her and Su Yi's homes will be gone, and Su Yi heard now. He also completely understood, well. The Earth is going to disappear again. This ball is gone every day. So Yi and everyone looked at the quantum field entrance of this van. To be honest, it's not that big right now. That is. 2734 inch monitor file size. About the size of a 2K monitor. But the problem is, it's really expanding in a very slow, 
but infinite way. Natasha Romanoff added on the sidelines. When it came it was the size of a cell phone. And none of the attacks worked. Thor slashed the lightning and almost threw his own hammer in it. So you looked at Thor. Thor tucks the hammer back a little. Don't talk about it, sister. Shame. And after seeing Su Yi's eyes, Loki greeted him respectfully. Su Yi hugged his arms and nodded. As for others, Hawkeye stood in the distance, unable to do anything. He acted like he was saying don't come to me. Theoretical mechanics why do you want my ADC? And the others are pretty much the same. Theoretical mechanics why do you want my magician? Theoretical mechanics, why do you want me? A soy saucer. All right. The big villain appeared and everyone tried their best. But my physics and math. I'm sorry, if you don't, you really can't. If you're awesome, you're really awesome. And now it can affect the quantum realm. It's not ordinary magic. Nor is it ordinary science. Either you think of an infinite quantum controller on a whim like Tony. Either you are a god who can master alter reality. The ability to make your wishes come true. That is similar to the ability of reality gem. And it has to be strong. So Su Yi turned to Wanda and said. Wanda, you can try to use origin magic power to turn it off. As long as you think about closing it in your heart. Same as when you used the portal. Wanda nodded in agreement. She came to Su Yi's side. Then reached out to diffuse scarlet energy and start using origin magic power. Loki, who was not far away, stared when he saw it. He wondered if he had heard wrong. Origin magic power? Isn't that one of the three ancient energies of the universe? It turns out that my brother-in-law's woman is her brother-in-law knew by sister. Husband is invincible. This has taken down a woman who can be stronger than Odin in the future. Isn't that great? And after Thor saw Loki's shocked look, he moved closer to Loki, nudged Loki and asked softly. What's wrong? Loki answered quietly. Don't say that I am the number one magician in the Nine Realms. Thor frowned. He retorted on the spot. When did I say that? Loki, the other side. Wanda has overridden the origin magic power to wrap the entrance to the quantum realm. Now look at them from their perspective. It is an illusory entrance covered with a layer of hazy red gauze. But Wanda ran into a problem. She looked at Su Yi and said, Dot vertical bar my magic will be swallowed as soon as I get close to the entrance. How can I fix it? So you raise two fingers. Two ways. One, directly modify the space you wrap. Briefly modify the space that exists in the quantum realm. Two, start alter reality at the moment of being absorbed. But the timing must be grasped accurately, and at the same time, it must be mastered quickly. Wanda thought about it. She decided to use the first method, because the second method is too much a test of proficiency. And Wanda is facing the quantum realm for the first time. So it's better to be the first one. So Wanda began to cast spells. She directly followed what Su Yi said and began to modify the space wrapped in origin magic power. For a moment, the audience is full of red lights. Silky red magic began to surge wildly from Wanda's body. Then rush out and start modifying the real world of this space. The power that exploded at this moment. It's as if the world has suddenly changed its style of painting. Gwen looked on in surprise. She had never seen Wanda's magic explode like this. And it feels strong and strong. There is a feeling that I am out of control. At the same time, the same goes for the people around you. Everyone starts with 0.0. .0. Then Wanda exploded. All become 0.0, .0 again. Hawkeye from a distance at. At. There seems to be a question mark in those eyes. I just touched the fish for a while. What's the matter? Not far away. Thor and Loki also suddenly changed from 0.0 to 0.0. Thor watched, elbowing Loki as he asked, Are you okay? How successful are you? Loki thought for a moment, then held out a finger. But the fingers are not standing up, but pointing horizontally. Thor rolled his eyes and continued to look at magic and said, 10%? Kang busy my younger brother, be more confident, how about 1.5? No, I mean not at all. The other side, after wonder outputs normally, while there are plenty of special effects around, Wanda actually finds it all herself. Sue, the entrance just stops expanding, but it doesn't shrink. Ban, Zamahau, looked at it and nodded. Is such that, it's just limited, but not cancelled. Su Yi put his hands in his pockets. Try it all. Wanda nodded, okay, and the people around were even more surprised. 0.0. .0. You told me I didn't do my best? It's all red today. Are you telling me you haven't done your best yet? But the next moment, Buzz Tilda, two black and white books flew out, but the people present did not know each other. Otherwise, you can also install a 13. But Loki, who was the only magician present, frowned and said to Thor with his eyes wide open, Thor, the two books seem to be divine books. Thor watched the wonderful magic closely. He asked without looking back, what is a divine book? Loki takes a closer look. I'm not sure. But I know that there are only two divine books, one white and one black, and it should be these two. Thor nodded. Motioning to continue, Loki thought for a moment and said, If there is a ranking of the treasures most wanted by magicians in the universe, then these two divine books should be on the list, and they are at the top, in the eyes of other magicians. These two divine books are more important than life. For it, they would rather turn against each other immediately, and there are even people who kill relatives. Thor understands when he hears it. That's the same as you were before. 
Dot 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 don't talk nonsense, I don't have one. But what they don't know is, at the moment is between a pair of grapefruits in wonder. There is also a golden gem buried deep in it that cannot fly out. But it at the moment is exuding a faint yellow light to bless wonder with spiritual power. It is mind gem, and under the three blessings of Waishan Emperor's book, Dark God book, and mind gem. Wonder also really started to use all its strength to try to close the storage of this quantum field. But Hank Pym thought about it. What is the purpose of his coming? Is it directly close the entrance? Etc. My family of three, wife, son-in-law and daughter, hasn't come out yet. 158. Multi-universe chaos. Wonder closes the entrance, under the blessing of the three treasures. With Wonder at full power on origin magic power. The entire sky outside the Avengers Alliance space turned scarlet. Everyone is surrounded by red energy that seems to be floating around, just like a blood moon in the sky. At the moment is not to mention ordinary people like Hawkeye and Natasha Romanoff. Not even Thor and Loki move. Do you think they don't want to move? No, they dare not move. This scarlet energy field made other people present feel as if their souls were about to be stripped. It seems that the next moment I am about to be changed. That intense heart palpitation will keep you feeling bad. Just been very uneasy. But Wanda can't control that much. She held out her hands, then start to forcibly modify the space where the quantum realm entrance is located. Under the blessing of Wanda's three treasures, the quantum realm is really slowly shrinking. Just very slow. Banner looked carefully. It's really shrinking. It's kind of weird. Wanda's origin magic power is also capable of alter reality. It's just that it's not a strong point. Wanda frowned slightly always thinking about modifying this space, under the influence of her will, an illusory haze began to appear in the space surrounded by scarlet energy, everyone around felt that Wanda was about to succeed, but under Su Yi's gaze, he could feel Wanda struggling more and more, doing your best is still going all out, but the changes are getting less and less effective, at this time, Hank Pym reacted, he remembered that his family of three was still inside, wait, my daughter, my wife, and Scott Lang are still inside, and if the entrance is closed, they will never come back. Hank Pym's wife is Janet Van Dyne. That is, the first generation wasp. She's been locked up in the quantum realm for many, many years. But this time Hank Pym's apprentice and daughter were imprisoned. If this is gone, he was left alone. And Natasha Romanoff frowned when she heard this. For them, this is another difficult choice. Save it. How to save it? Do you want to give up the opportunity to close it this time? Then it will get bigger and bigger and you can close the code. If you don't save them, then you will give up three lives to keep the safety of the earth. So Yi smiled after listening. It is the famous salvation problem in the movie again. When faced with a world crisis, do you choose love or salvation? Then each movie gave a different answer. But usually it's a happy ending. But the problem is, Wanda's progress is not as smooth as expected. As the quantum realm continues to devour energy, and under Wanda's modified compression, the quantum realm seems to be rebelling. Wanda wants to modify the entire space where the quantum realm exists, but the quantum realm affects the entire space around it. It seems to be resisting consciously. Wanda held on for a while longer. In the end, he could only stop and turn to look at Su Yi. Su, it's useless to modify the surrounding space. The entire surrounding space has been affected by the quantum realm. The space where I am modifying the space will also be swallowed by the quantum realm. Simply put, previously, Wanda had a progress bar. As a result, it has just risen to 20 or 30 percent. The progress bar was swallowed by the quantum realm. You won't even be given the chance to dry. After Wanda stopped, the surrounding space returned to its original state. The special effects of the blood moon in the sky also disappeared. But the problem is, method one, the doctor failed. So Yi put his hands in his pockets and shrugged. Then you now have a second choice. Just this option will allow your origin magic power to enter the quantum realm. It's the equivalent of setting up a temporary beacon in the quantum realm. If his family can see it, then he can use it to get out. Forget it if he can't see it, let him figure out a way by himself later. When Hank Pym hears that a temporary beacon can be set up in the quantum realm to give the family a chance to come out, he felt hope coming, but hear the words behind, he knew it was down to luck, if the three people who go in are all together and can still see the beacon, then the three can come out together, if not, it is nothing. Hank Pym clenched his fist nervously, and Wanda nodded, turn around and continued to cast origin magic power to start the second plan, that is, she pours energy directly into the quantum realm, then directly modify the space at the entrance of the quantum realm. This operation is definitely expensive, but with direct access to the quantum realm, Wanda drew with both hands. Immediately, the sky was filled with scarlet again. Thor and Loki looked up at the same time to survey their surroundings. This kind of existence that changes the world with a wave of hands. It's as if they haven't seen each other until now. If there is something to say, it was pretty much the same before Ancient One, but at that time, Ancient One was much worse than the current Wanda. You thought Wanda was just messing around at home? Even if she wakes up late every day, she still has to cook for Su Yi, and then go to Little Universe to tidy up the garden. But she will spend the rest of her time practicing spells in the small universe. Wanda is the Book of the Lord. Bjda, Xiuai Shandi. Minor majoring in the Book of Darkness. It's all about exercising origin magic power at the same time. 
because Tsu Yi told her that her origin magic power is the strongest, the basis of all magic, it's all about how powerful her origin magic power is. So Wanda, who has practiced with multiple divine books, has now added mind gem. Her strength has surpassed the ancient one magician back then. Stuck roughly between level godfather and level single universe, similar to Gwen's strength. It's just that one is a magician and the other is a warrior. Next, under Su Yi's gaze, Wanda began to pour origin magic power slowly towards the entrance of the prince's domain. At this time, the movement was not as loud as before, but Wanda is more focused than last time. You can see a red silk ribbon leaving Wanda's hand and then entering the entrance of the quantum realm. This requires this energy to enter. Then there will be a temporary coordinate that changes at any time in the quantum realm. But as soon as Wanda stops using magic, then the coordinates are gone. Under the gaze of everyone, the effect of Wanda seems to be obvious this time. The entrance to the 27-inch quantum realm is slowly shrinking visible to the naked eye. The speed of its progress bar is about 510 m and the speed of downloading several G videos is almost the same. This should be a little easier to understand. Everyone breathed a sigh of relief. Pickham looked at the entrance nervously, hoping that his family would come out quickly, but Wanda's brows are not very good looking, because her energy consumption is too great. Such an infusion of energy. Its consumption rate is faster than the consumption of Su Yi's recovery of physical strength when tossing herself. That is to say, although the entrance is shrinking visible to the naked eye, Wang Dia's mana consumption is no longer faster. It was a while later. Wanda couldn't bear it anymore. But the entrance to the quantum realm is only half closed. Wanda started to worry. She was a little worried. What if the energy was exhausted and the entrance exploded? Su Yi beside him already felt her heart. So he put his hands in his pockets and said lightly from the side. Don't worry, I will take action when the energy is gone. Hear this sentence. Wanda was instantly relieved. She is no longer hesitation. Instead, concentrate on casting magic. Gradually, as Wanda's magical energy is gradually exhausted, the entrance to the quantum realm is getting smaller and smaller. Everyone was worried as they watched the entrance of the quantum realm and the red silk in Wanda's hands fade away. They also see it. Wanda may not have enough mana, but the next moment, Su Yi stretched out his fingers, and the ball was also red, but the fiery red energy appeared on his fingertips. It was rolling and circling between Su Yi's fingers like a glass marble. Then wait until it rolls to Su Yi's middle finger. He flicked slightly. The fiery red charm glass marble instantly entered Wanda's body. Baking Tilda. This moment, Wanda's body suddenly ignited a blazing fire. It's like she's in Saiyan form too. And the red silk at the entrance of the quantum realm swelled in an instant. The people around were startled at first. Then he calmed down after seeing that Wanda didn't respond. This flame covered Wanda's body, but it has no effect on Wanda. Instead Wanda is back at full strength, even more aggressive. Under the blessing of Sui energy bins, the origin magic power output by Wanda has a fiery red energy color. And once these energy colors meet the entrance of the quantum realm, the entrance will shrink quickly. At the moment Hank Pym's heart was already on his chest. With the narrowing of the entrance, 24 inches dot 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 20 inches dot 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 16 inches 12 inches, his heart became more and more tense. What if the family really doesn't come out? What? Then he can only go back and study the controller. But the problem is, can his family still wait for these hours? Sudden, as Hank Pym imagined, a ripple suddenly erupted from the entrance of the quantum realm. Then the quantum realm began to oscillate. Wanda frowned. She turned her head to look at Su Yi and said, That's not what I did. I know. Su Yi nodded. He looked into the entrance. The people inside did it. People inside? Everyone was taken aback. But the next moment, as Wanda continues to close the door, the entrance to the quantum realm suddenly glows with light. Then there was a flash of light. Plop. Three people fell to the ground together. Janet, Hope, Scott. Hank Pym was ecstatic when he saw the man. He hurried forward and hugged the three of them. And Wanda continues to cast origin magic power. Finally, under the blessing of Su Yi's energy, with the last burst of light faded away, the entrance to the quantum realm has finally been closed. And it was before closing. Su Yi discovered that there are many bubbles in the quantum realm. Utilda and Wanda let out a sigh of relief. With the discontinuation of origin magic power, the surrounding space returns to normal. The flames on her body also disappeared. Wanda returned to Su Yi's side. Then he hugged Su Yi's arm again, and the other side. The Ant Man family hugged each other, feeling the luck after their lives were hanging by a thread. The second generation wasp shed tears. Hank Pym hugged his wife and daughter tightly. After a long time, they separate. The gray haired wasp, aka Janet Van Dyne, looked around. Then he fixed his eyes on Su Yi and said, The deepest breath I feel in the quantum realm is you. Are you guiding us? Su Yi shook his head, but said, It is. Ask Natasha Romanoff from the sidelines. What the hell is the quantum realm? What happened to you guys? This problem. In fact, the second generation and man and the second generation wasp are not easy to describe. During their time in the quantum realm, it was wasp who took them all the time. So wasp said, When I first entered the quantum realm, it was normal inside, and I still had a way to survive. But after Scott came in, 
the quantum realm began to experience vibrations and anomalies, and then hope came in. I know it's not because of them, but it shows that the originally stable quantum field has already been chaotic, and in the end it even started to shake. This means that the original normalized quantum field is no longer normal, but I don't know what impact it will have. The quantum realm is said to be related to reality, to the universe, and to the multi-universe, but not so relevant. This thing depends on the probability. It's as if the two sides on the battlefield shoot each other, and bullets may collide with bullets. And Ant-Man also said, if it weren't for an energy guiding us, we would absolutely be crushed to death by the foam inside. This is Banner chiming in. What is foam? What does it look like? Ant-Man indicated with his hand, then explained, it's the kind of colorful bubbles, one layer after another, which seems to be bigger than the world, and then it keeps blending, layering and colliding with each other. Banner nodded upon hearing that. Then write these down in your notebook. This is a new discovery in the quantum realm, and every little bit counts. But among those present, only Su Yi knew exactly what Ant-Man was talking about. He looked around. He said to Natasha Romanoff when he knew it was all right. We have something to do in the afternoon, so let's go first. Ha, huh, ha. Huh? Natasha Romanoff was taken aback, in such a hurry. No. Su Yi waved his hand, interrupting Natasha Romanoff's words. Then Wanda reached out and drew. A scarlet portal opens. The three of them walked in and closed the door. The Ant-Man family on the side were all stunned. You saved our lives and don't even need a thank you. Really don't need it. Su Yi only said that he wanted Wanda and Gwen to experience it, and then let Wanda practice in advance. After returning home, Wanda hugged Su Yi's arm. The three came to sit down in the small universe, and Wanda asked, Did you find something? Takumi, Gwen nodded in agreement. She also absolutely knew what Su Yi knew. That's why I didn't watch the show there. After sitting down, Su Yi waved his hand, and said what Ant-Man said just now. Remember what I told you about the universe beyond the universe? Wanda and Gwen nodded. That's the multi-universe. After Su Yi finished speaking, he materialized those bubbles and said, A multi-universe is an infinitely expanding universe, but the environment in each universe is the same. The Natasha Romanoff you know, there is actually one in every universe, including Hawkeye, Steven. Banner, etc. Some of their personalities have not changed, but some have turned into enemies, and some have changed species, and even changed from humans to animals or women. But now something seems to be wrong. Here, here. Wanda and Gwen were taken aback. She looked at each other, and at the same time, she got out of what she was worried about. What about us and you? Are we still together in other universes? Yes. After hearing this, both Wanda and Gwen were afraid of what would happen to Su Yi's relationship with them in other universes. Is it an enemy? Still not a lover? Or how so? But Su Yi smiled and shook his head. Then this is related to the parallel universe under the multi-universe, as well as issues such as numbering and major events. If you want to know, kiss me now. The more you kiss, the more I say, Mew am you am you am you at Tilda. So ye hasn't finished speaking yet. His face was covered with lip marks. Dot. 159. Check out the yoga workout. Female Hulk is dying. I can see it. Both Gwen and Wanda care about it. So ye hadn't finished speaking yet. There are marks all over his face. So ye was silent for a while. The two women watched from the side and couldn't help secretly laughing. So ye had no choice but to wipe his face with a towel in silence. Do not know how. Taking advantage this time seems to be the same as being taken advantage of. Is this the situation of two women and one man? Sure enough, there are many people and momentum is still useful. Wait for Suyi to finish wiping. Wanda took the towel and said, Speak quickly, speak quickly. I've said it. Suyi sighed after sitting down, and then said, A bubble is actually a universe, and beyond the bubble is actually a multi-universe. But you see only so many bubbles, but there are countless bubbles out there. Parallel universes are multi-layered bubbles and the infinite universes I'm talking about are normal bubbles. The development of the normal bubble world is the same. There is a solar system, there is an Earth, there is a Merrick, and there are all kinds of people. But the difference is that they may have different worldviews, different personalities, and even different genders. This is what a multi-universe is made of. So Yi clapped his hands. In an instant, countless colorful bubbles appeared in the air. And as long as you want, you can see more. Only then did Su Yi add the last sentence. So a multi-universe, that is, an infinite number of infinite universes, the two women looked inside the cosmic bubble. It's really pretty. But the point is, what about us? Wanda immediately recovered and asked, Are we still together? Gwen immediately nodded in agreement. It doesn't matter whether it's diverse or not. Gwen said that it has nothing to do with her. It doesn't matter. The one who has something to do with me is Su Yi. And Wanda thought so too. Su Yi smiled. It is a pity. Wanda, Gwen. The entire multi-universe. Wanda, Gwen. We are all unique. Wanda, Gwen. The two women were taken aback for a moment. Immediately afterwards, I understood what Su Yi meant. Don't think so much. Other universes don't have us. That's great Tilda. Gwen was the first to react and shouted. It's so much better. Wanda also let out a sigh of relief. She walked to Su Yi and sat down, then silently rested her head on Su Yi's arm. Although multi-universe has nothing to do with them, because you are yourself, we are not the same memory. 
But everyone didn't want to see the other self having nothing to do with Su Yi. Now hear yourself as unique. That's more reassuring than knowing the answer. That's what makes everything worry free. Gwen hummed happily. It was already afternoon. Su Yi looked at Wanda and Gwen and asked, Do you still want to go out and play? Both Wanda and Gwen shook their heads. Wanda leaned against Su Yi with her eyes closed and said softly, That's fine, Gwen said happily. It's already afternoon. Let's stay at home. There will be more weekends in the future. How can I not play, too? If you think about where to go every day, then you must have a day when you don't know where to go. But if you play badly, then you can go wherever you want. Definitely. The premise is not to work, that's all. The time allotment for this afternoon is. Wanda and Su Yi stayed together until 2 o'clock in the afternoon, and then Wanda went to practice magic. Then it was Gwen and Su Ai who went to grab Hala and Tanmai's place to play the game. Let the two bullies go. Tanmai and Hala can only be reduced to audience seats. Then watch the two play games. That's all. Four hours passed. The time came to 6 p.m. After Wanda practiced almost, she got up and went to the kitchen to prepare dinner. Then come over and ask everyone what they want to eat. At the same time, Su Yi and Gwen also returned the game consoles to Hala and Tanmai. Then I went to the small universe with Gwen to watch the sunset. After Wanda finished preparing the dishes, come and watch the sunset together. Definitely. During this process, Su Yi definitely wants to take advantage of it. Too lazy to look after the fact. The next day the addiction got bigger. Men are like that. Besides, what's wrong with not eating some lip balm? I have eaten this. Can't you try that too? After a while, the food is ready. Everyone happily ate dinner. Then wait until after Wanda and Gwen take a break to practice yoga. Tanmai also returned to her home. Definitely she would sometimes play games all night with Hala. But Tanmai also has her own research. For example, study why your body is always hungry. For example, research what technology can slow down hunger or stop hunger, like other things and so on. So Tanmai has something to do. Only when she is free. Only then will I play games all night with Hala. Night. Wanda and Gwen finished their yoga and took a shower. Three people are in the bedroom. So Yi coughed twice and said seriously, that Wanda, I'm going to smoke X this time. No, I want to check your yoga progress. It's just dot 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 it depends on whether you work hard or not. Wanda? Wanda thought it was real at first. She just did her first yoga pose. But hear this statement. Then she suddenly reacted. Wanda immediately rolled her eyes at Su Yi. She will. But Gwen was crying too. There's me. There's me. You're slapping me, Su Tilda. Su Yi nodded majestically. Wipe all. Wipe. I'll see who doesn't study well in school. If you are caught by me, then you will be severely punished. Then Gwen and Wanda do yoga poses together. Su Yi observed carefully. He upholds the attitude of treating everyone equally and rigorously and meticulously watches the switching postures of the two. After a while, the performance of the two is over. Su Yi pursed the corners of his lips, and then commented seriously. Gwen's posture is deft, slender, lively, full of youth and pure vitality, and her legs are not only 180 degrees but also 200 degrees. Su Yi immediately applauded. Praise praise. Hearing Su Yi's praise, Gwen had a happy smile on his face, and Wanda knew she was going to take a 13-year break. What does rest 13 mean? It means it's over. It's completely over, or just really bad, as expected. Su Yi commented on Wanda next. Wanda, although your movements are graceful, your posture is full of beauty, and your temperament is elegant, but your posture is difficult to display, and some movements are also very stiff, and the opening of your legs is only 150 degrees, which is far behind Gwen. Wanda pursed her lips. She had just looked at Gwen. In fact, it is true. Su Yi's comment was not wrong at all, only some of the opening and closing movements of yoga are too blushing, especially in front of Su Yi. And when he saw that Su Yi's head was getting bigger, Wanda's heart trembled even more. It's good that she can finish well. 82. Bad is bad. Wanda admits it herself. And Su Yi also used this to say, Wanda, do you still have any objections? Wanda clasped her hands and answered weakly. No disagreement. So Su Yi nodded. Okay, Gwen, come here and put her to death. Huh? X2. No, I made a mistake practice more. The next day, Su Yi woke up at 8.30 in the morning. After he stretched in place, I got up and went to wash up. The twin dancers followed with tools. They scrubbed Su Yi's back when he took a shower, wiped Su Yi's body dry, helped Su Yi trim his eyebrows, tidy up his appearance, trim his hair, and apply hot towels to his face. Definitely. The towels were changed, not the same. The service of the twin dancers came down. Su Yi was happy and refreshed. Then he went to the kitchen to order breakfast. When Nora of the refrigerator saw Su Yi approaching, she immediately said excitedly, Master, you finally came to see me, I miss you, and you make strange noises at night Tilda. So you looked calm, he was used to it, then you are broken, quickly fix it yourself. But I want the master to fix me, to fix me hard. So Yi touched his chin. Finally, make sure to have a meal for breakfast. Make round thin noodles, the kind that are only one or two millimeters long, make the soup taste better, I want to drink soup this morning. Now that I know master, when will you turn me into a maid? No. You can also be a slave. Five years from now. Five years. It's a long time, 
but in order to be with Master forever, I'm willing to wait till the refrigerator Nora rubbed her face with her tentacles while continuing to talk to Su Yi in her colorful language. And Su Yi, he's gone, Ling. Bring the noodles down later. Okay, employ people. Wait for Su Yi to come to the office. He sat down on his boss's chair and let out a long breath. Wu collected Su Yi's habits. So she stepped forward to open the refrigerator, took out a bottle of milk tea, then closed the door and put the milk tea in front of Su Yi. Finally stood aside. Su Yi picked up the milk tea and unscrewed it and took a sip. Then he sighed. It's no wonder that the last humans in the movie Wally are all fat. With a robot service like a dancer, it's no wonder that you can't be fat or suspicious. Wu lowered her head and answered happily. Thank you for the compliment, Master. Well, let's take it as it is. But under such services, there are indeed two kinds of people. A kind of lazy to the end, let the robot do it. A kind of hard work, will still insist on exercising. Definitely there will also be a third. For example, Su Yi who lives a normal life. After a while, Ling Juan came to see Su Yi. Then Su Yi began to drink milk tea and eat noodles while turning on the news to read. But today is Monday. Ask for flowers. There is really no news to read. And at this moment, reported by dancers, Master, the Bayesian Legion wiped out a space pirate organization on a planet not long ago, and rescued many survivors of the Empire. Huh? Su Yi ate a mouthful of noodles, feeling a little strange. Are they going to punish rape and eradicate evil? No. Lian shook his head and said, it was just passing by. But the descendants of shapeshifting King Kong found that there are a lot of scarce resources in the planet and reported it after scanning. After discussing and scanning, the elders determined that most of the planet's creatures were malignant creatures, and then used this reason to eliminate the pirate organization on the planet, and rescued more than 10,000 members of various empires and let them go home. Are this, as expected of a mechanical life? I didn't want to snatch you at first, but it turned out that you had a treasure at home, so I had no choice but to kill the rape and get rid of the evil. But Su Yi was curious again. How many members of the Empire were originally there this week? Less than 20,000. Less than 20,000. Save more than 10,000 people. More than half alive. With the rescue method of shapeshifting King Kong, can he survive more than half? Su Yi thought that more than 10,000 was just a small part. Not bad. Su Yi nodded in satisfaction. Not bad. The rescue rate is as high as 50% plus. Can only say. I hope there will be no shapeshifting King Kong going to save people in the future. The trapped people listened. Then asked the person who looted them for a gun. Finally, we discussed how to break out together. That would be ridiculous. And at the moment, the channel on the TV on the wall suddenly changed. Then it became a TV broadcast. At the moment a reporter was speaking impassionately outside a courthouse. Zero dot 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 zero. A kind female lawyer is going to file a lawsuit for a girl who was persecuted by the gang. Has justice finally come? She's brave and we have to support her. Follow the reporter's words. The perspective of the scene is switched to another camera. This camera is on an upstairs. Then, the entire square outside the court was photographed from an overhead perspective. Su Yi at the moment has already seen Jenny at the door, that is, what the future girl Hulk is talking about. Then she went in. At the gate of the courthouse, a figure wearing normal clothes but much larger than the person next to him watched Jenny finally disappear. Then he walked to the resting place and waited. I can see it. This person is Banner. It's just that he was very wrapped up, and his size has suddenly grown a lot. Is this the credit of the quantum realm yesterday? But there is one thing that Su Yi is quite curious about. In the plot, Hulk didn't go to court to accompany Jenny either, and Jenny was assassinated by members of the gang on the way to the courthouse. It's not going to court at all, but now, not only arrived, still in court. If they enter the court, the gangsters will never be able to do anything. Although the gang has a relationship with the upper class in New York. But as long as he dares to do it in court, then the upper echelons of New York won't hesitate to FK you anymore. Because the court is a very noble, free and sacred place in the United States. These unscrupulous black and evil events are not allowed here, even if you bribe the judge. But absolutely no assassination or anything like that here. But Jenny's evidence was too conclusive. And it's broadcast live. The gang just let her go? No way. It's not good to say. If the gangsters let Jenny go, then Su Yi's previous teachings will become nonsense. He has become the person whose heart is dark and everything is dark. No way. No way. As time passed, Su Yi finished eating the noodles. Then while drinking the drink, waiting for the result. After a while, about an hour or two less, Su Yi saw Jenny walking out with a triumphant smile. She smiled happily. It must have been a big victory in the lawsuit. She won for the persecuted girl and got compensation. People around applauded. Banner was also drumming in the crowd. So far, everything is normal. After a while, Jenny finished her speech in front of the reporters. Then he left alone calmly. People stared at her. Banner was watching her too. Jenny stopped a taxi casually. After she opened the car door, the crowd began to prepare to leave. Banner is also ready to go back. But the next moment, Butilda, with a very small voice sounded. Some people were taken aback. Some people didn't hear. 
but Banner immediately tensed up, available under Banner's gaze. Jenny looked at the gun in front of her heart with astonishment, and then slowly fell to the ground. No roar tilde. Hulk instantly transformed into a roar, and so far, what the gang wants to tell society is, even if you win the lawsuit, what if you win on the surface? Can you bear the revenge from the underground gang? Yes, you can't, you're just an ordinary person for a long time. Dot. 160. Here comes Auntie, female Hulk is born, the Moonlight Knight is here, and it is, without Banner as her cousin, Jenny would be a normal person, she alone is certainly not able to fight the gang, I will die here today too, but fortunately, she has a cousin named Banner, who is also Hulk, Raw Tilda, in Banner's roar of no, the people around were taken aback for a moment, then immediately panicked and started to run away, why, PTSD committed, the previous Banners did a lot of damage to the city, I looked and saw the green titan right in front of me, are you afraid of the people around you, that must be running away, and the killer saw that the Hulk was actually here, he also immediately put away his weapon and prepared to evacuate, in general, the killer mainly hits the heart first, because hitting the head does not necessarily kill him, but as long as the heart is broken, he will definitely die. So just to be on the safe side, the killer can beat the heart as much as he can. What's more, the hard head corresponds to the risk of small caliber weapons and ricochets. But the next moment, the angry Hulk jumped tens of meters, came directly in front of the killer. I even bought karma. The killer immediately seemed to run away, raw tilde, but Hulk caught the killer in one go, then throw it directly at the wall, PSST. The killer's head immediately exploded like a watermelon, and this was also recorded by reporters. Immediately afterwards, after falling to the killer, Hulk gradually calmed down. He thought of his sister, so Hulk hurriedly jumped to his sister, and Jenny from at the moment is already lying in a pool of blood. While dying, she turned her head slightly and glanced at Hulk of rage. Then lift your chin slightly, looking towards the upstate building in New York. Compared to the feeling of death, in this last time, Jenny still recalled Zhu Yi's 270 words. Where there is light, there must be darkness, Miss Jenny. So can you accept all the consequences of participating in this court appearance? I am sure. Yes, she admitted it herself. But she never thought it would be so dark, as for death. She also thought about it, but I didn't expect it to come so suddenly. This world is really dark. Mr. Sue, shouldn't the world just get better with superheroes? Why? What will happen? Jenny's pupils gradually began to dilate, and losing focus in this way means that a person's life is coming to an end. No, no, Jenny, wake up. Banner looked at the blood all over the floor, and he didn't know what to do. Call 911 for an ambulance. Carry yourself to the hospital, or emergency rescue. Too late. Banner knows it's too late. Jenny's bleeding volume and location can be seen as a heart attack. Such a wound cannot be healed with the current medical level in the world. Jenny can't get over it no matter what. What should he do then? Jenny is dying. He's a physical scientist, not a surgeon. Doctor? To the doctor. Sue is also a doctor. Will he have a way? As the saying goes, when you are in a hurry, you go to the doctor. Just like that. Banner picked up the phone and called Su Yi. Su Yi took just connected. Banner said anxiously, Su, it's me. My sister was shot in the heart, and now she's about to lose too much blood and die. What should I do? Banner didn't say anything and it was too late, because everyone knows that it is too late to be shot in the heart. Press to stop the bleeding, it's a fart. Isn't that pampers? So according to the normal situation, Jenny must die. But still that sentence, she has a superhero big brother. Su Yi picked up the phone glanced at the urgent news and said calmly, are you related to her by blood? Um, Banner was taken aback for a moment, he couldn't understand why Su Yi asked such a question, but he answered right away, yes, Jenny is my cousin, that's fine, Su Yi raised his legs on the table, look, it's not an accident that you can bear the Hulk, it's just that you have good genes, so you have only one way now, and it's the only way, what way, Banner asked anxiously, create a wound yourself, let your cousin drink your blood, and then there will be two Hulks in your family, exclamation mark, Banner's eyes widened when he heard that, his blood is not untouched, but the man who drank, died, but Su Yi said that genes represent everything, he can become a Hulk, and so can his cousin, Banner thought for a second, he looked at his wrist, and cherished that his eyes were almost slack to the extreme, next moment, he tosses the phone aside, the phone didn't hang up yet, Kai Tilda, Banner roared, and he opened his mouth and tore his wrist open, because nothing normal can hurt a Hulk, only the Hulk himself is the most powerful weapon, so Banner wanted to open his wrist, then keep on tearing the wound, until the green blood starts to flow, Banner immediately opened Jenny's mouth, then let the blood flow into Jenny's mouth, one second passed, twenty, three seconds, Hulk didn't even know how much he drank, maybe two hundred cc, but three seconds to one, the big wound on Hulk's wrist healed, Banner, no, Hulk, it's all the same, Banner was okay and continued to open the wound, drain his blood for Jenny, but the next moment, Jenny's dilated pupils suddenly shrank, then her pupils fluttered rapidly, in the last moment it turned into an emerald-like pine green, Tilda, and her body that had stopped breathing also began to breathe violently, then the heart quickly repaired, puff Tilda, puff Tilda, puff Tilda, 
The heart that had stopped beating started beating. Jenny came alive. Banner shouted excitedly. Jenny, Jenny has just regained consciousness. Um, she's a little short on the brain. Because in a sense, Jenny just died. It's just that the biological signs haven't gone away. To put it simply, it is not dead. Not hard yet. So Jenny is now like a computer reboot. The average person sleeps just hibernate. And she just unplugged and plugged into restart. The difference is still huge. You have to give the system boot time. But on the phone, Su Yi smiled after hearing this call. I think your cousin should be alive. With the sound of footsteps came. Banner quickly picked up the phone and thanked him. Su, that's great. Jenny really came back to life. It's just that her consciousness is a little short-circuited. I have to send her to the Avengers Alliance to check inside. When Jenny recovers, I'll bring her along to thank you. Su, Su Yi smiled, you're welcome. Then hung up the phone, and Banner put away his phone. Then continued to observe Jenny's situation. In general, she had sat up from the pool of blood. Then he looked at Banner and frowned. Who are you? Exclamation mark Banner was startled. You lost your memory, Jenny. Oh, palace, question mark. Jenny reacted after hearing the voice. Then she looked around. Why am I here? Oh yes, it's a lawsuit. At the moment, some reporters around have already gathered around. They see that the banner has returned to normal. So everyone wanted to come up and take pictures to get first-hand news. But it's a pity. Baked Tilda. There was a loud bang in the sky. A flight controller lands beside Hulk. It's a cunt-style war chicken. Then the driver's seat and the cabin door opened simultaneously. Hawkeye and Natasha Romanoff jumped out of it. What happened Banner? Natasha Romanoff walked and alerted the surroundings. The base issued an alarm that you have rage emotions, and issued a location. And Hawkeye came down and looked around. He glanced away. Immediately, I saw a lot of blood on a wall and reporters taking pictures around. Hawkeye indicated the position with his eyes. Natasha Romanoff took a look, opening her eyes slightly. She was not surprised by this scene. She had seen much bloodier scenes than this. Natasha Romanoff has a reason for this reaction. It's because she knew things were going to get worse. Superhero killed people on the street. Although it is revenge, the impact is also super large, let alone this moment. The superhero registration law has not been passed for a year or two. Natasha Romanoff thought for a moment. She flipped through her smartwatch, then sent the location and the message to the agent headquarters. Let them hurry to clean up the funeral. Then she spoke to Banner. Anyway, let's go back and talk about it first. Banner nodded and explained as well. Someone assassinated my cousin Jenny, but it's all right now. Let's go back first. So Hawkeye immediately returned to the driving seat. Then Natasha Romanoff took Hulk and Jenny on the Kun fighter jet and went back to the base first. After all, even if the future will be condemned by people, but blame is blame. Superhero is still superhero. This can refer to Homelander. The essence of strength is strength. It's the same. So no matter how you say it, the Avengers Alliance will protect the superhero first. It's not that ordinary people can do anything just by condemning them. At the same time, in the office, Su Yi nodded slightly satisfied after hanging up the phone. I did good deeds again today. I am really a good young man. Well, saving a life is better than building a seven-level pagoda. Isn't this a great thing to do? Do good every day Tilda. And at the moments upstairs, it's more than 9.30 in the morning. Wanda and Gwen are about to wake up. But this time... It was Wanda who opened his eyes first in a daze. Then she felt something was wrong. So Wanda quickly got up and went to the bathroom. After a while, when Wanda came back with a slightly painful face, she also saw Gwen clutching her stomach and going to the bathroom. The two met on the way. There are many question marks in his eyes. Wanda, Gwen, number. The same day? Such a coincidence. But anyway, Gwen immediately went to the bathroom first. But she found out later. You have to bring sanitary napkins. Wanda? So Gwen wanted to be called Wanda. But when she turned her head, there happened to be a bag on the shelf. Gwen, what a day. Also almost at the same time. Isn't this a coincidence? With doubts, Gwen comes out of the bathroom and realizes that Wanda is not in the bedroom. Wait until she comes to the small universe, only to find that Wanda was resting on a chair. Gwen was in a little pain too. But compared to before, her current physique has made this pain deaf. Just a little different. Gwen walked to the recliner next to Wanda and sat down and said, Have you come at this time before? Wanda shook her head. No. Gwen tilted her head. Me neither. But now it's a coincidence. Two women whose aunts were out of time are now perfectly matched. This is too coincidental Tilda. Gwen found it interesting. But Wanda frowned slightly uncomfortable. She is a magician. How can she have such a good body? Gwen suggested after seeing it. Would you like to use a horse charm? Wanda, I see you are in pain. Wanda shook her head resolutely when she heard it. This is a woman's nature. Gwen, who knows what the consequences of the horse's healing spell are. But without this, we will never have children again. Gwen listened. He immediately shook his head and denied it. Forget it, forget it. If he and Sue couldn't have children in the future, that Gwen could die of guilt. Can't wait to go straight to the shark. So forget about the dangerous hype. But Gwen thought again. By the way, Wanda, do you have pain relief immediately? You should have local pain relief, right? When Wanda heard it, she thought about it. Then he took out the book of Emperor Waishan and flipped through it. Finally found it, and more than one. These spells are simple. There is a local analgesic, which originally means that the spell is injured in battle. 
and this spell can prevent oneself from affecting the operation due to severe pain. There is another one that is more powerful. It is a spell that blocks negative will influences. It can be switched. For example, pain is a kind of influence on the will, but it will affect the original state of mind of the target. For example, you may feel uncomfortable at first, but after being cast, you don't know what it means to be uncomfortable, and you become emotionless. So Wanda thought about it. Let's use the first one. Gwen nodded immediately after hearing this. I want it to. I want it to. Give me a buff too. So Wanda drew with both hands. She took an analgesic by herself, and a pain warmer after a sedation. With scarlet energy into the body, both of them felt better immediately. In fact, the body is still in pain, but only the pictures are blocked. Blood should be shed or must be shed. But Gwen thought of one thing. She suddenly reacted to 0.9 and said to Wanda. Wanda, if we are all on the same day. What about Zeus? Wanda. 0.00.0 Broken. Wanda also reacted. Both of them are like this now. If he went all to Hela, Hela must not be smashed to death. Wanda. At this time, Gwen called Wanda. Wanda turned her head away. I saw Gwen say, maybe we'll just have to work on learning new skills this week. Gwen pulled out the comic book she read last night. In secret teaching, there are many episodes where the sister bites and helps the male lead with her hands. Wanda's face turned red instantly, but she thought about it and could only nod her head. But, Wanda hesitated. What about that sore cheek? Gwen thought for a moment. Rotation. Wanda nodded blushing. At the same time, Su Yi touched the fish. There was a knock on the door. Button tilde. Su Yi put his feet down. Enter. As the door was pushed open, after entering, he couldn't help but look around first. Then come and sit down. Finally, he said anxiously. Doctor, my name is Stephen Grant. I seem to have a mental problem. It's like there's another person in my head who can talk to me and control my body without my knowledge or permission. While listening to his answer, Su Yi hurriedly took a bottle of milk tea and pushed it to him. But he didn't answer directly. Instead, he took an antique mirror and placed it in front of Mark, the Moonlight Knight. Then he said directly, Mark Spector. On the other hand, Stephen Grant suddenly changed his expression when he heard Su Yi call Mark Spector. Why do you know my name? 161. The Delicate Moonlight Knight. Calculate biological time. Why do you know my name? Stephen just finished speaking, and immediately said in panic. No, that's not what I said, it was. But the next moment Stephen said again. What do you know? No. Don't listen to him, that's all. Stephen was talking to himself as if he was mentally divided. At the same time, his other self was talking to Su Yi. But Su Yi knew all these things. Stephen is the person in front of him, that is. The character and body of a normal person. Mark was the one in Stephen's mind. That person is also him, but with another personality, is the real Moonlight Rider. So it's useless for Su Yi to tell Stephen too much. He has to talk with both of them. Watching the two quarrel, Su Yi stretched out his hand and knocked on the table. Button tilde, a wave of red triggers from his tap point. Then it spread throughout the room. At the same time, Stephen suddenly calmed down, including Moonlight Nightmark in his head. Then Su Yi said, one sentence per person, don't talk too much. Understand? Stephen looked into the mirror. Then Mark in the mirror nodded at the same time as him. Good. After seeing both of them calm down, Su Yi crossed his hands, then said lightly, Stephen, what's your problem here? Hear this sentence. Stephen looked in the mirror. Then he turned around and said, Another existence in my head had a huge impact on me. He made me lose my job, and I couldn't chase dot 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 the girl I liked. Su Yi nodded. Then he looked into the mirror and said, What about you? What's your problem? Originally Mark was fine, but he looked at Stephen and said, we still have a bigger mission to complete, Stephen, your existence is more important than you think, you can't live like this, Stephen wanted to refute as soon as he heard it, why, but Su Yi waved his hand, the two of them stopped talking and looked at Su Yi together, then Su Yi Kai said lightly, then let me clarify your medical records first, first of all, Stephen, you don't have a person living in your head, but you have schizophrenia, early on, whether it's you or Mark is the same person, but you have independent feelings and consciousness, that is, you are completely divided, and then grow separately. That's why you feel like there's another 21 people living in your head, but you split up when you were kids, you just don't know it. Then if you want to treat your own mental illness now, the only way to do it is to let your brain delete all memories and do it all over again. Would you like to? Simply put, it can't be cured. Don't cure it, unless the system is reinstalled. That is to brush a machine. As soon as Stephen heard of this method, he resolutely shook his head unwillingly. Just kidding, after flashing the machine, except for the hardware, it is still itself and the software is not itself, but a new self. Seeing that Stephen was unwilling, so you looked at the mirror again and continued. And you, Mark, the other you are a mercenary, and then you get the will and blessings of the Egyptian gods, and then you fight against the messenger of another god. You keep switching identities, and you end up messing up everyone's life. But have you ever thought that two people can complete each other's affairs together, so as to increase the tacit understanding and allocate time between the two? After Su Yi finished speaking, Stephen still shook his head a little unacceptably, because the person who mainly controls the ontology is Stephen. 
he thinks his life has been disrupted, rather than the concept of coexistence of both sides. At the same time, Mark thought about it. He thought about it, and he didn't know what to do. Watching Stephen shake his head and refuse. So Yi smiled. Then your consciousness disappears. Give Mark all the control? He can be a superhero anyway, and you are just an ordinary person. For a while, Stephen shook his head even more. No no no. He hastily refused. But Mark in the mirror nodded to control Stephen and said, Good good good. No no no. The two were about to fight for a while. But and Tilda. So Yi gently touched the table with his fingertips. Then wait for the two to look over before talking. What about Mark? Are you willing to give up the power of Moonlight Knight? Stop doing your own thing, and let Stephen live by himself. Of course. Mark quickly controlled Stephen to nod, and Stephen controlled himself to shake his head again. Exclamation mark. After the two struggled for a while, Suyakai said helplessly. So now I say that you communicate well, allocate time reasonably, and work together to complete each other's affairs. Is it acceptable? Stephen, you have lost your job, and the girl has run away. Why don't you take a look at Mark's life and ideals? Mark, you can't completely control Stephen to do your own thing, so when you're not fighting, you can try to let Stephen do it. Then you get the money and live a good life. Stephen doesn't have to go to work, and then you get the girl back. Wouldn't it be nice? To put it bluntly. The state of Banner is very similar to them, but Banner's other will is Hulk. Hulk is even harder than them, but Banner successfully integrated with Hulk. This is ability. Moreover, after an unacceptable answer from Su Yi, he listened to the answer twice. Both of them immediately felt that they could accept it. Stephen looked into the mirror. Mark in the mirror is also looking at himself. At last, the two nodded in unison. We can try it. Thank you, Doctor. You're welcome. Su Yi pushed the credit card machine over. Just swipe the card. Finally, after taking his last my gen, Stephen stood up crying without tears. So Yi suggested after seeing it, if you don't even have the money for the air ticket to go abroad, perhaps you can join the Avengers Alliance, sign a work agreement after registering as a superhero, and you can receive the money in advance. Stephen's eyes lit up when he heard this, but Mark didn't want to. I still have tasks, can I register after my tasks are completed? Stephen, Stephen thought about it and nodded first. Finally the two left, and Su Yi comfortably sat on the chair. It would be nice if it could be done quickly. Two big men. He doesn't want to waste too much saliva. If a beautiful woman comes, don't talk until you get off work. For a man, it doesn't matter if he earns the money or not. Get it done as soon as you can. Then continue to fish. The time came to noon. Wanda opened the portal, and brought the food to the office with Gwen. The three of them met in debt. The latest news has been released. New York time at 9.30 a.m. Superhero Hulk's sister was assassinated by gangsters, rages Hulk fell to his death in the street, citizens, please leave us a message, today he can kill killers in the street, tomorrow he can kill us in the street, against superhero, they should be controlled, wait, your sister was killed, you are not angry, and this is an incident of ordinary people against gangsters, isn't this the fault of gangsters, but gangsters and killers also have freedom, how can they kill in the street, ok ok ok, I hope you and your family can say the same when you die. As everyone expected, New York and even the United States reacted violently to the incident. Some people think that Hulk is wrong, how can he kill people in the street? What if this uncontrolled superhero kills other people in the future? Everyone is free, but limit the superhero's freedom. Abbreviation People cannot be generalized from person to person. The other faction felt that the sister was assassinated, and it was assassination against gangsters. So Hulk is right. There is nothing wrong with doing this. If that person killed someone, he deserves to die too. The last batch are superhero fans. They felt even more that Hulk was right, and also want Hulk to go. The whole gang is wiped out. This is revenge. In general, these three categories, they are, double standard liberal party, rational analysis party, and hero fan party. Wanda and Gwen also watched the news. The two see here. Gwen said slightly surprised. It's actually Banner's younger sister. No wonder Banner looks very gentle, but he will be so angry. Yes, everyone is a bottom line. Among gentle people, there is also a critical point of madness. So don't bully honest people, it's the worst when they explode. And Wanda shook her head helplessly after seeing it. Society is always like this, messy. Everyone judges others for their own reasons, there's nothing good about being an above board superhero. Gwen nodded in agreement. She has concealed her identity until now, and her life has become more and more comfortable. What about this person? She can be saved when she encounters it. If you can't meet it, forget it. Her spider telepathy is still quite sensitive. Whenever there is crime nearby. Gwen can basically sense it. But if you can't save it, forget it. Counter is useless. But Gwen remembered something else. Then Banner's sister died just like that. Is the rescue effective? So he shook his head while eating the food. Shot in the heart. What's the use of resuscitating? Ah, then he is quiet. But he called me and asked me how to do it. I asked him to feed his blood to his blood-related sister. It didn't take long for the female Hulk to appear. Wonder, female Hulk. Wonder froze. 
She and Gwen started wondering what a female Hulk would be like at the same time. Male Hulk is so strong, female Hulk can't be strong too. And Su Yi knew what the female Hulk looked like, so he smiled mysteriously. When the time comes, you'll know when you go and have a look. Hurry up, maybe it will be enough in two days. Good. Compared to the appearance of a female Hulk, on setting, female Hulk's ability is higher than Banner's. Banner had taken that long to integrate himself with the Hulk's will, but the female Hulk is fine in a few days. The difference is quite a lot. Wait until lunch is over. Wanda and Gwen took the dishes back to Washington. Then Wanda practiced daily. Gwen's words depend on the situation. Anyway, she doesn't have much vacation time. She has to go to college next week. But wait until Wanda and Gwen leave. Ling turned her head, looked at Su Yi and said, Master, Wanda and Miss Gwen are already in their menstrual period. According to calculations, they will return to normal in three five days. Su Yi Wu also said at the same time, Master, Tonight you can find Miss Hala or us to spend time and release your needs. Dancers can serve the master at any time and any place. Any time, any place, super detective, recognize it Tilda. Hear things like this. So Yi stroked his forehead helplessly. The dancer's calculation was right. Gwen and Wanda's biological schedules are really aligned. That's the case. His bastard is really going to suffer. Kanunu has no land to plow. So Yi thinks about it. Then he looked at the twin dancers who served him wholeheartedly. How to say, this pen dot 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 it's time to use it. So Yi thought about it. I can only nod and say, let's talk about it tonight. The twin dancers nodded, and then returned to their original positions with the hands of the ballerina behind their backs. So Yi looked at them at this moment. Only then did he find out. It turned out that the twin dancers were not motionless when they stood there. Their crotch on the stressed side will rotate from side to side like a human. That is, when the left foot is stressed, the crotch is turned to the left. When the right foot is stressed, although the hip is to the right. In this way, the line of their vests will also be sideways. Tilda. Are they metal? How can the details be so good? Oh yes. They are now a better material than nanometals. Oh well. Tonight he will try these two fountain pens 267. It's 1 p.m. It will be done in half a day. At the same time, inside the Avengers base, after several hours of physical examination, Natasha Romanoff told Banner, Jenny's vital signs are now completely stable, even healthier than most of the world. Just. Banner hurriedly asked. Just what? Natasha Romanoff handed the tablet to Banner to look at. Banner took it over and took a look. The picture above clearly shows that Jenny's eyes have turned green. And even the new millimeter of hair that has grown at the bottom of her hair has turned green too. If there is one, it may not be conspicuous. But one layer is like this, you can see it at a glance as long as you straighten your hair. Banner continued to scroll down. Also saw Jenny's cytology and blood tests. The end result is basically the same as Banner. At this time, Banner suddenly remembered Su Yi's words. The Hulk family is going to be too. That is to say, Jenny will become a female Hulk. Only then did Banner react. Natasha Romanoff nodded. Yes, take Banner as the essence of a scientist. He was not excited, but carefully thought about the pros and cons. Bad thing. 1. I don't know what Jenny's daughter Hulk will look like. 2. Jenny will definitely not be able to go back to her normal life. 3. No, just the above two disadvantages. Advantages. Let's not talk about it, Ridgui. At least the future threat to life is gone. Thinking of this, Banner heaved a sigh of relief, nodded and said in relief. Fortunately, at least Jenny is back. Natasha Romanoff agrees with this statement. No matter what, the life of the family is the most important. It's better to be alive than anything else. Because apart from turning Jenny into a female Hulk, there is no other way in this world to keep Jenny, who was dying at that time, alive. So it's not bad. For it, at this time, Jenny, who had just slept, woke up from the bed. She opened her eyes. Then he looked around in confusion. Where is this? Banner stepped forward and explained. This is the Avengers base. Jenny nodded, covered her head with her hands and recalled. Next moment, a flood of memories floods the brain. Jenny reacted with a shock. I won the relationship with the girl who was persecuted by the gang. Then I got shot. Did I die? Banner shook his head. No, Jenny, you're not dead, you're alive. Question mark why? Jenny looked at her heart. Didn't I get shot in the heart? At the last moment, I could still feel so cold. Banner fell silent. He exchanged glances with Natasha Romanoff, then nodded. Jenny, believe it or not. You may dot 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 become a female Hulk in the future. 0.00.0. Ha? Dot. 162. Check in multiple times. The ultimate eraser. What Imbo want? After explanations by Banner and Natasha Romanoff, Jenny at the moment held a mirror and looked at her own face. In the mirror, her eyes turned green. She was parting her hair, which had grown a layer of green hair. The color is probably pine green. Kind of like the green of a pine tree. But the problem is, I'm going to be a Hulk. Jenny looked at herself, imagining what she would look like in the future with a little disgust on her face. A. Um. Ah. Banner thought about the modified sentence, and finally thought for a while. It's a female Hulk, to be precise. You are a female Hulk now. As long as you have rage, you can become a female Hulk. But you can also integrate with Hulk like I did, 
and then you will be able to control it freely. After Banner finished speaking, Natasha Romanoff also nodded and said, So you'd better cooperate with the inspection in the base during this time. We have customized a super sports bra and super sports pants for you, so that you can keep your clothes when you transform. After you can freely control Hulk, you can return to a normal life. Jenny nodded in agreement. But the problem is, she was afraid that she would be ugly after becoming a female Hulk. Women. Which woman would dislike herself for being beautiful? And which woman would wish to be ugly? Certainly not. So Jenny is only worried about becoming ugly now. Can I try transforming now? Jenny asked. This problem. Banner and Natasha Romanoff thought about it. Natasha Romanoff nodded. Okay, but let's change into custom clothes first. Jenny's already in good shape and couldn't be more fun. There is really no problem at all trying to transform now. So the three came to the training room. Jenny went and changed into a super stretchy outfit. It is probably two pieces of clothing like women's boxing. One is a corset, multi-layered, with the clavicle exposed on the top and the belly below. One is shorts, which are also multi-layered. There is a pair of shorts inside and a layer of sports shorts on the outside. That's all. Jenny began to try to transform herself first. Artilda. She tried to yell or a sudden burst of movement, but without exception, it doesn't work. Jenny looked at Banner and asked, how did you transform before? Banner thought for a while, stimulated. Natasha Romanoff analyzed it. Maybe you haven't experienced the feeling of forced transformation. Maybe you can try passive forced transformation. In this way, you can take the initiative to transform after you knows this feeling. Jenny thought about it. Will it hurt? Banner took a breath. It should be a little bit, question mark. After a while, Jenny looked a little confused at the strong restraints that bound her hands and feet. Can I dot 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 can I stay the same? Natasha Romanoff binds Jenny's hands and feet, including the waist, thighs, and even the back of the neck. He took out the electric shock equipment and said, It's all tied up, try it? Banner explained from the side. It's because you, Rage, won't be able to control yourself to destroy everywhere in the future, and I can't control my emotions after I first transform. So after tying you up, you can increase your safety to the greatest extent, and it will have no effect on you. Natasha Romanoff, who was adjusting the shocker, also explained. The recliner under you can withstand hundreds of tons of tension. Each of the restrained belts on your body can withstand the pulling force of six figures of tonnage. Don't worry Jenny, you won't get hurt. With the assurance of Banner and Natasha Romanoff, Jenny also closed her eyes and waited for the stimulation. The electric shock device in Natasha Romanoff's hand can freely adjust the degree of electric shock. For the sake of Jenny's first time, Natasha Romanoff adjusted to roughly knock out the dog. This level is not too high but not too low. Natasha Romanoff showed Banner the voltage. Banner took a look. This voltage will not hurt as usually even if nothing happens. So Natasha Romanoff took the taser and went to Jenny. Then press on her thigh. Zilla Tilda. After being shocked by a sudden electric shock, Jenny's eyes widened immediately. Where has she received electric shocks since she was a child? So Jenny's green pupils shrank suddenly, and then suddenly returned to their original positions. And along with it is, raw Tilda degrees. Jenny's yelling. With Jenny's panicked cry, her body expands rapidly. Zilla Tilda. Some of the restrained belts were torn instantly. Then Jenny continued to grow a little bigger. Then the skin on my body also started to turn pine green. After a while, Zilla, accompanied by another tearing sound, Jenny's size turned into a maximum situation. Banner frowned intently. As long as Jenny happens rage, he will step forward to stop it. With his long experience, that's sure to keep Jenny in check. And Natasha Romanoff was a little nervous. Hulk doesn't have an easy one. Once you start going crazy, that must have been no small disaster. But what the two of them didn't expect was that Jenny, who turned into a Hulk, turned to look at the two of them, then asked strangely, Then what? Then what? You ask us? Banner looked at Jenny and reminded, Jenny, you have become a Hulk. What? Jenny immediately looked at her hands, as expected. Her skin turned green, and the hands get bigger. It seems like my whole body has grown a bit bigger. Jenny wanted to come down and have a look. The result was trapped by the restraint belt. She looked down. The belt around the waist is broken. Only the ankles and wrists have changed little. All straps are unbroken. When Natasha Romanoff saw it, she stepped forward and untied all the straps. Then Jenny went to the mirror and looked at herself. How to say, green hair, green skin, green eyes, green lips. Everything is green. Jenny reached out and ruffled her hair. Still fluffy big waves. She looked at herself and thought for a moment. Banner asked a little nervously from the side. Jenny, how do you feel about yourself? Jenny looked at her appearance. It's okay. Out of 100, I give myself 81.17. But what Banner actually wants to ask is, how is Jenny doing? Natasha Romanoff looked up at Jenny from the sidelines. Before the transformation, Jenny was 1.7 meters, and after the transformation, Jenny was at least 2 meters. This is directly 30 centimeters taller. How's your body? Natasha Romanoff asked. Jenny squeezed her fist when she heard it. I feel like I have limitless power. Have a test? No problem. The three went to the physical examination area. While on the road, Banner said to Jenny, You survived, fortunately. Sue came out and asked me to drink my own blood for you, so that you can become a Hulk, otherwise you will die. 
So when everything is done, you have to go with me to thank Sue, understand? Oh, by the way, Sue is the psychiatrist you saw that day, and we actually know each other. Jenny was taken aback. It turns out that my cousin still knows Dr. Sue. No wonder Banner talked about it that day. In addition, I also have a lot of insights that I want to chat with Su Yi. So Jenny nodded decisively. Okay. At the same time, Su Yi who has been fishing all day. Off work. The time is 1 to 5 in the afternoon. Su Yi took the twin dancers out of the house on time, and then came to the door, and finally thought, clock in. Ding successful check in tilde. After checking in, Su Yi continued to check the rewards that he hadn't checked before. Acquire critical strike, true what imbo 1 dex 1. Obtain, phoenix force fragment x 10. Acquire. Titan full set of manga x1. Get critical strike, ultimate eraser x1. Acquire, Naruto complete manga x1. Colon. After looking at all the harvest, Su Yi first absorbed the phoenix force. Then I flipped through two comics. Definitely, no matter which comic book I got this time, there are quite a lot, so Su Yi flipped through the first volume and put it back in the space. The remaining two things are the most important. One is the real Watimbo wand. One is the ultimate eraser. The former is equipment. The latter is a prop. Let's talk about the former first. Watimbo wand. After absorbing energy, it can be released in any way such as healing, prophecy, defense, attack, etc. According to the user's thoughts. That is, this wand is an all-purpose wand. It is dedicated to magician. So Yi took it out and looked at it. The top and bottom of the wand are the same, with a spiral rod in the middle and one at each end like the head of a little horned beast. In appearance, it can only be said to be quite satisfactory. But it is widely used. It can be said that it is definitely not a loss for the magician to hold it. So Yi nodded, and put the wand back. This kind of rubbish. Ahem, such a baby. Just throw it to wonder when the time comes. I can't use it myself. In fact, the most precious in this lottery is a lighter. Next moment, as soon as Su Yi took it from the sky, he took out a silver lighter with blue light. Its appearance is unremarkable. It looks like a lighter. About a palm file size. It looks like a product of technology. But in fact, he is the Marvel artifact that can kill multiple gods. The ultimate wiper. That is what Tanmai wants in the comics to kill the bugs in her body. But in the end she was stopped by her father. And it is the ultimate eraser. Ultimate eraser. It can destroy or create any target chosen by the owner to destroy. The stronger the will of the user the more powerful this weapon will be. Su Yi is very clear about this artifact. It's really famous in the multi-universe. Don't talk about hooking up to Thanos. Even the five gods want to run away when they see the ultimate eraser aiming at them. Know it. They didn't even dare to run, because the ultimate eraser can choose a target to attack. So being pointed at by it, you have to beg for mercy. At the same time, the greatest power of the ultimate eraser is far more than killing the five gods. But if your will is strong enough, it can even destroy a multi-universe dimension outright. It is to remove one layer of the entire multi-universe framework. Definitely. The consequences of using it are also serious. Under normal circumstances, users will suffer huge amounts of backlash, like when the infinite gems came together. The higher the damage you hit, the damage you eat will be higher. But don't forget, so he is a phoenix force that is almost immortal as long as the energy is sufficient. So this artifact is for him. So good with spicy. The province used ability to call back and forth. Fight later. Take out the lighter and hit you. Gaba. You will die. The five gods are no exception. Definitely. It's still a little underwhelming in front of the life court. But it does not matter. The ultimate eraser was also used by Su Yi to beat the five gods and these mobs. Not a big problem. Next, Su Yi put away his lighter. Then I went upstairs. At the moment Wanda is still practicing spells in the small universe. After sensing Su Yi's arrival, Wanda opened her eyes, but she was just about to say something. I saw Su Yi throwing a staff. Dot dot hum. Wanda took the staff and looked at it. Then I recalled it. This staff. I seem to have seen it in Kamartaj. Su Yi nodded walked to Wanda and sat down. Then he put his arms around her waist and said, That's not as good as this one, it's genuine, you can try it later. Wanda nodded, but he felt the big hands making trouble around his waist. Wanda whispered shyly, Dot. Um, my and Gwen's menstrual periods have arrived together, you can't toss about these days, question mark. So Yi pretended to be surprised and regretful, but at the same time, he put his hand in very intimately, put his palm on Wanda's belly to warm up and said softly, then are you in pain, a little, feel the temperature of the big hand, Wanda narrowed her eyes comfortably and muttered, but now it's warm and, see, it is useful to put a hot water bottle on the stomach to keep warm, you said that, the goddess still hates you, that means the goddess doesn't like you, because if the goddess likes you, everything you say is right, well, that should be it, actually we don't know either, after Sully warmed his palms to comfort him for a while, he asked again, it's such a coincidence that you two came together, what should I do? Wanda shuddered when she heard that. She thought about it. He reached out and shook his hand, and then opened his mouth. Oh Tilda, Su Yi understood, but, just relying on these, are you sure you can hold it? Wanda closed her eyes and whispered, okay, isn't this still Gwen? She has a bad mouth. That's what it says, but Su Yi felt unrealistic. After all, 
We were happy together before, but the two proposed by Wanda are only happy for Su Yi. Wanda and Gwen are unhappy, so this is purely one-sided. This is not equal, but Su Yi thought about it, but there was no good way. So he agreed. Then you and Gwen will be miserable. Wanda's body trembled. She was really scared. Night. Everyone finished their dinner. Then Su Yi took Gwen and Wanda to the small universe to enjoy the evening breeze. But Su Yi remembered one thing. So he said to Gwen, By the way, Gwen, an evil god will appear in Egypt in two days. I will send you there. Just kill a crocodile god. Although Gwen didn't know the details, she nodded. Whatever it is. Su Yi threw her over, and it was enough for her to finish killing with Wash Wang. Then go home. Gradually, the time came to night. Seeing that the twin dancers didn't come to find herself and wander, Gwen asked curiously. Why didn't the dancers come to us for yoga today? Heard the words. Wanda immediately gave Gwen a roll of eyes. Do you still do yoga during your menstrual period? All right. Gwen finally realized. When Su Yi saw it, Gwen didn't even feel it. Girls who don't have aunt pain are so lucky. Su Yi just turned around. He just saw Wanda applying lipstick to herself. Um? Su Yi was taken aback. What are you wearing lipstick for? Wanda. Wanda's lipstick is red. It is the kind of bright red. Queen red. Very bright. And Wanda didn't speak. She lowered her head, lifted up Su Yi's cloak, then took a sip on his washboard. Immediately, a lip print appeared on Su Yi's abdomen. Tilda. See here. Su Yi's heart suddenly broke down. He never thought about it. Am I obsolete? Dot. 163. Thanos attacks Midget. Cybertron intercepted in the middle. Watching Wanda's hair sink slowly, Su Yi couldn't help but fell on the recliner, and then see who asked. Wanda. Where did you learn this trick? Uck. Wanda didn't have time to talk. But Gwen pulled out a book and said, Sue, round here. Su Yi turned his head and looked at Geneva. He really learned it from comics. They want to beat me by learning skills from the manga they gave me. Um, dreaming. Su Yi took a deep breath. She sinks into the dungeon, immovable like a mountain. The Yellow Emperor's Canon of Internal Medicine naturally has the principles of the Yellow Emperor's Canon of Internal Medicine. If the Yellow Emperor would easily lose, how did he soar? So Su Yi will never lose. But what she didn't expect was, after Gwen reads it, she puts away the comic book and starts to help out in times of injustice. Ah this, Su Yi frowned slightly. This is broken. They all sucked Su Yi's skills like they learned the magic of sucking stars. A person seems to be making trouble, but also uses the star absorbing method. Broken. Su Yi thought to himself that he would suffer a loss today. He really didn't expect it. The two teamed up on the fighting machine to be so strong, and the two work well together. There is no room for Su Yi to relax. This battle, hanging, that's all. The time came to near dark night. Wanda and Gwen Mingjin withdrew their troops. Seeing Su Yi panting, the two went back to sleep full of satisfaction, and Su Yi rested on the recliner for a while, looking at the moon in the sky, looking at the stars in the sky. Su Yi still didn't understand. He would be swallowed and ended peacefully with a 50-50 split. Reminiscing about the departure of Wanda and Gwen, Su Yi felt that this was a defeat. The two women were able to go back to sleep in a normal posture. This is not a defeat what is this? And Su Yi also realized it. This is most likely the reason for my lack of exercise. Because the new skills Wanda and Gwen are using are so advanced. He has never experienced it. Grandmas, it seems that I have to train myself more in the future. Big shame. But at the moment, Tita Tilda, a message came from Su Yi's cell phone. He picked it up and saw that it was Natasha Romanoff's message. Natasha Romanoff, just now Captain America received news in the middle of the night that the King of Wakanda. Black Panther Kala, fell ill, fall sick, etc. Su Yi reacted at this moment. Didn't Black Panther die after Avengers Alliance 4? Why is it also advanced to the 643 timeline of Avengers Alliance 3? Last time it was Ant-Man. This time it's Black Panther. Then this is, is the result of multi-universe chaos. Su Yi recalled that once the multi-universe is chaotic, the timeline will be chaotic. And this happens to be the case now. That is, now the multi-universe is really messed up. Su Yi, dead? Natasha Romanoff. Not yet, but has fallen into a coma, and the reason cannot be found out. So ye, what about the follow-up? Natasha Romanoff, there was a small amount of chaos inside Wakanda, and Captain America stood in the ranks of Black Panther's sister, including layers. So ye, so, Natasha Romanoff, yes, Captain America may want to use the power of Wakanda to reverse the world's situation and perception of superheroes. After all, Wakanda's technological power is 100 years ahead of the Earth. Are ah, this, Su Yi actually didn't think so much, because he cares about his business? But as Natasha Romanoff said, Su Yi can only admire Captain America. This is the unyielding warrior. Actually thought of changing the situation of superheroes through the power of Wakanda. How do you say this? Su Yi replied two words. Su Yi, warrior. Natasha Romanoff, I think so too. Forget it, let's not talk about it. As long as Captain America joins Wakanda. He will be dismissed as an Avenger by default. It's up to him to decide. I'm going to bed. Goodbye.
To Yi, goodbye. After turning off the phone, To Yi can now confirm that this multi-universe is really chaotic. Captain America joins Wakanda. Isn't that an Oreo? That's okay too. This kind of plot that only appears in what if actually appeared in the real universe. Add to that the discovery of Ant-Man and the early death of Black Panther. To Yi is sure, the multi-universe is messed up. Maybe anything will happen in the future. Never mind. To Yi looked at his lipstick covered Nunu. He snapped his fingers to clean up first, snap tilde, then he put on his pants and said, whatever it is, I'll chat if there are beauties, and if there are no beauties, I'll fish, wouldn't it be beautiful, there are girls who look at girls, and there are girls who don't have girls, and tilde, at the same time, in the deep space of the universe, the third spiral arm is the Orion spiral arm, this can only be regarded as the outskirts of the Milky Way, cosmic minerals Jenishi like, you can only pick up junk when you come here to mine, but the next moment, three giant flagships and countless battleships began to jump over step by step. After a while, there are tens of thousands of warships with large file sizes and small ones parked in this star field. However, there are only three giant flagships. There are only a few hundred or so large warships. But this is still not to be underestimated. In the past cosmic forces, these warships are enough to rub the Nova Empire, the Kerry Empire, and the Skrull Empire back and forth. Why? Just because the name of these warships is called... Legion of Thanos, and their master is none other than Thanos. Looking at the three full legions he brought, there is a hint of deep obsession in Thanos' calm eyes. He stood in front of the space glass of a flagship, closely watching the nine realms of Midgard, or the position of the solar system. And behind him stood Corvus Glaive, General Proxima Midnight, and General Ebony Maw. Saw Thanos brooding. Ebony Maw said forward, Master Thanos, as long as you get the two gems in Midgard, no one will be able to stop you again. Hear the words of Ebony Moore. Thanos raised his hand and looked at the only soul gem on his infinity gauntlet. During the period of military expansion, the duel had an effect on him. One of the biggest effects is that the will is affected a bit erratically. Sometimes, he thought it would be a good to kill them all. Sometimes, he will also think about stud directly, and kill all the life in the entire universe. But the more I think so, the orange light in his eyes became brighter and brighter. Thanos closes his eyes. After opening it again, the light in the depths was reduced a lot the solar system that Thanos looks at again. Then he ordered coldly, let the entire fleet prepare for the jump again, this time jumping directly to the vicinity of Midgard. Ebony more solemnly nodded in agreement. Yes, me tamping, soon. All warships are ready to jump again, and all coordinates are ready. Immediately afterwards, as the engines of the battleship group started, the leap is really beginning. The first to jump is the flagship. With the start of the flagship engine, Thanos' flagship flew towards the open space gap. But also after going in for a while, Ebony Moore's face changed. It looked at the alarm and range on the star map and said quickly, Master Thanos, there is a powerful warp disruptor near Midgard. It threw our warp position far away from Midgard. We can't get close to the Midgard galaxy. With Ebony Moore reporting, the flagship has drilled in. Proxima Midnight reminded, it's too late. It's too late. Then after a while, Thanos first crashed into the jump interrupter barrier in the solar system during the period. Then it was squeezed out by the powerful force of space. For a moment, everyone is unsteady as the flagship shakes violently. Wait until the flagship is squeezed out. Even many instruments have been damaged. Proxima Midnight got up and said angrily, How could Midget have a warp disruptor? It's a space blockade technology. How could a suburban Midget have one? Ancient One Magician is long dead. With the fury of Proxima Midnight, Ebony Moore looked at the solar system that was close at hand. He reminds Thanos after he levitates and lands. Master Thanos, all warships will go through this process later. And whoever installed this instrument in Midgard must have known of our arrival. I suggest waiting until the Legion is fully assembled, don't count the losses, and march directly into the solar system. As expected, Ebony Moore just finished speaking. The warships of the Thanos Legion began to migrate over one after another. But they also hit the space barrier of the jump disruptor. Then it was squeezed over by the powerful force of space. But more and more warships are coming over. CBBJ while they are being squeezed out, also began to collide violently, boom, boom, for a while, the universe released hundreds of fireworks without sound, wait until Thanos's legions are all here, just because of this warp disruptor, Thanos lost one tenth of his total force, Thanos looked deeply at the solar system, in front of him is Pluto, but it was just a warp disruptor that made him lose so many outstanding fighters in vain, Thanos looked at his menacing gloves, if there is a space gem, then none of this will happen, they can even warp directly onto Midgard, otherwise, how did the Thanos Legion in the 3rd and 4th Avengers Alliance directly reach the Earth? It's not because the Earth doesn't have a defense plus early warning device like a jump disruptor, so Thanos can come and go when he wants, but it doesn't work now. Now there's Cybertron. But after seeing that the Legion has lost one tenth before the battle, the orange light in Thanos' eyes grew stronger and stronger. He took a deep breath. He ordered in a calmer and crazier tone, Attack me, Midgard. Ebony Moore nodded. Then immediately the whole army ordered, Activate the battleship, Target. Midget, and at the moment's Cybertron star, 
The moment Thanos' flagship triggers the space barrier of the solar system, the planet Cybertron starts. Alert! Moment. The surface of Cybertron erected a large number of laser weapons towards space. This weapon is not afraid of the gravity of the atmosphere, and it has a great range. Single target attack power is super high, although it consumes energy. Is the current U-boat lacking in energy? Infinite Gems ability harvesting technology has been in the works for a long time. The infinite energy stored by Cybertron should not be too much. They only lack precious metal minerals, but definitely no shortage of energy. At the same time, the shape-shifting King Kong army far in the depths of the universe has also received orders. Originally, only the Optimus Legion needed to come back. However, as countless warships hit the space barrier of the solar system, Cybertron immediately recalled the two legions outside at the same time. That is to say, the Bajan Legion is also back. At the moment, the starport is constantly accepting the return of the Legion. And the returning Legion is except for the transport ship to dump the minerals. All battleships don't even need supplies. Line up directly to the periphery of the planet Cybertron. Gradually, with the return of starport, more and more battleships are coming. The Elders and Collectors are back too. Their warships are at the forefront of the Legion. Collector looked at the alarm message in surprise. This is a Legion attack whose legion will come to the solar system. Yes, whose legion has nothing to do to come to the solar system. Even the fugitives from the original Skrull Empire were forced to run to the Earth. Otherwise, who will come to Earth? But the point is that this time more than one person came. Still came with a large army. Collector looked at the number of legions and said, There are at least three legions here. Veterans, we must organize a counterattack. If the opponent is an enemy, we will attack directly at the end. Of course, shapeshifting King Kong on a 10,000 meter transport ship. All 20 veterans have turned into Star Destroyer mode. With their current Star Destroyer power, not surprisingly, basically, most planets are a one-shot thing, that's all. In a short period of time, Starport constantly takes back the fleet. Then the transport ship goes back to deliver supplies, and the warships turned around and lined up to stand by, and a vote has passed unanimously. It was found that the opponent activated the propulsion engine to enter the solar system, and directly annihilated the opponent's main core. 1000 colon zero. Not surprisingly, this vote passed unanimously. Why? Because Cybertron has set up a space barrier in the solar system. This is to tell everyone. The solar system is not allowed to enter, or be allowed to enter only after being approved, because this is the home planet of shapeshifting King Kong, Cybertron, so shapeshifting King Kong will never allow any fleet to enter the solar system. On the other side, if you can't jump in, you have to push the propeller in. Need to say, either you are hostile, I will directly annihilate them first, either you are shabby and don't listen, then even if you are a good fleet, you should still fight. Shapeshifting Kim just now won't choose to forgive you for your ignorance. What are you thinking? Whoever comes in hits who? Over time, three legions of Thanos have entered the outer reaches of the solar system, and began to approach Midgard. That is the Earth. But, there is another planet beyond the Earth. It used to be called Mars, and now it's called, Cybertron Star. After a period of sailing, the Thanos fleet approaches Cybertron. Displayed via remote projection, Ebony Moore observed, then was completely stunned. He opened his eyes to Thanos. Master Thanos shapeshifting King Kong's home planet. Right next to Midgard. What? Thanos was originally so calm, but he couldn't believe it after hearing this. They have been looking for so long for the shapeshifting Vajra Mother Star but they couldn't find it. It turned out to be found in this shitty outskirts of the universe. Why? Why does shapeshifting King Kong press the parent star here? Why don't they go to higher resource planets? Why are they so close to Midgard? Is it a coincidence? Not intentional. Next moment. In projection observations at Ebony Moor, a dazzling light suddenly came out from the periphery of Cybertron. Ebony Moor reacted instantly. Fleet dispersed. Immediately after hearing Ebony Moore's order, the fleet began to disperse. Ebony Moore also asked at the same time, Master Thanos, the shapeshifting King Kong civilization is near Midgard. If we want to attack Midgard, we will definitely encounter the shapeshifting King Kong army. Should we fight or withdraw? When Corvus Clay I've heard it, he said immediately, fighting. Proxima Midnight shouted the same, fighting. But they had only just finished speaking. Twenty dazzling beams of light arrived at their fleet in an instant. Tilda. For a moment, the three legions of Thanos Legion were all blown away by the energy fluctuations, and one of the three flagships disappeared in an instant. Thanos took a look, his eyes glowing orange. He immediately ordered in a low voice, attack. At the same time, at the moment of discovering Thanos Legion, there is also a sentence in all shapeshifting King Kong channels, all shapeshifting King Kong, attack, 164. Instant War, Legion of Thanos vs Legion of Shapeshifting King Kong, Thanos hadn't figured it out until now. Why does Shapeshifting King Kong make a home in this shitty place? So many high value regions in the universe, doesn't Shapeshifting King Kong need resources? Why not occupy high value sector? Thanos doesn't understand. But they've matched up, Tilda. First, 
the 20 ray salvos of the shape-shifting King Kong veterans, 20 terrifying laser beams thousands of meters thick passed between the three legions of Thanos in an instant, boom boom tilde, hundreds of battleships were instantly wiped out, even more than half of one of the three flagships was destroyed, soldiers of Thanos legion in need flew out of that little half left, then be frozen to death by the temperature of the universe, as for other warships, under this intensity of laser light, the warship will not be broken into pieces, not even ashes will be left behind, it's just that Thanos army is scattered enough. 20 laser beams with a thickness of nearly 10,000 meters are only 20 laser pointers when viewed from a distance in the environment of the universe. So this single weapon, it is impossible to annihilate an entire star field directly after a salvo. There are still plenty of remaining Thanos legions out there. 20 laser salvos. The number of legions eliminated is not as much as that of space barriers. Attack immediately afterwards. With Thanos command to attack, all warships are flying towards the shape-shifting King Kong Mother Star. Both sides are in view at the moment. It can be said that this is the middle goal. Double-sided direct face-to-face -face bombardment. The shape-shifting King Kong elders also ordered at the same time. All shape-shifting King Kong strike. Although shouting like this, all the shapeshifting King Kong received another command. Use the volley of the elders as the clarion call for attack. Collector only heard the first one, but didn't hear the second one, because the second message uses the communication technology built into the body of the shapeshifting King Kong, rather than relying on external communications. So Collector doesn't know, as expected, when the Collector heard the offensive order but no one did it. Um, Collector was stunned. He turned his head to look at the shapeshifting King Kong army around him. Neither the red-dominated Optimus Legion nor the blue-dominated Bashan Legion have any intention of moving. Instead, he was ready to go as if waiting for something. But isn't the command to attack issued? What are they waiting for? While Collector was in a daze, suddenly, there is a shining light behind him. Even if the light comes from behind, it also makes Collector feel extremely dazzling. Collector was shocked. He knows. He knows what the shape-shifting King Kong army is waiting for. In a state of excitement, Collector looked back with difficulty, as expected. The surface of the planet Cybertron is already full of shape-shifting King Kong veterans. They line up from across Cybertron to this end. Then the whole group becomes a Star Destroyer. All the muzzles also shine with gathered light. Very scary, more than 900 rays of light. There is only one sentence in Collector's mind. Fire covered. More than 20 channels are useless right? Then put you closer. Then do it again with more than 40 times more than before. Energy consumption horror? Shapeshifting King Kong lacks energy? What a joke. They have infinite gems. That's fire coverage. After seeing these dazzling lights, the Thanos army who just killed them also realized it. Scatter. With Ebony Moore's channel conductor, all warships began to disperse urgently. But laser flight is faster. Tilda. First, 10 laser beams shoot out. Then the lasers are constantly fired row by row. That is to say, more than 900 lasers are not covered all at once. It's layer by layer. In this way, although there are more fish that slip through the net, the large battleships are not instantly wiped out by the laser group. But, wouldn't direct dense coverage be better? Why is that? Collector is a little confused. Computational way of shapeshifting King Kong. They must be able to calculate the best strike ideas. Why do you shoot like this? And one round of salvo on the left. One round of salvo on the right. Why is that? Collector is a little confused. He looked back. Then you will understand instantly. Tilda. Under the watchful eyes of Collector, another round of Salvo is launched. But all the same, the planet Cybertron actually retreated a little because of this Salvo. Collector didn't notice at first. But when the other side shoots again, the ball just swung from side to side. Only here does the Collector understand. It's because the recoil of the Senator's volley is too great. Dozens of Salvos can deflect the orbit of Cybertron. So you have to use the Salvo from the other side to square it back. If only Cybertron was originally Mars. And Mars isn't that big at all. It doesn't take much planet engine to push at all. What's more? Dozens of volleys fired together, so the elders have to shoot multiple volleys in batches. What if more than 900 Star Destroyer cannons fired together? The aftermath. It is estimated that the recoil force can tear up the Cybertron star, at the very least. The floating continent of Cybertron must be smashed down, so it's the right thing to do. Collector also understood at this time. It's because I didn't think carefully enough. He only cared about maximizing firepower, but I didn't expect what the consequences of doing this would be. If it is true that more than 900 Star Destroyer cannons are fired, that's really 1000 kills and 800 damage. And compared to the waiting shapeshift in King Kong army, not so good on the other side. Boom 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 tilde. With the continuous salvo of Star Destroyer cannon, at first Thanos Legion thought these attacks would be few and far between. Between, ah, one round, two rounds, three rounds, ten rounds, twenty rounds, thirty rounds. Wait until the end of forty Doron. Thanos has switched from a flagship to a battleship, and the three largest flagships have long since disappeared under this kind of carpet blow. At most, there will be some unshot wreckage left. 
but what about Legion? After 40 duolan salvos, the three legions and tens of thousands of warships have been directly reduced by more than half. Thanos looked back at the fleet. All scattered in the universe are the wreckage and debris of warships. There are more wrecks than battleships. Thanos clenched his fist and weapon. The soul in his eyes shines brightly. An unstoppable rage made Thanos order the charge. And Ebony Moore looked. According to the normal situation, more than half of this kind of battle damage must be evacuated. Because you are the attacker. You can't fight each other to the end. And the opponent has the confidence to fight to the end. But Ebony Moore knew it too. After this failure. There will be no chance to fight the shape-shifting King Kong civilization again. Because this time it is already Thanos' expanded army. Even if you go back, you can expand. Also miscellaneous soldiers. This is not even qualified to stand in front of the shape-shifting King Kong civilization. So, this war must be fought even if it is damaged. Not to mention Thanos has said charge. So the next moment, more than 3,000 warships charge towards the shape-shifting King Kong civilization. And shape-shifting Donkey Kong isn't much of a thing either. Attack. For a moment, the battleship starts to confront head-on. Shape-shifting King Kong transformation directly into the space fighter mode to fight. For a while, 2,000 shapeshifting King Kongs have been transformed into space fighters and inserted into the battlefield. The warships also began to bombard each other's warships. This is the most powerful firepower. At the moment, General King Blade of Thanos Legion and General Proxima Midnight each lead a fleet to attack. And Field Commander Ebony Moore found out. Master Thanos. The shape-shifting King Kong army has expanded to two. Yes, the red and blue armies on the battlefield can be seen at a glance. This number is obviously wrong. At least double that of the previous one. And in a huge blue portal in the far distance, battleships and shape-shifting King Kong fighters are still being spit out. But General Wang Ren disdained it. We are already close to each other and they will not have the laser weapons just now. We have over 4,000 warships, and the warships of the shape-shifting King Kong civilization are much less than ours. We should attack fast. Ebony Moore thought about it, too. Duh. He always had a very uneasy feeling. Obviously, there are not many fleets in the shape-shifting King Kong civilization. But why do you feel that danger is coming? With the swarm of Thanos Legion, and the shape-shifting King Kong army goes head-to-head, -head. the legions of the two sides immediately fought a war. Warships bombard. Fighters roam. The two sides fought hard. The whole battlefield is in chaos. But soon Ebony Moore found out, although the warships of the shape-shifting King Kong civilization are not as many as the Thanos Legion, but the fighters of the shape-shifting King Kong civilization are all elites. The spaceships and fighter planes here are all being hit, and the opponent's battleship is also better than here. It is often my own side that hits the opponent with a single shot and survives, but the other party fired back and immediately exploded here. Nemas, the hardware and software are all incomparable. Only in numbers is Thanos Legion superior. Ebony Moore looked serious. But this, it's not that you can't fight, it's just that it may end up in a desperate situation. But, the Thanos Legion has no retreat either. This battle can only be fought to the end, as the war started. This star field immediately began a huge firepower interaction. Sparks light up in the universe, but generally there are more Thanos Legions and less shapeshifting King Kong Legions. But even so, the number of warships of the shapeshifting King Kong Legion is not as many as Thanos 3 Legions, so it looks like it's evenly matched. The shapeshifting King Kong Legion can't crush three expanded Thanos Legions at once. The battlefield seems to be very tense, even if the battle loss ratio is high. But with such a large number of supports, the battlefield situation is not clear. But at this moment, after the starport outside Cybertron emitted a burst of blue light again, dot 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 asking for flowers, a giant beast with a height of 600 meters was teleported out. It is covered in obsidian-like armor. At the same time, the whole body exudes a coat like a flame, because Godzilla is really too conspicuous. So it was discovered by Thanos and others as soon as it appeared. What kind of creature is this? Proxima Midnight tasked in shock in the channel. There are very few creatures with a file size of several hundred meters in the universe. But once you have it, every strength will not be low. It is impossible to grow up so big by eating plain rice. And that layer of flame coat can be a special effect. Even Ebony Moore, who has learned a lot of knowledge, shook his head and said, Creatures never seen before. It doesn't matter if you haven't seen it. You will understand immediately, with Godzilla also through the portal of Starport. It looks back. Immediately saw the Thanos army fighting against the shapeshifting King Kong army. Godzilla immediately remembered Su Yi's words. Help shapeshifting King Kong fight? Shapeshifting King Kong will also help you cook delicious food, keep you, Cybertron and Shapeshifting King Kong are your other home. This sentence is correct. Godzilla hasn't fought a fight so far, but the Shapeshifting King Kongs have also been giving Godzilla infinite energy harvested from the Space Gem. Godzilla is full every day. You say Shapeshifting King Kong is good for it? Now the whole family has been beaten. Godzilla can bear it? Roar Tilda. Godzilla let out a roar immediately. This roar is originally without sound because the universe does not transmit sound. But under the brief spread of Godzilla's physical energy, many soldiers in the battlefield have heard it. They turned around, 
dot 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 zero. I saw a 600 meter giant creature rushing towards the battlefield with flames, and its dorsal fin keeps accumulating blue light upwards. Om tilde om um, om. Follow the blue light from the dorsal fin to reach the throat. Godzilla also flew into the battlefield. It opened its mouth wide and directed towards the opponent's camp. Do buzz tilde. Suddenly, a bright blue laser cut across the battlefield like a hot knife cutting butter. And Godzilla flips his head from left to right. This laser is directly thrown out of the space station in an arc to create a cutting like visual effect. With a blue laser across the battleship of Thanos Legion. Boom tilde. Boom tilde. Boom tilde. These warships were once exposed to blue lasers. It melts instantly and then explodes. A light flicked from left to right. Dozens of warships were directly swept away. And Godzilla can aim while spitting. It's not like the elders can only shoot at one point. Godzilla is drawing lines. Collector was extremely shocked when he saw this. This monster is a bit like the Tendian group. And Godzilla went down this round of lasers. Their warriors seen by Thanos Legion were stunned. What kind of monster is this? It shoots lasers from its mouth. It shoots lasers from its mouth. Run. Stop it. Don't run. Break it. That's all. Thanos expanded Legion wasn't fully executed. So some ran. Some rushed towards Godzilla instead. But Godzilla is afraid of these. Raw tilde. Godzilla roared. It directly improves the combustion efficiency of the black hole in the body. Then hit the opponent's battleship directly. Collector is stupid again. A 600 meter Godzilla hits a 1,000 meter warship. Some large warships even reach 2,000 meters. Is it possible to hit like this? In Collector's puzzled eyes, the result is obvious. Godzilla strikes in Saiyan form. Any battleship that comes into contact with it cannot hit Godzilla. As long as the two parties contact each other. Boom tilde. It must have been a battleship that exploded. Then Godzilla is like connecting dots to dots. It rammed directly towards the battleship. It doesn't make sense at all. Get out of the way. Get out of the way. This monster's skin is too thick. Boom it. Don't let it fly over. Where's the general? Let the general kill it. To the cries of soldiers of Thanos Legion, Godzilla is playing bumper cars on the battlefield like no man's land, and after a touch, he will stop and take a rest. Then directly launch a continuous blue superpower laser that can be aimed at. And the form of the battlefield changed instantly. The original array of Thanos Legion directly failed. What kind of formation can withstand Godzilla's rampage? What's more, some people run and some rush. Thanos Legion is straight up in total chaos. This looks silly to collector. The battlefield dot 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 is it still possible to fight like this? A Godzilla? smashing the three legions of Thanos directly, then if there is no countermeasure on the other side, Thanos legion is doomed, definitely, there's no way Thanos core can't do nothing, after seeing General Wang Ren and Proxima Midnight, together they consult Thanos directly, Master Thanos, let's deal with that monster, Thanos granted their request, dot, 165, Godzilla note, sweep the battlefield, breath Thanos, with Thanos agreeing to General King Blade and Proxima Midnight to join the battlefield, Ebony Moore also asked for instructions, Master Thanos, Two generals may not be enough, maybe I have to join. Thanos looked at Godzilla, still rampaging through the Legion. He nodded, also agreed to Ebony Moore's request. That's all. The three put on special equipment. Pilot your spaceship directly from the battleship towards Godzilla. Compared to fighting on land, the individual strength of sky combat is the most weakened. Most creatures are born on planets with gravity. Fighting is also where there is gravity to fight. And in space, a lot of combat power has been consumed. But they can't help it. If Godzilla can't be dealt with, the Thunder Extinguishing Army will undoubtedly lose. With the acceleration of the three spaceships, soon they came near Godzilla. And Godzilla is still on a rampage. It is full of soaring energy. All warships are one head at a time. And after discovering that there are three flights rushing towards him, Godzilla frowned. Caught death. Beep tilde beep tilde beep beep tilde. See Godzilla's dorsal fin light up. Ebony Moore just wanted to remind General Wang Blade and General Proxima Midnight in the channel. The result is the next moment, Godzilla's atomic breath has already been fired. Do buzz tilde, vast blue energy spurts out. General Wang Ren and General Proxima Midnight quickly drove the spaceship to the left and right to separate. They also just brushed aside to avoid the first breath. This is because the spaceship moves fast, and the two are also on guard in advance. But, Godzilla's breath can hit moving targets. So Godzilla shook his head, spray directly at the spaceship driven by Proxima Midnight. What? And when he saw the breath coming towards him immediately, Proxima Midnight knows that it's 600 160 spacecraft is not as fast as a laser, so she ejects right away. But the next moment, blue laser sweep, boom tilde, first the spaceship exploded, then Godzilla swept slightly, let the laser sweep over the Proxima Midnight Proxima Centauri directly with it, the moment the two touch each other, in the horrified eyes of Proxima Midnight, after atomic breath sweeps, Proxima Midnight didn't leave even ashes behind, it disappeared into the universe directly, General Wang Ren saw his wife reduced to ashes, he didn't yell, instead, 
he instantly turned his head and stared at Godzilla angrily, then speed up the spaceship and rush over, facing the galloping spaceship. Godzilla stopped breathing. Then wave your little fat claws, but the consequence of a large body must be slow movement, unless Godzilla reaches level single universe. Therefore, General Wang Ren piloted the spaceship and directly bypassed the big hand waved by Godzilla. Then it came to Godzilla's face in an instant. Lift your machete and cut it. Clang tilde, with a soundless spark sputtered. Wang Ren's approaching eyes immediately showed consternation. His weapons are the strongest in this group. Not far behind Thanos' double-edged sword. So far, there is nothing it can't cut. Not to mention steel. Even the strongest battleship shell can be cut by this knife. But when Godzilla's face was cut, bounced. In Wang Ren's astonishment, Godzilla waved his big hand again. The nearly 100 meter long hand whizzed past in space. This is obviously silent, but with great coercion. But before Godzilla's big hand is about to get close to General King Blade, its big hand suddenly stopped in the air and did not move. General Wang Ren was shocked again. He and Godzilla looked aside at the same time. Then it turned out that Ebony Moore was helping. At the moment Ebony Moore stretched out his hands, it turned out that he used psychokinesis to stop Godzilla's screaming minister. But blue blood started to come out of its nose. He looked quickly at Corvus Clay Ive. Eyes signify hurry up. That is, destroy a creature as big as Godzilla. Ebony Moore just can't stand it. So General Wang Ren carried the scimitar. I wanted to swing at Godzilla again. But at the moment, a huge black shadow opened up. General Wang Ren looked up. Godzilla had already opened his big mouth biting directly towards him. No, this time, in General Wang Ren's frightened eyes, Godzilla ate it into his mouth in one gulp. A tilde, but a corvus clay eye that enters Godzilla's mouth cannot die directly. He was like a human being actually held in his mouth. At the moment, General King Blade puts his hands on Godzilla's upper jaw, and his feet support Godzilla's lower jaw. It seems to want to open Godzilla's big mouth, but, Godzilla's dorsal fin lit up. It just charges up, then directly released a trace of atomic breath. Raw tilde, with a burst of blue light spurting out of Godzilla's mouth. It's like a rocket ignition experiment. PSSD after a while, poo, a ball of metal was spat out by Godzilla in disgust. It's not that it doesn't eat. It is because it despises living beings being dirty. The equipment you wear is also dirty. It has infinite energy that can't be eaten every day. Even if it travels with a legion, it will bring an energy tank. Then what does it eat this bug for? What if? What if I eat bad stomach? And as General Wang Ren's equipment turned into a metal crystal ball and was spit out, Ebony Moore was shocked. He didn't even wipe his nosebleed, just turned around and ran, without hesitation. How do you fight this? Ebony Moore gets nosebleeds just trying to control one of Godzilla's claws. Then how do you beat this whole Godzilla? At the same time, Collector also looked silly. I bought cakes. Thanos' three generals go together. As a result, one died instantly, then got swallowed again. The last one to escape, let alone the remains of the two dead generals. If you go to pee, I don't even know how these two generals disappeared when I came back. This is straight up, not a splash of water at all. And at the moment shapeshifting King Kong civilizations King Shin Legion and Bashan Legion turn to the offensive, go straight to the fight against the three Thanos legions. They are not surprising at all, as if this is how it should be. And once there is an advantage, the execution strength and war intensity of the shapeshifting King Kong civilization will come up at once. All shapeshifting King Kong are highly compatible. 2,000 sets of shapeshifting King Kong descendants only lost about 100. The remaining 1,900 shapeshifting King Kong descendants began to crash crazy. Thanos Legion Air, take it away. Thanos Legion Battleship, activate and take away. Or give a position and call the offspring with heavy weapons to shoot away. Battlefield situation, not only the firepower is interspersed but also the firepower coverage that is not afraid of logistics. In short, the battlefield has changed from a superficial headwind situation to a crushing situation in an instant. The total force at the beginning is 5 to 1. After the senators salvoed it was 3 to 1. Finally Godzilla joins the fray. After a change of situation, the total force on the battlefield becomes 2 to 1. It still looks like there is a double gap, but Godzilla is here. Even if the opponent is twice as many, it is only a matter of time before they are all wiped out. Godzilla is like a grandpa who can't handle it now. Thanos Legion can't help it. But is it over? Not yet. Godzilla looks at Ebony Moore, who hastily flees. He can remember it. This is what forces the cub not to let himself shoot people. Godzilla's dorsal fin lights up blue. Beep tilde beep beep. After a quick charge, Godzilla's atomic breath again. Boom tilde, with a flash of laser light. Ebony Moore's back shines. Be swallowed by the atomic breath again. In the end. The whole person disappeared into the cosmic space. So far, four of the five generals of Thanos' obsidian will all perish, and they all died at the hands of the shapeshift in King Kong civilization. Only the last one is left. In other words, Supergent survived by not participating in the battle. Collector muttered in disbelief when he saw this. Four out of the five generals of obsidian who looked down on me in the universe before, just died like this? Compared with the time when Thanos conquered the world, 
These four people died too fast, only a few months at most. This is dying fast. I can't believe it. Collector observes and observes the battlefield again. With the demise of the generals, there is no one to command the Thanos Legion, only the silent Thanos himself. And the uncommanded army of Thanos is still very strong. But this is like ants gathering together in the face of the discipline of shapeshifting King Kong. From now on, the shapeshifting King Kong is almost undamaged and begins to clear the Thanos Legion. Yes, one to one total force. But the shapeshifting King Kong Legion has already started the clearing mode. This also means that the opponent of at the moment is not worth mentioning at all. The shapeshifting King Kong civilization even started with zero battle damage. Collector looked at it and still couldn't believe it. Are they about to win? How many hours has this war been fought to end? Legion of Thanos. Three legions of Thanos, the strongest army ever in the universe, none of them. Ten to one total force. The strength of the shapeshifting King Kong civilization army is only one tenth of the opponent. But it's only been a few hours and it's over. Only a few hours. Remember the Millennium War between the Kree Empire and the Nova Empire? Although it has not really reached the Millennium. But the all-out war between the two sides has been fought for at least a hundred years. Then there are hundreds of years, close to a thousand years of negotiations, Beijing Opera and the border phoenix time. So the two empires have been fighting for a hundred years and friction for a thousand years. But here, the outskirts of the galaxy, inside a solar system without going out, the strongest army in the universe is about to disappear. Do you think Collector is shocking or not? Even if he knows that the shapeshift in King Kong civilization has great potential, but he still couldn't believe it. Too much information, and with shapeshifting, after King Kong's Bashan Legion and Optimus Legion began to clear the Thanos Legion, inside one of the battleships, Thanos, as the commander-in-chief, really couldn't believe it when he saw such a result. Why isn't he on? Because it's space, not the surface. Although Thanos is not afraid of the ultra-low temperature of space, and has excellent resistance. But that doesn't mean he can fight in space. Follow the original plan. Thanos Legion charges, destroy the enemy formation, then enter the surface and start fighting warriors. And in that environment, Thanos fighting power is at its peak. At the moment, Thanos A's glowed with a strong soul gem. And the soul gem on his infinity gauntlet is also shining slightly. Watching his legion begin to be crushed infinitely, Thanos was silent for a while. He wears the infinity gauntlet in his left hand, and in his right hand holds a double-bladed great sword set aside, then turned and walked towards the spaceship cabin. After a while, a spaceship carries Thanos into battle quickly. At the same time, his gloves are also full of light. Collector frowned when he saw the star trails in the universe. He immediately took an instrument to lock on the star track and looked at it. Turns out it was Thanos. Then take a closer look. Thanos with infinite gems. The Collector immediately reported to the Elders. It's Thanos. He has entered the battlefield himself. He still has infinite gems in his hands. And the elders also discovered at the same time. Watching Thanos enter the field, the elders also dispatched their first generation shapeshifting King Kong descendants saw the strongest descendants to behead them immediately. For a while, at least 30 shapeshifting King Kong offspring head towards Thanos. Just go for Thanos. And look at the shapeshifting King Kong flying in the distance. Originally, Thanos was at most 1v1, and as long as he was 1v2. He would definitely be defeated. But now, he has infinite gems. Thanos accumulates power inside infinite gems. Wait until more than 30 shapeshifting King Kong descendants get close. Thanos holds out his left hand on the flight controller. Then give it a hard grip. Boom tilde. For a moment, an orange explosive energy wave surged centered on Thanos. See here. All the shapeshifting King Kong offspring pressed a button at the same time. Suddenly, a piece of metal on all shapeshifting King Kong descendants emitted a strong blue light. Then they are all covered with a blue barrier. This is the technology developed by the elders. Put unlimited energy in a similar battery. Then activate the equipment to use. See here, Thanos is slightly surprised. At the same time, explosive energy waves also bombarded the barriers of more than 30 shapeshifting King Kong descendants back and forth. Boom tilde, after a series of constantly loud noises. The offspring of shapeshifting King Kong were all knocked hundreds of meters away, and the barrier has been broken. Then they stabilized themselves. Keep pushing and fly towards Thanos. See them coming again. Thanos opened his left hand and squeezed it hard. Boom tilde. Another explosive energy wave surged out. Crack tilde. With the shapeshifting, the equipment on the descendants of King Kong collapsed. This time, more than 30 shapeshifting King Kong were all blown hundreds of meters away. Fortunately, there were no casualties. 5.5. But these more than 30 shapeshifting King Kong still want to continue to execute the beheading order. Collector used the instrument to observe very carefully. After he saw here, immediately notify the elders and said, Thanos is already able to use infinite gems. Can't use the descendants to force it. Let three three shapeshifting King Kong descendants go to harass. And let Godzilla take the opportunity to breathe. You can cooperate well. Coincidentally, the elders thought so too. Their star destroyers are no longer usable at this time. Otherwise, 
they would destroy their offspring together. So Godzilla's breath is really useful at this time. So the instrument in Godzilla's ear sent a message from the elders. After Godzilla heard it, it saw Thanos fighting based on its positioning. Those bursts of explosive energy waves were too dazzling, and the elders spoke to it. You just choose your max atomic breath on Thanos. The rest of the shapeshift in King Kong's will work fine. So Godzilla is no longer hesitation. It opened its mouth wide open, then increased the reactor combustion efficiency. Baking Tilda. For a while, Godzilla's body is burning with fire. It's like Captain Marvel turned on the double star status. And Godzilla started high intensity charging. Beep Tilda beep Tilda beep beep. Appears with a dazzling blue light. Godzilla's throat began to emit a strong light. Wait until the charge is over. Godzilla spits out its strongest atomic breath directly at Thanos. Raw Tilda. Do Buzz Tilda. The terrifying blue laser passes through the battlefield in an instant. The fleet of the shapeshifting King Kong civilization has long received orders to get out of the way ahead of time. They dodge suddenly and uniformly like a countdown. The Thanos army who had no time to dodge was hit instantly. Then it went straight to ashes. 166. Victory. Godzilla headshot. Still not sleeping? Godzilla's superatomic breath across the battlefield. All the shapeshifting King Kong army received the information card and dodged suddenly to make a passage through which the breath passed. The Thanos army who had no time to dodge was wiped out in an instant. Even if some are not breathed out. But if you get close, you will be burnt on the spot. And this atomic breath passed through the battlefield in an instant. The shapeshifting King Kong descendants who besieged Thanos immediately thrust a jets back. More than 30 shapeshifting King Kong offspring in uniform. It's like saying yes. Um? Thanos stared at the shapeshifting King Kong who pushed away at the same time for a moment. Then its side glows with a brilliant blue light. Thanos had no time to defend. He can do it. It is subconsciously raising the infinity gauntlet and the double-edged sword in front of him. Next moment. The atomic breath arrives in an instant. Where the two meet. The moment the breath laser collides with the Thanos Infinity Gauntlet, Soul Gem automatically spawns an orange barrier with portal on Thanos, but the terrifying energy still bombarded Thanos, Tilda. For a moment, the figure of Thanos is covered by the atomic breath. Then it disappeared in the blink of an eye. Is it sent away, or fade away? Neither. More than 30 shapeshifting King Kong descendants look at the top of the atomic breath jet together. It turns out that Thanos is being blasted infinitely. But even with infinite gems and double-edged sword protection, Thanos still disappeared into the universe without knowing his life or death. Soul Gem has detected a threat to the host's life, so it automatically opened the entrance to a space and wanted to recycle Thanos into it. Because Soul Gem has its own space, but this space is just opening up. While Thanos' double-edged sword is destroyed, the man is inside. The terrifying ability of atomic breath is also poured into it. It's like you're flushing the toilet. Can you just push paper or shovel down? Impossible. You must bring water. So after entering together, the entrance of the space immediately couldn't bear such a big impact and was distorted. And once the space is distorted, the space-time coordinates and teleportation location are also different. That's all. Thanos 24 hour after coma, being teleported to is not the inner space of the soul gem. Instead, he was sent to a space full of negative energy. During his coma, a bug covered in green found it. Then it quickly called its companions. In the end, Thanos was transported to a terrifying and magnificent hall. And in this hall, there is actually a huge green bug king. So here it is, negative space. And it is, annihilation bug king middle dot annihilation. They are, obliterate the zerg. At the same time, after seeing Thanos disappear, these are 30 or so descendants of shapeshifting King Kong reported the complete battle records and situation to their elders. After the elders receive the materials, let the shapeshifting kings return to their ranks, and at the moment, no obsidian would be with Thanos himself. That legion of Thanos is as fragile as paper. At the moment shapeshifting King Kong legion has started harvesting without damage. That is to clear the battlefield without injury. After hours of fighting Godzilla, it looked at the few remaining pairs. I am also satisfied to turn off the Saiyan mode and return to Cybertron. Just leave the rest of the scum to the Legion, that's all. After a while, only less than 5% of all Thanos Legion's warriors successfully escaped ahead of time. The remaining 95% of the warriors died in the solar system. At the moment, there are a lot of war debris floating in the solar system. Corpses, debris, wreckage, weapons, engines, ammunition, food, equipment. Pieces of these garbage spread throughout the solar system. But it doesn't matter, with the influence of the gravity of the solar system. In the end, they are not floating in the vast space of the universe, it is captured by the gravity of Jupiter or something, finally fell into the planet, or burn up by the friction of the atmosphere. So it's not a big problem, the shapeshifting King Kong army only needs to collect useful materials. As for the rest, you don't even need to clean the battlefield. So far, the war is completely over. In the case of disparity in total force, the shapeshifting King Kong civilization has achieved a near-perfect victory against the Thanos Legion, and Collector stands in front of the instrument, looking at the result of such a war for a long time cannot calm down. Not that he thought it was impossible. It's not that he thinks it's amazing. But seeing such a picture shocked Collector's heart for a long time. Collector has lived for many years. Although he is not strong in combat, 
He has a lot of insights available until now. He has never seen a civilization that develops as fast as the shapeshift in King Kong. Maybe it's in the records, but there is no definite news that they exist. So in the civilization that Collector saw with his own eyes, the shapeshift in King Kong civilization is definitely the most powerful civilization in his opinion. That's why he was shocked. This would give the shapeshift in King Kong civilization some time to develop. At that time, it must be the strongest civilization in the universe. None of them. The Thanos army was wiped out in such a devastating manner. In the future, who else will be able to shapeshifting the King Kong civilization? Collector thought for a while. Maybe there are only civilizations that do not exist in those myths. At the same time, as early as a few hours ago, Su Yi rested on the reclining chair of Little Universe. The twin dancers came over and said, Master, the Thanos army entered the solar system and wanted to attack the Earth, but their battleship failed to transition, and they collided with the shapeshift in King Kong, and now there is a fierce battle. Um, Su Yi, who heard the news? immediately found it interesting. Fight? Before a few days, Su Yi said that if the Thanos Legion wants to descend directly to Earth this time, they must first pass the level of shapeshift in King Kong. It turned out to be a real hit. Su Yi nodded and said with great interest, you take good records and report the detailed data to me later. Okay, Master. Su Yi directly believes that the shapeshift in King Kong civilization will defeat the Thanos Legion in the end. Why? The reason is very simple. Of the six infinite gems in this universe, three are now in the hands of shapeshift in King Kong. Two on Earth. Thanos has an auxiliary soul gem in his hand. Is Thanos strong without the power gem? Really not strong. If Thanos has a power gem or a space gem in his hand, then Su Yi can still see who will win. Do you want to intervene and wait? But only soul gems Thanos. It's hard to say whether you can beat Godzilla or not. If it was sprayed by the atomic breath, it is estimated that Thanos would have snapped directly. As for those Thanos legions, excuse me, it's not that he looks down on it. After all, the Thanos legion can beat the three major empires in the universe. But compared to shapeshift in King Kong, no way. Every shapeshift in King Kong warrior is a pure warrior. How do ordinary creatures in the universe fight against shapeshift in King Kong warrior? And it's still in space. Then there is no chance of winning. So Su Yi directly waited for the detailed results. Process unimportant. The twin dancers nodded after hearing this. But they know that it will take some time for this war to end. And what happened last night? The twin dancers looked at each other. Then Ling bent down and asked, Master, have your two partners made you feel happy? Do you need the service of the dancers tonight? Hear this sentence. Su Yi couldn't help but think of the scene where he was being reciprocated by the lipstick painted Wanda and Gwen. The picture of the two grabbing candies. It did put a big buff of 50% weakness on Su Yi. So much so that I just used the submissive post given to Su Yizi today. So Su Yi waved his hand. Forget it today, I will call you if there is a need. Or you can talk about it after seeing me stand up. The twin dancers nodded. Then go back. At the same time. They felt a little regretful, and the reason for this feeling, it is because they are no longer the twin dancers of the robot, but twin dancers with a new life. They have souls now, and Su Yi is the main one, so they want to be favored by the master. Otherwise, they would not take the initiative to ask. It will not be notified in advance, or make a suggestion. If they don't have such a soul, then they won't take the initiative to ask. Instead, it's just waiting to be used, not actively expecting. That's the difference. After a few hours, Su Yi was blowing the evening breeze in the small universe looking at Kun's Titan comic book. At the same time, the final battle report of the Twin Dancers game. Ling reports from the sidelines. The end result was a big win for the shapeshift in King Kong civilization. The battle damage ratio is 100 to 1.5. The five generals of Thanos Obsidian are dead, four generals are dead, and it is not clear who the remaining one is. Thanos himself was blasted into the turbulence of time and space by Godzilla's atomic breath, and his life and death are unknown. Shapeshift in King Kong civilization to reap the battlefield. After calculation, Sky debris will not affect the Earth. After Ling finished speaking, then he sent the detailed battle data to the tablet and handed it to Su Yi. Then while Su Yi was watching, Wu also said, After this war is over, the strongest legion in the universe will come to an end. Not surprisingly, the shapeshift in King Kong civilization has officially become the strongest civilization in the universe. The total combat power will be higher than that of the Nova Empire, the Skrull Empire, and the Kree Empire. But the legendary display of the Shah Empire does not know whether it is true or not. Maybe they're in other galaxies or spaces. Su Yi nodded. Um, then check out the details. First is the preview. The total strength of the three Thanos legions and the two shapeshifting King Kong legions are indicated above. Although it is three legions to two legions, but the numbers vary enormously. It clearly shows that Thanos has a large number of flagships, battleships, spaceships, and warriors. Definitely, some are estimated. Then there is the personal list. 1. How much the elders wiped out. How much shapeshifting King Kong offspring wiped out. It's even down to how much each shapeshifting King Kong wiped out. At the same time, Su Yi also saw an interesting profile picture. That's Godzilla. The head of Godzilla is also in it. And it's number 1. As shown above, its record is the best. And far ahead of other shapeshifting King Kong. Su Yi took a closer look. Sure, little guy. 
displayed on the panel. The little guy destroyed a total of 1,500 spaceships, more than 800 battleships. Destroy the three generals of Obsidian. Thanos himself died with the last atomic breath. These achievements are too impressive. Godzilla's kill record, basically. It is far behind the personal record. Not bad. So you looked at Godzilla's head. Suddenly there is a feeling of seeing the child grow up. Not in vain. This is so useful. Even count as an investment. That is also earned in blood. After reading the report, so you returned the tablet to Lian and said, Say to the elders, keep an eye on the trajectory of this man Thanos. If he is not dead, there must be other moths. If you die, so ye thought about it. The twin dancers also repeated curiously. Dead words? What else is dead? Wouldn't it be dead if you died? Actually not. In the Marvel Universe, being dead isn't really dead. There are people who can resurrect you, like Thanos is dead. It is really possible for the goddess of death to resurrect him. Then let him do something or something. It's not like this hasn't happened before. Put it simply, Thanos will meet the goddess of death when he dies, and death doesn't want to see Thanos. Then she will resurrect Thanos, and then give him the ability that you are and ye will not die even if he is torn to pieces. Then Thanos would never see death again. How about it? Isn't this a unique way of abandoning dog licking? But the goddess of death really did it. It's just that the target is a little bitch. That is Deadpool. 510. But so ye thought about it, and the shape shifting King Kong has nothing to do with it. So he waved his hand. It's fine if he's dead. Anyway, he should pay attention when he's alive. The twin dancers nodded. Then convey the news to the elders. This is not what Su Yi said deliberately. It is because no matter in which version, Thanos is indomitable and he is considered half of the protagonist. So let shapeshifting King Kong pay attention. He likes to make trouble too much. Definitely. It has nothing to do with myself. After reading the battle report, so you looked at the time. It's 1-2 o'clock in the morning. Sleep. So you threw the comic book aside. Then a hole appeared in a space, allowing the book to fly in. Then open another hole in front of the bookshelf in the comic room. Wait until the comic book flies in and puts it away by itself. The hole is also closed, and Su Yi had already arrived at the bedroom. As soon as he opened the door, the lights in the bedroom were off. He thought the two girls were asleep. But the next moment he found that there were two bulging lumps in the quilt. Then it swayed back and forth with a sound of inhalation. Question mark. Su Yi raised his eyebrows. He walked silently to the side of the quilt. Then he opened a corner and went in to have a look and asked, What are you looking at? Still not asleep? Artilda. X2. Obviously taken aback by Wanda and Gwen in the nest. So you looked down. Gwen was holding an imperial comic book and the two read it together. But what if the bed is too dark? Fine. Wanda held a faint Illuminati in her hand, and it is easy to use lighting to assist in comic books. So even if Gwen put it away, Su Yi saw that the comic book was hiding in their clothes emitting light. Su Yi suddenly realized when he saw it. So I didn't learn well, so I came back early in the morning and watched this. Su Yi stretched out his hand. Give me Kang Kang. Gwen is very hesitation because the two look very exciting. She and Wanda exchanged glances. I want to find a way from the other person's eyes. But Su Yi's nasal sound came out. Um, Gwen turned in the book right away. Su Yi opened it and took a look. Really exciting. When Wanda saw it, she twitched her legs and said, Su, even if you still have, Wanda and I can't help you anymore. Even if you use spell duplication, duplication is also a menstrual period. Yeah, Gwen nodded in agreement immediately after hearing it. But Su Yi flipped over. He saw a picture and suddenly his eyes were exposed. Yes, another way. The old way is warm. Su Yi closed the book, and suddenly there was light in his eyes. He looked at Wanda and Gwen. After being stared at, the two immediately embraced each other in fright. Definitely, it will be tonight. But tomorrow night, Su Yi smiled, put the book back and said, Don't worry, what time is it? Let's take a good rest and talk about it tomorrow. Gwen felt bad. Dot. 167. Hulk announces his seclusion. Tony is going to have a daughter. After Su Yi finished speaking, I took the two girls to rest and sleep normally. But before falling asleep, Wanda and Gwen were still exchanging glances in Su Yi's arms. The two looked at Su Yi. It all feels weird. How could he fall asleep without doing anything like this? Neither woman could believe it. But it turns out, Su Yi really fell asleep, following his long breathing ups and downs. Nothing unexpected really happened. Question mark. The hearts of the two women are very strange. This is not like Su Yi. Wanda is very strange. But Gwen says she has a bad feeling. This premonition is not immediate. It's coming soon. Gwen put her hand on her arm, indicating that something was wrong with her. Wanda thought about it and nodded. She didn't have a Gwen jerk. But she has a woman's sixth sense. Wanda felt it too. It's not easy. But what can the two do? Sleep. So the two also leaned on Su Yi and fell asleep. At the moment. Late at night. Early in the morning, Su Yi was asleep, but in a wooden house in the suburbs, Tony lay awake in bed. At the moment Pepper has fallen into a deep sleep, but Tony still stared at the ceiling with his deep eyes open. Indeed, is between the projection screens. He wears earplugs in his ears so he can hear the silent projected audio. Next to his bed was a stack of spellbooks. This he borrowed from Kamar Taj. After reading it, 
I have to pay it back, and no damage can occur. The price is that he will build public facilities for the towns outside Kamartage, such as free parks, entertainment and fitness facilities, traffic roads, libraries and so on. And it costs money to hire locals to maintain it. But Tony is quite willing. All the above mentioned facilities are provided. How many million yuan can it cost? It's all about money anyway. Compared to magic, that's not the case either. But the problem is not this. At the moment Tony stared deeply at the images he received from the satellite. In the picture, high energy reactions have been taking place on the fringes of the inner solar system. If it weren't for the fixed star publicity, Mars and the Earth have reached the closest distance. Otherwise Tony wouldn't be able to detect the information at all. But the problem is, how can there be a high energy reaction there? Isn't the Mars? What happened to Mars? Exploded. Tony frowned. But he doesn't have a probe near Mars, so I can only do this and watch the reaction. Wait until it's all over. Tony still pursed his lips, not knowing what to do. Did something happen to Mars? Dot 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 or the outer planets of the solar system? Tony stroked his chin and thought about it. Possible. But it is inference. What should he do? Tony thought about it. How about building a flight tool to see it? Then call tomorrow at noon to ask Sue. Can. But ask Friday first. Tony asked Friday in a low voice. Can my existing Earth satellite system go to Mars? Note that it is mine. Tony has many satellites floating in space. But these satellites are early warning systems. The only one with a bit of combat power is the low Earth orbit satellite, Veronica. That is, anti-Hulk armored satellites. But after Friday's calculations. After a while. Answer on Friday. Sir. Your satellites are all medium to near orbit satellites. After the fuel is propelled and accelerated at one time, after calculation, it can only be scrapped after taking a set of photos from the vicinity of the solar system, and cannot be recycled. After hearing Friday's words, Tony nodded in agreement. Okay, then send a satellite over there. It's just a satellite. How much can it be worth? As long as you can take a group of photos to reassure yourself. Tony didn't feel bad about the money. He has many satellites. At this time, the sound of activity came from Tony's side. This made Tony immediately turn off the projection, turn his head and close his eyes to pretend to sleep. After a while, E slash B. Pepper didn't know why he woke up. Then she went to the bathroom slightly uncomfortable. Then go back to sleep. Tony figured it was time for him to sleep too. But as soon as he closed his eyes, the headset in his ear reminded Tony. Sir, after a physical examination by the emission detection system, the results of Miss Pepper's toilet just now showed that she was four weeks pregnant. Exclamation mark. In the dark night, Tony opened his eyes sharply. Next morning, so he is really the same as what he said last night. Rest well, everyone, and go to bed early. Then he fell asleep peacefully with his arms around the two girls. 18.30, so he opened his eyes on time. After he stretched himself, Gwen and Wanda, who were full of sleep, also woke up. The two were not tossed yesterday, so very little supplemental sleep is needed at night. With Su Yi waking up, the two also chatted with Su Yi early in the morning. Gwen climbed up and put everything on Su Yi's head. Wanda hugged Su Yi's big hand tightly. Then you have to hold it between your legs. Maybe that would be comfortable. Ten minutes later, paste finished. Su Yi pulled out his hand wrapped in two grapefruits. Then pushed away Gwen, who was breathing like a blow on his face. Get up. Those who sleep late will be spanked. Following Su Yi's waking up, he went to the bathroom to wash up first. Gwen bounced straight off the bed. Then he put on his clothes with agility in the air between clothes and pants dancing. It seems that there are after images flashing. Then she followed Su Yi to the bathroom to wash up. Wanda opened her eyes first. Then he lifted the quilt off his body. As soon as the quilt is opened, she, who was brought to sleep by Su Yi, also showed a large amount of whiteness. As for physical phenomena, don't worry. Wanda has already solved the leaking problem with magic. Just modify the ceiling magic. Very simple. Then Wanda went to the cloakroom to choose clothes. She chose a red leather jacket, a small red leather skirt, and a black slim fit underneath. Wait until the clothes are changed. Wanda just walked to the bathroom. But once at the door, Wanda saw Gwen straddling Su Yi's crotch. Su Yi just finished washing, spit out the toothpaste water. But Gwen was full of toothpaste. Then he insisted on having a relationship with Su Yi Bobo. How could Su Yi be willing? She pushed Gwen's face, not letting Bobo. It's too disgusting for Mada to wear toothpaste, and Yin Yi can't accept it. But Gwen insisted. The two were deadlocked. Fortunately, Wanda came to rescue Su Yi. Wanda, take this crazy girl down. When he grabbed Su Yi's hand, Gwen Bobo calmed down again. Bobo, I don't. In the end, Wanda was pulled down by Gwen, because she fell sick too. Mouthful of toothpaste. If this is Bobo, Wanda didn't want to be with Su Yi Bobo all day today. I don't know what kind of nerves Gwen has. Next, after the three of them washed up, choose your breakfast. I'll eat whatever you eat. I'll go down first. Su Yi handed over the right to choose breakfast to the two girls. Then I went downstairs to work. Parter. 1855. Su Yi opened the door of the office and went in. The twin dancers followed. Then Wu helped Su Yi get the milk tea as usual and then opened it for Su Yi and handed it to Su Yi, drinking sweet milk tea. Su Yi is not afraid that eating too much sugar will make him gain weight. 
These energies are too little for him. Then Su Yi turned on the TV. Check out the latest news. Superhero Hulk, that is, Bruce Banner, publicly stated, admitting that his rage has caused bloody effects. He will take his sister to live in seclusion and no longer appear in the city as Hulk. Simply put, I, Hulk, make no mistake. UBB, I quit. Whoever loves to protect this city will protect it. See you soon. DJE, Recluse. No, you live in seclusion too? Didn't Banner take his sister for special training in the original plot? He didn't say he wanted to live in seclusion either. As a result, he is now living in seclusion. Is this influenced by Tony, etc.? If only because of Tony's influence. It seems that this matter has something to do with him. It was because of him that Tony went to live in seclusion a lot earlier. Ah this, Su Yi smiled helplessly. Now he understands. Even if he participated in very few incidents and did not directly participate in the incident. But his impact. It also caused a chain reaction. All right. It's still about him. So you looked at the news again. With Iron Man in seclusion. Scarlet Witch in seclusion, Captain America gone, and now Hulk in seclusion, only Lady Spider is still active in the city. If our city is threatened again, who will step forward? Is it the President's army? The following reply, I buy karma, long time no see, it seems that there are really no superheroes in the city, so if there is another crisis, who will help us? The League of Goddesses has only one spider lady left in the city. With Scarlet Witch's silent seclusion, the man who often appears behind them is gone. Turkeys, I figured it out. It's not the difficulties that made the superheroes live in seclusion, but you forced them to live in seclusion. Next time you encounter a crisis, save yourself, as expected. With the announcement of the Hulk went into seclusion, only then did everyone find out. The superheroes are not showing up anymore, and most of them chose to live in seclusion. Natasha Romanoff, Hawkeye, Falcon, Thor, Loki, Ant-Man, Vision, and more are now only on covered missions. They don't show up anymore. Iron Man, Hulk, Scarlet Witch, etc. are already reclusive. Captain America and Winter Soldier are semi-reclusive, or a latent state. So who else is fighting crime in the city on a daily basis? Only Gwen. And everyone also found that only Gwen, who hid her identity, was not troubled by any superhero identity. Life is the same as normal, but better. Not to mention love, now I am happy every day. Not to mention the career, above the heavenly father, below the single body, it can even kill the level single universe, and also holds the power gem. Is there anything else to say about this strength? That is, among all the current superheroes, the happiest is only Gwen. Next is Wanda. Then there is Tony. Everything else has to go further back. But careful people also found it. The top three are all people who are very close to Su Yi. The first two even had negative distance contact. At the same time, the top three were all people who listened to Su Yi's opinions and psychological counseling. Then the result is obvious. Do you understand a psychiatrist? Tactical retreat. Do you understand your life mentor? Tactical retreat. As for online messages, that Su Yi didn't want to care about it at all. He just wanted to laugh. First, nothing to worry about. Second, serve it right. Summary is over. Party tilde. At this time, Gwen and Wanda came in with Su Yi and their breakfast. Both of them turned their faces. Su Yi saw that it was still fine noodles. You geez like this too? Gwen put down her own bowl, and pushed Su Yi's to him. Then he reached out and took down the chopsticks he was biting into his mouth before speaking. It's the first time Wanda and I have eaten. But Nora from the fridge said it was your favorite vermicelli. So we ordered that. Nora. Su Yi was taken aback for a moment. He didn't expect that. This burning refrigerator is quite intimate. The fine noodles are less than 1.5 millimeters in thickness. So you usually asked Nora to make the soup better. Why? Because the thin noodles go well with the soup. The taste of the noodles is very fragrant. So Su Yi loves to eat it, which is not found in foreign countries. Because its full name is, Long Su Noodles, that's all. The three began to eat breakfast. As soon as Wanda and Gwen took the first bite, they discovered that this kind of noodles was unusual. Matilda, Gwen opened her eyes, quickly finished eating the noodles in her mouth and said, Sure enough delicious. Compared with the noodles of the United States, this thin noodle seems to have a taste inside, but other noodles have a taste on the outside. Wanda nods in agreement. She also had nothing to say. It's so delicious, let's talk after eating. So Su Yi gave a thumbs up, and then the three of them showed off first. But this side is just halfway through. Beeping Bell Tilda. Su Yi's cell phone rang. He picked it up and took a look. Tony calling? Su Yi turned on the hands-free connection, then put it on the table and asked while eating noodles. Hey, Tony, what are you calling for? Huh? How did you know I was going to be a father? Hear this sentence. Su Yi was speechless. He paused with Barton, and continued to eat. Kian Zhao's, noodles. But Wanda suddenly reacted when she heard it. Miss Pepper is pregnant? Because it is hands-free. Tony heard it too. He immediately said happily, Sue, I only found out in the early morning that Pepper is already four weeks pregnant. I'm 36 weeks from being a dad, Sue. When he or she is born, you must come. Let's celebrate. Hear this sentence. Su Yi nodded in agreement. Definitely. Tony's kid. If I remember correctly, she is still a daughter. She is the future second generation Iron Man, 
and she will grow up to be very beautiful. It's actually in the last deleted clip of Avengers Alliance 4. Tony's daughter has grown up and is watching her father Tony's life experience. Wait, what's her name? At this time, Wanda looked at Su Yi. He hinted at Su Yi with his hands and eyes to ask for his name. Here in the United States, parents usually prepare names in advance. So Su Yi also asked, Tony, what is the child's name? Have you figured it out? Thought it out. Tony decided instantly. Oh? Su Yi asked interestedly. What's your name? Morgan Stark. What's the daughter's name? Morgan Stark. Question mark. Morgan Stark. Question mark. You mean, both boys and girls are called Morgan Stark? Yes. Su Yi's mouth twitched. He exchanged glances with Wanda, who was covering her forehead, and Gwen, who was covering her face. How can there be a name that can be used by both men and women? And the name Morgan is not suitable for girls. Tony, if you name it like that, it must end up being a girl. This sentence surprised Tony. Why? Because from a metaphysical point of view, your daughter's name is the most peculiar, so you are very likely to be a daughter. Tony froze for a moment. He didn't expect such a statement. Well, if it's really a daughter, then I also believe in metaphysics. 168. The difficulty of giving birth to the strong, Thanos and the annihilating Zerg. Compared with whether Tony believes in metaphysics or not. Instead, Su Yi asked curiously. Why does your kid have to be called Morgan Stark? For what reason? Right. Both boys and girls should be called this name. There must be a reason for that, right? Wanda nodded curiously too. There must be a reason. Tony was really happy today, he laughed. Not long after we moved in, Pepper said she had a dream that we had a baby named Morgan Stark. So we decided right then and there that if we could have a baby here, he or she would be Morgan Stark. Heard such an answer. Su Yi smiled helplessly. Then you are called metaphysics, huh? Tony was a little confused. Why is this also called metaphysics? What is metaphysics? Metaphysics is the meaning of meow, which is easy to understand. An unknowable feeling and probability are affecting an undetermined matter. So Yi simply explained. If this matter really matches the probability because of this feeling, that would be great tilde. Tony nodded knowingly when he heard this. Kind of like probability. But not quite. Get in touch with psychology. But not quite. Well, that's what I called to say. Oh wait, not just this. But two more. There are two more? Su Yi finished eating the noodles and wiped his mouth. Go ahead. Tony continued. The second thing is that I have joined Kamataj as a mage apprentice and started learning spells. Their supreme mage Stephen is very kind to me. I can even use the magic book as a library to borrow out and read it at home, and then just return it after finishing it. And I just need to spend some money, and that's fine. Um, well, actually, I want to say thank you very much. I know it's mostly because of you that I enjoy these conveniences. Tony really can't thank people. In fact, the second thing he wanted to do was to talk about his own learning of spells. At the same time, thank you Su Yi. But he mumbled a few words before thanking him. Well, that's Tony's character too. If he can thank you, it means that he is really thanking you. Su Yi also smiled indifferently. He didn't pay anything. You're welcome. When we go to your house again, we'll have some delicious food and drink. That's definitely. Tony readily agreed. He didn't know how to thank Su Yi. Money? Su Yi doesn't need it. Strength right ability? Su Yi didn't need anyone but you have to eat. Then Tony must get you the best in the world next time. 523 must be top middle top. Then, Tony started to say the third thing. There's one last thing. Last night I discovered abnormal energy fluctuations in the outer reaches of the solar system. Have you found anything, Takumi? Tony said so. So ye knew that Tony's satellite had discovered the fluctuation of Mars, the star destroyer of the elders, Godzilla's atomic breath. These are all super high energy reactions. Every attack will light up like a star so it is not surprising to be found. But it's not Su Yi's doing, cough cough cough, and I can't explain it. There is so much to say, so Su Yi said, don't you have a satellite? You can know it by launching it yourself. After you have seen it once, you will know it roughly. Tony shuddered. Sure enough, this matter is not related to Su Yi. But what did Su Yi do to cause such a big thing to happen to Mars? You must know that the distance between the Earth and the Moon is 380,000 kilometers. The shortest distance between ground fires is 55 million kilometers but the longest can exceed 400 million kilometers. So if it weren't for the shortest distance between ground and fire this time, Tony hadn't noticed this Martian war at all. If you look at the moon, you can still see a circle, but you can't see Mars at all. Because even at the closest time, the gap between the two is more than 100 times the distance between the Earth and the moon. Tony figured it out too. So let's wait for the photos and videos from the satellite. Okay, then I'm fine. So Yi nodded, then hang up. I'm fine. He was just about to wait for Tony to hang up. As a result, another sentence came from there. Wait, I have one last wait. What? Say it quickly. Hurry up and be a father too. Then my two children can play together. 11. So Yi didn't say anything yet. Tony just hung up the phone. Let's play jingle together. If you want to show off, it is true that you have children first. It's numb. This dog is better than Tony middle. She stark. So Yi sighed and put away the phone. As a result, 
He looked up, I saw Gwen and Wanda giggling on the sidelines, but he didn't dare to laugh out loud, just shrugging there. What are you laughing at? Is it funny? So ye pouted. Whenever I didn't fill you up, it turned out that there was no response. Yes. So let me say this. Gwen Wenda was also taken aback. Yes. Every time Suyi takes it to the place without an umbrella on rainy nights. And it's all poured directly into the innermost part. Then why it has been poured for several months. Nan Bun. Gwen looked at her little belly and was also very curious. According to Suyi's farming method. If not pregnant. That's kind of weird, isn't it? Wanda rubbed her belly. She thought about it. Suddenly his face turned pale. She looked at Suyi in a little panic. Su. I dot 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 is there something wrong with my body? She suddenly realized. Is there something wrong with your body? Can't you get pregnant? What is the reason? Why? What to do? Wanda panicked all of a sudden. Gwen was told so by Wanda. Also his complexion changed instantly. The two looked at Suyi nervously. I'm afraid this is the problem. If true, then they probably really lost their minds. But, what a fart. Suyi shook his head helplessly. What are you thinking about? When Gwen and Wanda heard this, they immediately relaxed and felt relieved. Then Suyi continued. If this is the problem. Don't you think it's my problem instead? How can you both be infertile at the same time? If you really can't get pregnant, I'm the biggest problem. Gwen thought to wonder. Also dot 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 not impossible. After all, there are two women, and both of them are infertile, which is too strange. But, Gwen asked hesitantly, you are obviously very strong dot 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 how could it be your problem, Sue? That's a good question to ask. Gwen said strong, you aren't Sue Yishing. So Su Yi first explained Nu Nu's question. Gwen, even if it's very strong, people who are infertile are infertile. Secondly. It's normal for you to have a low chance of getting pregnant, and it's also because I'm strong. But this strong is not that. But the ability is very strong, understand? Gwen and Wanda exchanged glances. They all nodded to show they understood. But, what does this have to do with a strong ability? Wanda was still a little puzzled. The stronger the ability, the harder it is to conceive? So Yi nodded. In a sense, yes. Although I can also force us to have children, it's something I can control, not something normal. But if you want to come normally, it really depends on luck. Wanda is still puzzled. Why? I said it before. Su Yi gave an example, the stronger the life, the more it violates the rules of nature. Remember the celestial seed that Gwen killed? Gwen nodded, I remember. That thing can only appear once in a billion years. So long? Gwen and Wanda were stunned when they heard this. Only one god group emerges in one billion years. Although Su Yi is not talking about the entire celestial group, but a single celestial group, one billion years is too exaggerated. This is a billion. One billion multiplied by 4.6 is about the birth time of the earth. This is too exaggerated. No wonder Alan said that day. The Tengen group must be born. Who prepared for one billion years not to want their own children to be born. But that's not all. So he shook his head and continued. The Celestials are the level single universe, and they take one billion years to be born. But above them there are multi-universe levels. The creatures of this level are the five gods of the universe, and their children are even more difficult to be born. So you use the word even more. This is no joke. And Gwen suddenly remembered. Wait. Isn't Tartars further the five gods of the universe you mentioned? Wanda remembered too. Su Yi said this. That's right. Su, how long did it take for Nata to be born? Nata. Su Yi thought about it, but it was really hard to say. Um, it was about the beginning of the birth of this universe. No, before the birth of the universe, neither Ganata's father nor the devourer of the planet allowed her to be born. Dot. Gwen and Wanda were stunned. Before the universe was born? How long will this take? Gwen immediately took out her phone to check. The birth of the universe is close to 14 billion years. 140 slash Z? That is, Nata took 14 billion years to come into being. More than that, Su Yi added. 14 billion is just the observation time of the Earth. In fact the age of the universe is much longer. What's more, before Galactus came to this universe, he lived in other universes for a long, long time. So the time being spent is more than a multiple of 14 billion. As soon as Su Yi finished speaking, Gwen and Wanda were about to cry. They did not cry for the birth of Ganata. They cry for their children. Why? Because Ganata said so. You are stronger than my father. This sentence is, said to Su Yi. Gwen and Wanda remember it well. At that time, the two were still complacent. Now, it took Galactus tens of billions of years to have Nata, and Su Yi is stronger than Galactus. Does he have to spend tens of billions of years? Oh my god, Wanda and Gwen are desperate. My child, looking at the eyes of the two who were about to cry without tears, Su Yi smiled helplessly and said, Definitely, it also depends on race! Exclamation mark. Hear this, Gwen and Wanda finally feel refreshed. The two stared at Su Yi closely and waited for the following. Su Yi continued, How should I put it? human beings can be regarded as a fast reproducing species, and they are also very strong in potential, so we don't need to wait that long, it depends on luck, luck will come in a few years, and bad luck will last for decades, and you two don't have to worry about it, I'm still here, 
so you must be too. Here from years to decades, Wanda and Gwen let out a long breath at once. Tens of billions of years compared to a billion years. Years and decades are too acceptable. Wanda and Gwen exchanged glances, then the two clapped their hands. Then they came over and chatted with Su Yi for a few seconds. Finally, I happily went upstairs with a leftover noodle bowl. So you looked helpless for a while. But that's the nature of life. Reproduce. So ye sighed. What is on the internet about women who don't want to have children or get married? In the final analysis, the need for a partner is greater, and even if you don't deserve it, you have to demand it. Because in the instinct of life, the strength of a partner can lead to a safer life and better offspring. And this is in modern society, money and power. Once the partner's condition is good, in ancient times, it was powerful, or the leader of one party. In ancient times, it was an official, or a noble gentry. In modern times, he is a rich man, or knows how to understand. Even good once you hit the mark, that woman will instinctively want to list you, and then marry you, that is, bind. Finally, I will have a child with you, because of the next generation. There is also a binding component. So it is false that women do not want to get married and have children, as long as the conditions are met. There is nothing unwilling. They were eager to do so quickly. This is the nature of life. Although this is cruel, it is a fact. And there are women who deviate from this fact, but they are just a few. So, when you are on good terms, whether you are a man or a woman, the same men and women will be delivered to your door for you to choose. Stop being a licking dog, improving yourself is the kingly way. That's all. The pleasant fishing time passed in this way. The time comes to 5 p.m. So ye close the door on time. Thoughts? Check in. Then go upstairs. Find another way to go to the two women to prepare and warm up for the evening. At the same time, in the depths of the universe, the king of negative space. After a day of treatment and relaxation, purple sweet potato essence woke up in a worm sack. Thanos opened his eyes, tore the sack and came out. He looked down at his left hand. The infinity gauntlet is gone along with the infinite gems. Who is it? Thanos stood up weakly, looking around. As a result, the surrounding pictures shocked him. There are buildings full of ovaries and living bodies. It's like he's in the belly of a living thing. This is where, when Thanos was wondering, part Tilda, a side door like a tympanic membrane opened. Thanos looked around. He could only walk in. Then piece by piece of the eardrum opens as Thanos advances. But the other eardrums are closed. It means that Thanos can only go in the direction indicated. After a while, with the last huge amounts of eardrums cracked, Thanos walked in. Then he saw a sight that left him speechless. In the outside world, it's a world of bugs. Count buildings like flesh and technology have sprung up. And these bugs are the Annihilation Zerg. They are big and small, and their lengths are different. But without exception, they all have hideous appearances. Part of Tilda. At this time, a tall figure came over. Thanos looked over his shoulder. It is green all over, but its body is human-shaped, with a pair of wings on its back, and red purple armor and helmet on its head and body. It is the Annihilator. Annihilator. And the key is, Thanos looks down, in Obliterator's hand, with its infinity gauntlet and a soul gem. 169. Annihilation of the Insect King Take two girls to visit Chinatown After seeing the Insect King bring his own equipment, Thanos was in a bad mood. At the moment he already knew things are getting worse. And after the Bug King Annihilator saw Thanos, it looked at the glove again. Finally, he raised his hand and took a deep breath on the glove. The smell of the universe is so delicious. Those words made Thanos frown. Isn't this the universe? Definitely not. Obliterator looked at Thanos and said directly. This is negative space, how did you come in from the universe? Annihilator is taller than Thanos who is over 2 meters tall. It's at least 4 or 5 tall too. Although Thanos is not afraid of his size, he feels a strong sense of oppression from Annihilator. This sense of oppression, stronger than any creature Thanos has seen so far. In other words, the insect king in front of him is very strong. Very strong. Thanos meets the bug king's eyes. After half a sound, Thanos spoke. I was hit by an attack. As soon as this statement came out, the insect king's eyes widened. Then show a myopic crazy expression. It's in full swing. An invisible momentum made Thanos feel full pressure. The pressure was so great that Thanos couldn't breathe. Why is that? Very simple. The Oblivion Zerg is one of the most powerful races in the multi-universe. They're on top of comic book records. Even take down Galactus. Transform the planet Eater into a super destructive weapon. Yes, that's right. Transform one of the five gods, the planet Devourer, into a weapon and almost slaughter the universe. So the strength of annihilating the Zerg is terrifying. And the insect king who annihilated the Zerg, Annihilator, is even more powerful. It was against all superheroes in the entire universe at that time. Everyone is fighting hard. But at the last moment, one mistake detonated the annihilation core of the annihilation zerg across the universe. This caused this universe to explode on the spot. In the end, 
It was O.R. who came on the stage and restarted the universe to end this incident. So, Annihilation Zerg before the appearance of those special races. They are also extremely powerful, but just can't get out of negative space, and they need it. That's the negative space, after half a sound. Wait until the Insect King's madness is over. It looked at Thanos and said directly in a deep voice. You help us annihilate the Zerg and leave the negative space. I can return this glove and the gemstone on it to you and promise another request of yours. Hear this sentence, Thanos shuddered. There are creatures that are not needed to face infinity gauntlets and infinite gems? Doesn't it know how powerful this glove is when paired with gems? One gem is the level single universe, six gems is the multi-universe level. A treasure that the entire universe is obsessed with. Why don't you want it? Thanos' heart tightened. He immediately thought that the other party was lying. It is very likely that they just want to kill the donkey. But the Annihilation King saw what Thanos was thinking at a glance. It stretches out its right hand. Then remove the Infinity Gauntlet in front of Thanos, said, while handing it to Thanos at last. I guess you've failed. Then what else do you have to fail? Why not try one last time? Your equipment means nothing to me. Thanos looked at the Infinity Gauntlet in front of him. I was already shocked in my heart. Who really doesn't care about Infinity Gauntlets and Infinite Gems? And the other party said that Infinity Gauntlet and Infinite Gems are nothing. Is this real? This is real. Oblivion Zerg has an artifact. That's the cosmic control rod. It can completely control any energy in the universe. It can make the entire universe zero energy. It can even make all the existences in the universe be energy. That is when it works well. The cosmic control rod can even turn off the sun for the entire universe, and make the entire universe free of any energy. That is, if the user is also powerful, like the god group, even the planet devourer among the five gods can be killed instantly. Well, it's Uncle Tan again. But it's all true. The cosmic control rod is powerful. It depends on how the user uses it. Under good conditions, with the quantum wrists trap, it can completely resist the full-scale Big Bang. So Thanos' infinity gauntlet and the solid air just. The Annihilation Bug King is really not interested. It can even make this infinite gems no energy anymore, as long as it's not six infinite gems together. And Thanos realized it too. He's already a laggard. He is already a loser. If you don't go back, just wait until you die. What can you do when you go back alone? Dodging and hiding. The shape-shifting King Kong civilization will definitely look for him, so it doesn't matter what happens to Thanos. The consequences were all bleak. But he still has a chance now. That is to cooperate with the obliterating Zerg in front of you. Thanos turned his head to look out at the world. The Oblivion Zerg is horribly plentiful. Endless bugs are flying outside. And don't worry about not having enough energy. Thanos doesn't know why but he knew that it must be the means to annihilate the Insect King in front of him. And this is exactly the ability of the Cosmic Control Rod. So, if you work with them, myself maybe, still have a chance. Thinking of this, Thanos clenched his palms. If the cooperation can make a comeback, if cooperation can make oneself stronger, so what else is he unwilling to cooperate with? And the Annihilation King also saw Thanos' ambition. Next moment, Thanos reached for the Infinity Gauntlet of the Annihilator King, then said in a deep voice, I helped you find a way out of negative space and you helped me conquer it. Here just conquer the universe. The Annihilation Bug King smiled. That's it, that's all. Thanos officially teamed up with the Oblivion Zerg. Annihilating the Zerg gave Thanos the right to use a legion, making Thanos one of the generals of the Annihilating Zerg, and helping Thanos completely conquer the universe. And what Thanos can bring to the Oblivion Zerg, it is to let the Annihilating Zerg completely leave the negative space. Totally liberated. After watching Thanos leave with gloves on, the other generals who annihilated the Zerg came out from the side and asked, are we really going to help him conquer the universe? Annihilate Yinren. The Annihilation Insect King heard this. Its face was extremely disdainful. To help him destroy the universe? Yes. Want to expand negative space? You have to let the outer universe explode. Otherwise, the negative space for them to live in is just so big, it cannot be bigger. And now in negative space, the number of annihilating Zerg has long been saturated. That wants to annihilate the endless growth of the Zerg. More universes must explode. This way the negative space can get bigger and bigger. And helping Thanos conquer the universe is exactly the process of destroying the universe. Just add another hand at the last step. For example, let the largest black hole at the center of the universe explode. The five great gods of Wen blew themselves up. That can destroy the universe in an instant. And the universe of Thanos. It is the first target of the annihilating Zerg. The other side. After chatting, playing games, entertaining, and having dinner. At the moment the earth is already night. But this time Su Yi, Gwen, and Wanda were not at home. Instead, the three of them went shopping with Hala and Tanmai. It's not good for everyone to stay at home all the time. Su Yi walked ahead with the two girls. Hala and Tanmai chatted about the game strategy in the back. If you meet another fat man, Hala will also ask Tanmai how much energy is that person worth? Fatty, shaking and cold. The five of them walked along the beach like this. Wanda hugged Su Yi's arm. Wen held Su Yi's hand. Now Su Yi is his own except for legs, eyes, and mouth. Everything else is involuntary. The evening wind was blowing on Wanda's face. 
making her red hair flutter in the wind. Tzu Yi withdrew his hand from the soft grapefruit, then helped her tidy her hair. After tidying up, Wonder Presents fragrant Bobo. Then he looked at the scenery and sighed a little. Do you still remember when we first met? You said at that time that the vigorous love is fake, and the real love can be bored on the road together. I agreed at the time, so now it's true. We live this life. After Wanda finished speaking, Tzu Yi hasn't returned yet. Gwen said in surprise. You still have this kind of time, Artilda. Why didn't I? Wanda looked at Gwen and smiled. Because you are that vigorous fake love. No, I'm real too. Okay, it's all true. Tzu Yi pulled out both hands and rubbed the dog's heads angrily. Go shopping well, and you have to be taken care of by family law when you go home on the street. What is Tzu Yi's family law? Ah, uh, what is the family law for women? The answer is, if you are not good you will cry too much. I am happy Superman. Once happy, Superman. That's why I heard the words family law service. Both Wanda and Gwen will be honest. After all, both of them have times when they are overcrowded. Then, five people came to a lively street market. Wow Gwen looked at it, so lively. Wanda looked at it, and it was really lively. But she found out, it's all in Chinese. So you looked up, Chinatown. Chinatown in the United States is developing extremely fast. From one street at the beginning, there are now dozens of streets, and even the nearby Jewish street has been annexed a lot, and because of the United States community and kindred spirits, so most of the people living here are Chinese, and the location is in Manhattan, New York. Su Yi glanced at it. The street is really full of oriental atmosphere. One third of the entire street is restaurants, and the rest are selling fruits, Chinese medicine, seafood, gift shops, shops and so on. Lively is really lively. There are really many people. Dot dot task for flowers. Su, you should be familiar with this place right? There are these words. Let's go in and have a look. Gwen suggested while holding Su Yi's hand. Su Yi looked at Wanda after hearing it. There is a lot of curiosity in Wanda's eyes. Needless to say, Su Yi nodded. Let's go. As for Hala and Tanmai, those two are responsible for eating. Don't care about the others. Five people entered Chinatown, and it happened to be eight o'clock in the evening, and they were all people. Fortunately, everyone has a presence shield. Otherwise, let's not talk about whether you will be squeezed when you walk in. He went shopping in Chinatown alone with four women, and they are all foreign girls. When those Chinese saw him, they probably all nodded their heads. Five people come in. Gwen pointed to all kinds of Chinese and asked, Sue, what's this called? Chinese savior crepe. What's that called? Lanza noodles. And that one? Chinese medicine shop, bookstore, barber shop, fruit shop, grilled cold noodles, Barbecue. Tzu Yi helped Gwen translate a lot. Gwen was also very curious along the way. And among the five people, one person bought a pancake fruit. When buying pancakes, the five people's shielding of the boss's presence is invalid, and the owner is a Chinese aunt. As soon as she saw Su Yi's face, and then saw the woman behind Su Yi, she immediately said in surprise, Wow, pretty boy, so sharp Tilda. Su Yi felt the heart of this aunt. Not bad people, nothing malicious. It is also a real compliment. So he smiled and replied in Chinese, Five finger pies with sausage, eggs, bacon and no spicy sticks. Massive question Tilda. After hearing Su Yi's request, Aunt also felt more respectable and began to do it diligently. Here in the United States, the determination of class status is quite obvious. You live well, dress brightly, and drive a luxury car. Although everyone is free outside, but a gap is a gap. Meet people who look like they have money or ability. Many people are very respectful, and after watching Aunt start doing it, Gwen leaned over curiously to have a look. Wanda also stared at such an approach, and Hala and Tun might simply want to eat, but Aunt also chatted with Su Yi while doing it. What do you do here? There are so many beautiful sisters. Su Yi smiled, Doctor. Wow Tilda, awesome. When I heard it was a doctor, Aunt also looked at Su Yi in surprise. Being a great doctor in the United States can make money. The lowest are the high income class, roughly equivalent to when in the East. The kind with an annual salary of several million. The annual salary of professional doctors here is generally 300,000 yuan or more. Purchasing power equivalent to a year's salary can buy 5 Porsche 718 or 2 Porsche 911. Or you save some more. You can also buy a Lamborghini Bull. But this is only the average annual salary of professional doctors. That is the average salary of a resident doctor. But above the resident doctors, there are specialist training doctors and attending doctors, that is, attending physicians. The last one is a heavyweight player. And Stephen was the attending physician before the car accident. And also a star attending physician. So Stephen's annual income is basically close to seven figures. That's a million dollars. That's why Aunt was so surprised when he heard that Su Yi was a doctor. Become a doctor in this land. That's at least a firm foothold. Dot. But Wanda heard this curious question. What did you just say? Gwen nodded in agreement. Su Yi explained with a smile. She asked me what I do and why are you beauties by my side. Hear this sentence. Gwen and Wanda both had happy smiles. Was praised ha ha. So Wanda asked Su Yi. How do you say thank you? I want to say thank you to her. Then Su Yi taught the two girls how to speak Chinese. 
Thank you. After the two women learned, Wanda and Gwen spoke to Aunt in Chinese together. Thanks. Aunt was surprised, and quickly answered with a local accent. Oh no Tilda. No way Tilda. Gwen. Wanda? The two girls were dumbfounded again. If you say no thanks, at least there is a thank you word that is exactly the same, right? Shouldn't it? What do you mean? Seeing the confused eyes of the two women, Su Yi almost laughed out loud. This is a local accent, a native dialect, and it also means you are welcome. This is equivalent to the Boston spoken language here and the British spoken language, but the Eastern spoken language is sometimes almost a different language. Oh Tilda. Gwen finally understood. At the same time, she is even more curious. She looked back at the Chinese representations all over the street here. It's decided. I want to take Chinese courses in college. I think these Chinese are so cool Tilda. Huh? Su Yi was a little surprised. Cool, cool. Gwen nodded fiercely, and I think it sounds good. There are people who have Chinese tattoos on their bodies before our class. Are this? Boo. 170. Symbiote venom? Exclamation mark ready to expose the relationship. Hearing Gwen's words, Su Yi grinned. Tattoo Chinese on your body? Su Yi thought for a while almost getting goosebumps all over his body. Think about how it feels to hold the words of love, dragon, and love in your body. It's too embarrassing for me to copy. So Yi's scalp tingles just thinking about it. And Gwen also speaks Chinese nicely, and Yuwen is nice. Is this reasonable? That makes sense. So Yi suddenly realized, the aesthetics of each country are actually different. For example, some people think that hip-hop is better than Sabi. But some people think hip-hop is so handsome. Just like beatbox. The same is true in language. Some people think French sounds good. Some people think Japanese sounds good, and some people think Russian sounds good. Then definitely some people will think that Chinese sounds nice. Words are the same. After all, Chinese is the most unique word and language in the world. Then someone here tattooed the word on their body. It doesn't seem to be a strange thing. Think about it. Is there a bunch of people who also keep English on their own? That's really no different from when win Chinese. So Gwen was right. That's really it. All right. So Yi sighed. But just don't get this tattoo on your body. Gwen nodded. She wasn't planning to get a tattoo. She was just talking about it. But she was still curious. What happened to this tattoo? So Yi just wanted to explain. Aunt's five finger biscuits are ready. But Wanda went to get it and handed it to Su Yi. Then Su Yi explained. Because it's really low. R? Gwen was shocked. Is this the case in the eyes of people who know Chinese? Su Yi nodded. I can't say all of them, but at least Chengdu thinks so. Here, Su Yi's words. Gwen thought about her former classmates. Immediately felt that he was so pitiful. Then, Su Yi settled the bill. Divide all the food in 420 to everyone. Here. Let's eat. I'll try it. I'll try it. Seeing that it was done, Hala quickly took two and gave one to Tanmai. So Yi distributed it to Gwen. Let's go and continue shopping. Then everyone continued to walk in while eating. Aunt looked to see that everyone was about to leave. He also waved his hand and said, Remember to come here often, pretty boy. So Yi didn't return. Wanda turned around, waved her hand and spoke the only Chinese she knew. Thanks. The moment Wanda said thank you, Aunt was stunned suddenly. She raised her hand, wanting to point to Wanda and say something. Crimson. Aunt opened his mouth and stuttered twice. But after everyone left, the impression in her mind became lower and lower, until completely forgotten. Finally came to her senses and continued to set up her stall. Gwen looked back at Aunt. Then he looked at Su Yi and asked, I thought you'd talk to her for a while. Su Yi smiled and shook his head. There is a saying in our country, that is, rely on your comrades at home, but be afraid of your compatriots outside. I'm afraid it means being cautious. I'm definitely not saying that Aunt is a bad person but that I should be cautious and not trust people casually. Gwen was very surprised after hearing this. Wanda also didn't understand very much. Why? So Yi spread his hands. Maybe it's human nature. That is the truth. Otherwise, there would be no such thing as half the pit of a stranger, a grand slam of acquaintances. Anyway, just be cautious. To make friends, you must gradually get to know each other before making friends. That's all. No one continued to walk in. Chinatown is crowded with people and many people are here. Everyone chatted and chatted. Walking is not idle. Looking at the lively scene around. Gwen sighed. It's so lively, it feels very exciting. Wanda looked at the chattering crowd and agreed. She is also difficult to describe. It just feels powerful. That's right. Su Yi nodded. It must be admitted that when Chinese get together, chatter is the most lively. So there will be a lively and energetic atmosphere on the street. This is different from other streets in New York. Even though there are many people on the streets of New York, most of them are just relatively indifferent, which is commonly known as freedom. But there are many people chatting on the streets of Chinatown, or chatting with a boss for a long time. That is the truth. It's kind of like the feeling of New Year's Eve. Then five people passed by a fish stall, Gwen said, pointing to the fish at the fish stand. Sue, does this word mean fish? Huh? Su Yi smiled and said, how did you see that? Hearing himself was right. Gwen suddenly explained happily, because I suddenly thought just now that this fish looks like the word for fish, so I think it is the word for fish. So you looked at the fish the boss was selling. It really is. After all, Chinese is pictographic and onomatopoeia, and pictographs are the best to recognize. Su Yi smiled, Gwen, 
You have the ability to learn Chinese. Yes, Tilda. Gwen lifted her small chin proudly. She is indeed smart. Do you understand, Xwiba? But at this moment, as soon as Gwen finished making a proud little expression, she frowned and looked aside. At the same time, Tsu Yi and the other three women also noticed this matter. The five looked at the fish stall at the same time. Precisely, it was an old lady who was slowly approaching the fish stall. The old lady approached the fish stall slowly, then watched the fish swimming in the oxygenated pool. The boss found the old woman. He came over and wiped his hands and asked, What kind of fish do you want? The old woman did not speak. Just keep looking at the fish. The boss thought she was crazy when she saw her like this, and she was still sloppy. So he quickly waved his hand and said, As you go, you can just look at it without buying it and don't touch it with your hands. Speak the truth. This boss is okay. I didn't think that he was a lunatic, so he forced him to leave. But the problem is not this. Gwen looked at Suyi at the moment and said, I feel, something inside her that I'm familiar with. Wanda nodded and said, This old lady is no longer controlling herself, her mind has changed to another creature. Hala took a bite of the finger pie. Is it going to be slaughtered? Tanmai smelled it. She seems to be more fragrant than ordinary people. All four women expressed their views. And Suyi frowned. His expression was a little strange. Because isn't that the opening scene of Venom? How did it change until now? No, there is no Venom in this universe either. And the villain boss in the Venom movie is also the Life Fund Company. Nor does this company exist in this universe. So Yi said this when he made Gwen dizzy on the yacht. But now, it appeared again. Have there been any crashed ships recently? So Yi took out and searched. There really are but not the life fund spacecraft, but Jin's spaceship, are this, Su Yi understood immediately, this is when the multi-universe opens up in chaos, at that time, various Marvel elements will be slowly added to each universe, every universe has it, but not all are the same, and the first thing Su Yi discovered with his own eyes was venom, as for the signs found before, there are many, such as Black Panther fell ill early, for example, infinite gems is not right and so on, so, a multi-universe of infinite chaos, here we go, Su Yi looked at the old woman, and said to Gwen in a leisurely manner, Your feeling is right, Gwen, because what's inside her is from the same origin as yours, but yours is progenitor level, and what's inside her is just the offspring of ordinary garbage. For it, in a sense, Venom was originally the sexiest horse among the symbiote planets, but even the strongest batch on the symbiote planet. That's rubbish compared to Gwen's symbiote battle suit. Really rubbish, because Gwen's symbiote battle suit is the original symbiote at the ancestor level. It can be infinitely stronger. It's just made into a battle suit without consciousness. So Su Yi was right. Gwen also understood immediately. Is there a symbiote inside her? No wonder Gwen felt familiar. It turned out to be a symbiote, and Wanda frowned. Are the symbiotes conscious? Whether there is something made, there is the body. Su Yi explained. Otherwise, how can we coax the living body? And at this moment, wow Tilda, the old lady who was staring at the fish went straight to catch the fish. In the stunned eyes of everyone, the old lady's family buckled up all the fish. Then it's a mouthful to the head. Crack Tilda, after a sound of sour teeth sounded, the head of the fish was directly bitten off by the old woman. Then the old lady chewed and ate there. Wanda and Gwen felt sick seeing this. Don't talk about them. Su Yi also felt disgusted, and the surrounding crowd immediately panicked when they found out. What is she doing? Vomit. She's disgusting. Go. Go, don't join in the fun. I saw someone eating fish brains. The surrounding crowd hurried away while feeling disgusted. Don't talk about them. Su Yi walked back with the four girls. Don't splash blood on yourself later. And the boss was immediately disgusted when he saw it, and said with steam at the same time. What are you doing? Are you disgusting? The old woman looked up at the boss. The boss was immediately stared into silence. He stepped back. In reality, people are not stupid. In this current Marvel world, people also know that this person is a bit strange. Maybe there's something wrong, and I am a loss of a fish. But it's not worth it if you lose yourself. Think about it. The boss still walked back, then called the police, and after the old woman ate a fish brain, she chewed. Then he spat out the unpalatable food with a bar, most, then throw the fish away. She looked at the others. Wonder see here. After she used magic to investigate, she said with a displeased face. The internal organs of this old woman are already shrinking and this symbiont can no longer be possessed, and this symbiont wants to eat human brains, Gwen hated it, eating human brains, then let him separate first, yes, symbionts are not completely energy free, if not eating a phenophilament to maintain body energy, it will absorb the host's internal organs such as the liver to provide itself with phenophilament, so the symbiote is attached, also pay attention to eating habits, definitely, chasing it away is easy, so you looked at Gwen and said, as soon as your presence shield is cancelled, You'll know when you go to say hello. Really? Gwen was curious. Then I'll try. Gwen transformed into a symbiote battle suit in an instant. Then leave Su Yi's place. Walked up to the old woman. Finally, he took the initiative to speak. Hey little one inside, what's your name? 
I'm Gwen Stacy. Gwen controlled the volume. This sentence will only be heard by the symbiote in the old woman's body. But at the moment when the symbiote heard Gwen, the old woman's eyes suddenly widened. It looked at Gwen in horror. Then a ball of black liquid flew out of the old woman in an instant. The black liquid first adhered to a fish with a plop. Then it flew straight into the air with a slam. Ended up jumping into a nearby sewer. Gwen. Watching the symbiote flee like this. Gwen was dumbfounded. She turned around and asked Su Yi. I'm so scary. Su Yi smiled. It's not that you are scary but a kind of existence called bloodline suppression, which makes it frightened when it smells your breath. Gwen put her arms around her arms, and the sun shone on the case. How can this be? How can you run away when you see a beautiful girl? Really are. Ah. She also wanted to say hello and find out where it was. Plop Tilda. And after the symbiote left, the old woman beside Gwen also fell down. The organs in her body were already in a state of failure. Then go through the possession of the symbiosis. Then her old body must not be able to bear it. Wanda looked at Su Yi and asked, Let me extend her life and let her return to the state before she was possessed. Su Yi nodded. Yes. After hearing this, Wanda took out the wand of Watambo that Su Yi gave her. She charges the magic on her wand. Then it was transformed into healing magic through the wand and transmitted to the old woman lying on the ground. Omtilda, after a green fluorescent light appeared, with the fluorescence then dissipated, the organs in the old woman's body returned to the state before being possessed by the symbiosis. And that's enough. After the treatment was completed, Wanda put away her wand and took Su Yi's hand again. When Gwen came back, she hugged Su Yi's other hand. She's about to shed her symbiote battle suit. Everyone is ready to leave. DJE. Wow Tilda. Wow Tilda. Etc. Accompanied by the sound of shock. At this moment, Su Yi felt the eyes of everyone. He turned his head, looked at the 3.5 crowd, and remembered the people who took out their phones and cameras. Wanda rescued the old lady. He also temporarily lifted the presence shield on himself. Then the three hugged each other, and Hala and Tanmai are fine if nothing happens in the back. However, the three of them were temporarily exposed. Are ah, this crack, accompanied by a faint camera shutter sound. So Yi knew that the state of the three of them had been photographed. It's Scarlet Witch. It's Scarlet Witch. Wow. And Miss Spider. How are they holding a man? So close. What happened to them? Why are they hugging a man? Could it be? Hearing the voices of the crowd and the exclamation of speculation. So Yi turned his head helplessly to look at Wanda. How to say? Modify memory. Yes. This is the way to go now. Either modify the memory, or go back in time. But Su Yi doesn't like turning back time and using it on his own people. And it is not convenient to modify the memory. So he is more inclined to modify memory. One trick is to select a range, an option, and then snap your fingers. It's okay. D. Wanda thought about it, then shook his head and said, Let's announce this matter, Su. We will know sooner or later. We just announce that we are living in seclusion. Ah. This is hiding again? But it's not impossible. Wanda has said before that she wants to announce her status and relationship. This is an upright and bright announcement. As the saying goes, if a girl is with you and she doesn't even want to announce you, then she doesn't consider you human. I even feel ashamed to be with you. Just make do with finding a dog. So I heard that Wanda wants to use this to announce. So Yi nodded. Yes. Anyway, Gwen wasn't exposed, so it didn't have any influence. But So Yi felt even more relieved. Cough cough cough. Dot. 171. Find another way. A man from the League of Goddesses. Wanda wanted to use this to disclose her identity, and Su Yi had no objection to this. Instead, let others know the man behind the two women. Su Yi was still a little dark. Your goddess, my forehead dot 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 wife. Yes, very happy. Su Yi nodded. He looked at the crowd around him, then wave. The crowd could no longer see them. Huh? Where's Scarlet Witch and Miss Spider? Disappeared. They're gone. It's a pity. I still want to ask who that man is. Oh. My League of Goddesses, in the howling of the crowd, Su Yi and the other five are actually nearby, and here clearly, Gwen laughed as he lifted the symbiote battle suit state, Wanda, when you say that, I don't know how many people will cry under the quilt at night, Wanda doesn't care about stalling hands, anyway, don't care about her, I just want everyone to know that Scarlet Witch is meant to be, when Wanda said this, he also looked closely at Su Yi's eyes, Su Yi reached out and stroked her cheek, the two also got closer and closer, stop Tilda, stop, Stop. Gwen immediately jumped between the two of them to stop them. You are not allowed to show your affection in front of me, unless you bring me with you. So he laughed when he heard that. Okay Gwen, very good, I will take you with me tonight! Exclamation mark. Gwen immediately stood up weakly. Diddy diddy tilde. And at this time, the police officers who had called 911 from the boss before also came. With the arrival of police officers in police uniforms and armed with guns, they came to the place where the crowd was gathered and shouted, Stand out, keep your hands safe. Who is calling? What's going on? With the arrival of armed police officers, everyone disperses and becomes more honest, and will not just join in the fun, or in case someone goes crazy. You can see if they can't empty the magazine. At the same time, 
the boss who called the police also came up and pointed to the old woman lying on the ground and began to explain, and Su Yi is here. He had already walked back with the four daughters, walking on the way home. Gwen hopped 24 and led the way. Wanda looked at her lively back. It suddenly occurred to me, wait a minute, Su, what will Gwen's parents do if they see our exposure? Right. I was talking about my sister earlier. Now it's changed, isn't that the end of it? But well, it's fine. Su Yi waved his hand and said, don't forget that your psychic effect is still there. As long as there is no special event to stimulate them, they will always think you are my sister. Coupled with our presence modification, even if they see it online, they will automatically understand it as a younger sister. Simply put, this is what hypnotic ability is. But not much. If only Spider-Man had hypnotic ability. He'll definitely get Aunt May's hypnotic ability. Cough cough. What Su Yi meant was to let Aunt May stop worrying about Spider-Man. It's not what you think. That's good. Wanda let out a long breath after hearing that. Obviously the same. If this reveals his truth. He might be scolded as a mistress. That would be a big loss. However, Su Yi shook Wanda's hand and asked. The photo just now will go viral tonight, and the whole world will know it tomorrow morning. How do you plan to expose it then? Yes, how to expose? Have a press conference? Or on TV? Or find Avengers to send it on behalf of you? It's all troublesome, and it will once again appear in the public eye. So Wanda thought about it. He also frowned. Su Yi thought for a while, but there was no other way. But at this moment, come on baby Tilda. Let's go Tilda. Su Yi. Wonder? The two turned their heads. I found that little Halo was swiping her phone. There is a video on the phone. The software that broke out the video is TikTok. What is TikTok? Short video app. Its software share has surpassed Facebook and Twitter in previous lives. And now is the time when it is draining and exerting force. So, see here. Su Yi's eyes lit up. He turned his head and met Wonder's eyes with attention. Needless to say, Su Yi already guessed that Wonder was thinking the same as him. Open a personal account? Wonder proposed. Su Yi nodded. I think it's okay. Wonder will be filmed as a vlog. In this way. She can not only appear in the public eye, but also announce her news. How good, just a perfect fit. And Hala saw the two looking at him. She doesn't know how, suddenly asked with a guilty conscience. What's wrong? It's okay, you continue to brush. X2, after Su Yi and Wanda finished speaking this sentence, he turned his head and continued walking. The five of them were on their way home. Wanda took out her phone and turned on the recording function. Then he raised the hand he was holding with Su Yi. Start recording. The picture in the video is only the street and a pair of hands. Su Yi's hand is on the top. Hers is on the bottom. The two people interlaced their fingers, held each other tightly, and walked on the road home happily. And Gwen was still humming in front. This was also recorded on video. After shooting for a while, Wanda put away her phone contentedly. I don't know what she was thinking. But suddenly she smiled charmingly. Um, so you looked at her suspiciously. Wanda explained with a smile. This is just a paragraph, but I don't know what's wrong. The thought of our love vlog will be posted on the internet so that everyone can feel it. I feel very happy and look forward to it when I think that there will be envy jealousy, praise, blessing, etc. Oh Tilda, face this feeling of wonder. Su Yi nodded in understanding. Then your feeling is called showing affection. Show affection? I just want to share my beautiful life with others, and then see the reaction of others. This is showing affection, a kind of BT's desire to share, huh? You are the BT. Gwen also turned around and interjected at this time. That's right, Su is BT, and he likes to look at you when you roll your eyes. Gwen, wonder exasperated. Yeah. Okay, Su Yi said happily after hearing this, there will be more BT tonight, get ready, huh? X2. After a while, the five returned home. Turn my bid farewell to Hala under the building. But wait until Hala gets home. Immediately went to play the game. It is estimated that a little later, her withdrawal reaction will come out. And after Gwen and Wanda finished changing their shoes, the three of them came to the small universe as usual, compared with the floor-to-ceiling windows and night view of another house. Obviously, everyone prefers the vast natural features and bright starry sky of a small universe, and when Sui lay down, Wanda and Gwen definitely were lying in his arms. Gwen hummed softly a song she had rehearsed with the band earlier. Wanda also hummed softly to the accompaniment. Sui closed his eyes and leaned on the recliner, listening to the beautiful female voice reverberating left and right. Two words fun. At the same time, Wanda took out her mobile phone and recorded some scenes of everyone holding hands and cuddling. There are also starry sky, grassland, garden and so on. Definitely, Wanda knows what can and cannot be recorded. She only recorded Su Yi's hands, feet or back. Gwen doesn't even give any pictures. Even if Wanda leaves the country by herself, she also only recorded herself leaning on Su Yi's shoulder. Nothing else. So the mystery is in place. And while doing these things, Su Yi could also tell that Wanda was really happy. She has a lot of potential to show affection. Also really enjoyed doing it. But the next moment, drip Tilda. Gwen's cell phone rang. She frowned, took out her phone and looked at it. Mother? Yes, it was Mama Gwen calling her. After thinking for a while, Gwen connected the phone. Hey mum, Gwen, do you remember you start school this week? R? School is about to start. Gwen, there are three semesters in college, and you don't have that much rest time. Okay, I see. Is there anything else, mum? It's alright, 
But are you at Sue's house? Is his sister Wanda at home? Are you getting along well soon? In addition to reminding Gwen that school is about to start, Gwen's mother, he also began to care about Gwen. How about at Su Yi's house? Wanda watched as Gwen kept talking on the phone. She looked at Su Yi and smiled. Then he took Su Yi's hand and placed it in front of Gwen's body. Gwen shuddered. She turned around to find out. It was Wanda who took Su Yi's hand and did it. Gwen glared at Wanda. But Wanda doesn't care. On the contrary, the smile started to intensify. For example, get up with the technique of Oreo. Su Yi was extremely happy being manipulated. Instead, it assists the operation. And Gwen could only push Su Yi and Wanda back and forth with one hand on one side. While blushing, she continued to talk to her mother. Fortunately, Gwen's determination is relatively strong. Otherwise, she would have to hang up the phone on her own initiative. But after a while, finished chatting with Gwen and mum, she puts away her phone. Then he turned around abruptly and said to Wanda, You're going to die, Wanda. Poor Wanda is physically weak. Soon both hands were clamped by Gwen. Moreover, she was sitting so rigidly that she couldn't even move. Then Gwen looked at Su Yi and said, Sue, what is the BT you mentioned to use against her? Exclamation mark. Su Yi raised his eyebrows. Mine, if you try it for the first time, you will need oil to assist. Question mark. Wanda was taken aback for a moment, and Gwen was also taken aback. Then the two looked at each other, and both thought of the plot they had seen in the comics at the same time. Wanda immediately shook her head and said in fear, Gwen, let me go, or I will be the first to try and it will be your turn. Gwen was still in hesitation, but she thought about it after listening to Wanda's words. Nanas, as long as you lose face first, I can lose face later. So Gwen gritted her teeth and stomped her feet. She offered to turn Gwen over, then sat on her back, pressed Wanda's hands and said, Sue, we are in the same group, I will help you, but you will be more compassionate to me later, and be more ruthless to Wanda. So Yi was very pleased to hear this sentence, it creates the oil directly out of it. Then drip it on Wanda. No, no, Sue. Yow's a big, this one will really die. But she said it was useless. Gwen watched Wanda chirp. So one hand grabbed Wanda's two hands with a tiger's mouth. Then another hand covered Wanda's mouth. So Wanda is a lamb to the slaughter. And Su Yi also cooperated with Gwen. He rode a white dragon horse, held a gentian silver gun in his hand, and found a small path, and finally reined in his waist and reined in his horse to find another way. At the same time, under Gwen's incredible gaze, Wanda also rolled her eyebrows. The next day, Su Yi got up, washed, ordered breakfast and went to work as usual. It's just that Gwen and Wanda still didn't get up today. Still asleep. Let's not talk about the water and fire in the backyard of the two last night. Wait until Su Yi comes to the office. He lay down on the armchair. The whole person let out a long breath. Hatilda, so happy. Wu handed over the milk tea. Su Yi took a few sips after taking it. This is not. If the action and sending points are made into a card game. That Su Yi really collected a lot of cards last night. I really didn't expect that. It turns out that the data in the textbooks is sometimes inaccurate. Why only men can do it there. And women don't feel it. No. Sturgeon 700. Yes. Su Yi has successfully practiced it. But it's hard. And it's another feeling. After experiencing this skill. Su Yi can only say that it is difficult to master, and Su Yi can do this. That's because he learns fast. That's why I was able to throw the shit out of the two people who killed them last night. Literally. This is not. Both of them slept on their stomachs last night. Did not lie down to sleep. This is the record. Next, Ling brought Su Yi's breakfast, and Su Yi also read the latest news while eating. He turned on the news. After reading the content, he smiled happily. Look at what's all over the screen. The man behind the League of Goddesses. Count how many times and why that man appeared. Shocking capture. Scarlet Witch and Miss Spider fell in love with a man at the same time. Who is he? Who is he to them? What happened in this world? Superheroes public relationship. In just one night, at least hundreds of thousands of men in the United States cried bitterly, and the rest cried bitterly after waking up. Don't think about it. If there are ten news items, at least six seven are about the incident last night. The man, Scarlet Witch, Miss Spider. These three words were searched for countless times overnight. I almost gave Google's background server a whole thought who was swiping traffic. It turned out that something big happened. And Google is rushing to gather information, then make a special search result and present it to everyone. Even made a linear timeline. When did that man first show up? And also made a web chat room. Anyone can come in and talk about it. So Yi found this place. He went in and took a look. Good guy. This early in the morning. Ten tens of thousands of people online? This is higher than a bunch of Twitch game anchors online. And what's inside? So Yi took a look and laughed out loud. This showed him that breakfast was getting more and more delicious. For example the dadao middle dot expression. Where is that man? I want to kill him. One on one. Who is that man? If you are a man. Come out and fight us one on one. I buy karma. This is a chat room. Not for you men to lose your temper. Scarlet Witch has found true love. We should celebrate. Yeah. This man is very handsome. I am sure he is worthy of Scarlet Witch. If I am, I like it too. What? Do men only look at handsome ability? Who is he? Is he worthy of a superhero? Yes, that's right. Although he is handsome and has a good figure, 
A strong man depends on his ability, not his face and figure. So Yi was overjoyed to see the quarrel in the chat group. He just dived and watched while eating breakfast. Well, today's breakfast is extraordinarily delicious. Get up at noon. If Wanda posted the edited video online, what will happen then? So Yi belongs to the fun people, so he wanted to send it out quickly. He wants to see people break the defense. 172. Black Panther dies. Captain America joins Wakanda. The relationship is officially exposed. Until noon. Su Yi has not waited for Wanda and Gwen to wake up. Just waiting for a text message from Natasha Romanoff. Natasha Romanoff, Su, Black Panther of Wakanda, King Kala is dead, incurable. Really died? Although Su Yi knew the reason, he still asked curiously. Su Yi, Wakanda claims that its technology is 100 years ahead of the world, and its medical technology is advanced. Why did Black Panther die like this? Natasha Romanoff, I don't know. But what I know is that Captain America really joined Wakanda, he became the head of the Wakanda Royal Army, and Winter Soldier also followed him to become the Wakanda Royal Captain. Natasha Romanoff, Wakanda will also customize a complete set of vibranium equipment for them, provided that they need to support Black Panther's sister, that is, the Royal Camp of Wakanda. As expected, after Black Panther died after suffering real damage from the fourth wall, something has changed in Wakanda, and for the same reason the heart-shaped grass is extinct. No new Black Panthers will be born in Wakanda. So Wakanda continues with a new superhero force, and Captain America and Winter Soldier, who have been hiding in Wakanda before, are obviously the best choices. So the royal family of Wakanda. They suggested that Captain America and Winter Soldier side with the Wakanda royal family, which is Black Panther's own sister, become Wakanda's superhero assistant. And delicious definitely the two. The whole set of vibranium equipment is not enough to kill a lot of people. You know vibranium is more expensive than diamonds. Wear a set of vibranium gear. It's nothing less than wearing diamonds all over your body. Definitely. Captain America and Winter Soldier aren't about that. Captain America wants to use the power of Wakanda to change the power and status of superhero in people's hearts. Short name, Freedom. So the two hit it off. It became the present result. So ye, everyone has their own choice. And Avengers is not the original Avengers. I hope that we will not be enemies when we meet in the future. Natasha Romanoff wholeheartedly agrees. No matter what, it's good to not be an enemy until the end. But then again, Natasha Romanoff, now the internet is full of things about you and Wanda and Miss Spider. Huh, what do you want to do? Speaking of this, Su Yi said happily. Su Yi, it was decided last night that Wanda will open a TikTok personal account in the afternoon, then expose her own affairs, and use it to analyze her life in the future. Su Yi, I don't have any objections. Anyway, Gwen and I won't show up and it won't affect our lives, but watching the crowd wailing online makes me a little happier. Wanda's happiness is to share her desire to show her affection and get people's feedback. So Yi's happiness is watching others screaming in pain, while he and Sheng Sheng are so happy. So dot 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 he felt happier instead. Natasha Romanoff, it's really bad fun, Su, a goddess who plays with others at will. Su Yi, do not talk. The two of them are still lying on the bed. I don't know if I woke up or not. And Natasha Romanoff was right. He is random, and dos. There are also bad tastes. Broken. He has become the villain. Su Yi smiled helplessly. Su Yi, you can't say that. A slap can't be slapped. We are in love. What you say is the same as I am strong. Natasha Romanoff, do you still need to be raped? Which woman is not fascinated by you? It's okay, I won't praise you. What happened in Chinatown last night was a supernatural event. I have to follow it up. See you here. Su Yi replied her last sentence okay. Then turn off the phone. But what made Su Yi curious was, is Eddie Bullock? aka Venom's host, in this universe? So Yi turned to face the computer, then open Google and search for, Eddie Bullock reporter, as expected. There really are, Eddie Bullock, a top reporter for a certain news company, good at collecting extreme news, and the interview questions are also very interesting. There is indeed a profile of Eddie Locke on the page, and his previous past, for example, who took pictures of big events and so on. But what made Su Yi curious was, he was in this universe before the chaos of the multi-universe, just the timeline, came here after the multi-universe chaos, if it's later come here, then how did he have such a complete record, this should be something that exists only in this universe, but look at what happened yesterday, this was discovered after the multi-universe mess again, could it be, is this multi-universe messy different, so ye thought about it, perhaps, the chaos of the universe this time is to directly incorporate other timelines instead of inserting them, it really is, if it is inserted, it's like Stephen crossing the multi-universe, he is an outsider, not a native. But merging into the timeline is different. This is straight up becoming a local. That is the integrate plot. And now Su Yi's universe, it is merging into the timeline. Integrate the plot. The newcomer becomes a local directly. And the timeline is still confused. That is, even now it is after the fourth stage of the Avengers Alliance. But it's still possible that Spider-Man beats up Dr. Octopus. Or like last night's Venom episode. It's obviously a story of a parallel universe. 
but now it is directly incorporated, regardless of the development of the timeline. So Yi thought for a while, then smiled helplessly. It's so interesting and the messy can't do it well. So Yi could still see a bunch of new things, tighter. At this time, another message popped out of his hand, and Su Yi saw that it was still Natasha Romanoff. Natasha Romanoff, by the way, I will let TikTok officially certify Wonder as an official superhero, and help promote it, because I will not focus on it. So Yi nodded and replied okay again. After a while like this, to close to 1 p.m., Wanda and Gwen just came down with their lunch. The two were walking down at the same time. You can also see the unnatural movement of the legs. Wait until the two bring the food to the table. Wanda still sat down gently. Gwen is fine. In fact, she recovered, and it didn't matter much. But Wanda even used the horse charm. Still feels strange dot 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 hot? No. There is a strange dot 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 unexplainable feeling. It's like a faint touch. After putting down the meal, Wanda immediately glared at Su Yi. Big braid too. Gwen had already picked up the meal, and at the same time nodded sharply in agreement. Fried chicken braid too. Su Yi's mouth twitched. He picked up his own job and began to defend himself. You can't say that, you didn't have any pain last night. On the contrary, it made me press a little deeper. Heard the words. Gwen and Wanda blushed instantly. And also at the same time, they also can't think of it. Why can they be happy like that? And when it explodes, even happier than before. And because of his big, the stomachs of the two of them can actually bulge out small bags. This really messed up the two girls. In the end it was all pumped out. I can only sleep on my stomach and don't talk. It was almost impossible to close the door. Do you think Su Yi is cruel or not? The first time I went to a dry battlefield, I reined in and killed indiscriminately. How can there be such a thing? No piece of armor will be left to kill someone directly. To this end, the two women are really painful and happy. So Wanda was eating then suddenly raised her head and gave Su Yi a fierce look and said, You have nothing today, Gwen and I are going to sleep in another room. Question mark Su Yi was full of doubts. He looked at Gwen. Gwen hesitated for a moment, then nodded. That's right, I'm going to sleep in another room with Wanda today, you can't make trouble anymore, I can't take it anymore, Little Beer is going to have a day off. Are this, is this also a holiday? Su Yi was stunned, but think about it too. Both of them were weak and they were killed by Yi in another way, if only to come again tonight. It is estimated that the two will be so happy that they can't close their legs the next day. So Su Yi thought about it, also nodded. Okay, you guys have a good rest for a day, and you can do whatever you want. I really agree. After hearing that Su Yi agreed, Wanda and Gwen glanced at each other, with a twinkle of joy that was both loving and fearful. It's like knowing you'll be happy, but after the joy is the weak look. But it's always nice to have a good day off. It's better than being closed the next day. After a while, the three finished their meal. After Wanda and Gwen cleaned up the dishes, Wanda just came over and said, I'm going to release the video now, Sue. Please help me see if there is anything wrong with the video. So Yi took Wanda's mobile phone or card video and looked at it. The video has no special effects. It is a patchwork of video clips to form a complete video. But the video quality is high. The beginning of the video is a vlog recorded by Wanda herself. She introduced herself as Wanda. At the same time, he talked about his current situation. For example, I already have a partner. I have retired from Avengers. I am a semi-retired superhero. I am a good friend with Miss Spider. I am very excited now. I hope to be a housewife who can always be my partner, etc. Wonder is no nonsense. Every sentence is on the point that everyone cares about. Then after this self-introduction, it is an excerpt video like a short video. For example, he and she held hands, we snuggled together in the garden to watch the starry sky, and we went to the garden to water the lotus and lotus in Wangshan. Under the combination of these fragmentary videos, the full video of Wanda's thoughts is out. It's here. Wanda said a lot of what she wanted to say. For example, why do I like this kind of life? such as my views on superhero and common people, etc. These are at the press conference, or what can be said in the newspaper is endless, and it may be edited and edited by others, but on short video sites, Wanda expressed everything she wanted to express, and it's very intuitive, after reading it, Su Yi also, he nodded with satisfaction, no problem, you can send it, in the video, neither Su Yi nor Gwen was photographed with their faces or full bodies, at most it is hands and feet, or parts, not to mention Gwen, her heels and hands are at best in the camera. The rest are sound at best. And Wanda can appear on camera because she is originally a public figure, because everyone knows her. But Su Yi and Gwen were not, so there's nothing wrong with this video. There is nothing such as revealing the location of the building through the window, or the microcosms being photographed. It can be said that Wanda is very hardworking, and Wanda nodded in satisfaction. Okay, then I'll send it, soon. Wanda registered her own account on TikTok. The result was the instant she registered, the certification of superhero Scarlet Witch came out. Huh? Wanda was taken aback. So Yi took a look and understood. Natasha Romanoff did it for you, so you don't get into unnecessary trouble. Really, if not authenticated, the internet is actually the same mess in all countries. There will definitely be a lot of trouble. 
and after being certified, it will save a lot of unnecessary trouble. Wanda nodded, then upload the video. Because of the superhero certification, soon this video was seen by the backstage staff. Then there is the push flow without money. Alright Tilda, I'm going to water the flowers and practice spells, Sue. Well, let's go. And Wanda from at the moment has put away her phone and gone upstairs. She waters the flowers first. After watering the flowers, go to practice magic. Wanda is very focused when practicing magic, basically. He would not stop to practice until after Su Yi got off work. Every afternoon, from the time after dinner to when Su Yi got off work, it was time for Wanda to practice magic by herself. FFLX, 3 o'clock in the afternoon. Su Yi himself was bored and wanted to check TikTok. And I also want to see if I can get Wanda's video. As a result, he opened TikTok. The first video is Wanda's exposure video. Ah uh, this, at the first moment, Su Yi didn't know that it was the beauty video pushed by Big Data. It's still a system push stream that everyone has. Leave it alone. Take a look first. Wanda's first video is not short. So you watched it repeatedly. The video was several minutes long. But this video has only been posted for an hour or two. There are 230k likes, 54k comments, 49k shares and favorites. On TikTok, K means thousand. That is, this video by Wanda, Nuo Zhao Zhao has 230,000 likes in 2 hours, 50,000 or so favorites and shares. This push flow is too much. Doesn't everyone push it once? So Yi felt a little bit. While he didn't care, it was outrageous in the normal course of events. This is equivalent to making a wooden sword yourself, and its value is the same. But if you pick up a piece of wood that looks like a wooden sword, it is priceless. It's almost a truth. Immediately afterwards, the time comes to 4 p.m. When So Yi watched it again. He liked it and flipped it over again. Wait until 5 p.m. Not only is the data not exhausted, but it is still spreading like a bamboo. So so you liked the video. Get off work first. We'll talk about it when the time comes. Patter. Wait until Su Yi gets off work and closes the door. He went up to find Wanda and said with a smile. Guess how many likes your video got, Wanda. Wanda first asked curiously. Did you get my video? Yes. So Yi nodded. Then Wanda stepped on. 5k, 5k, so ye couldn't help laughing. Is that too much? Wanda was a little disappointed to hear that. No matter how you say it is very popular superhero, it is really not enough face to post a video up to 5k. But Su Yi shook his head and said, for 5k, you have to multiply it by hundreds of times. Hundreds of times? Wanda was taken aback for a moment, and she did some calculations in her head. Breaking a million? Su Yi nodded, yes. When Wanda heard it, she quickly got up and went to get her phone to check her clothes. Wait until she turns on TikTok on her phone. So Yi saw her backstage from the side. Good guy. Do you understand fans 999 plus messages 999 plus comments 999 plus and everything is 999 plus scenes. Wanda was overjoyed when she saw it. She quickly looked at Su Yi and said. Do you have a TikTok account? I want to follow you, and I only follow you. 173. Gwen also exposes her love affair, the service of the twin dancers, question mark. Here Wanda wants to focus on herself, just focus on yourself. Su Yi's first reaction was that there should be no beauty videos in my likes and favorites, right? If anything, Wanda's fans will definitely see a large number of people come in to see who he is after seeing the attention of him alone. That in case there is a bad record, this is really social death, wrong. I don't seem to have likes and favorites, and the account number is also the initial number. That's fine. So Su Yi took out his mobile phone and made DA pay attention to him. As for whether his account needs to be decorated, certified and personalized, feel sorry. Not at all. We are the initial number. Add nothing. Even the name is, user. Very simple. After Wanda focuses on herself, so the background message lights up a small red circle. He clicked on it. Fans plus one. And this fan is superhero Scarlet Witch Wanda. So Yi turned back with one hand. Immediately afterwards in the next moment, he saw what is called, drainage. It was only a few seconds before Wanda paid attention to him. So Yi's background information began to soar. From 1.2.3 directly to 99 plus all attention and private messages have also started to send messages so ye took a quick look outside most people are asking themselves what is their relationship with wanda who is wanda wanda also leaned over to take a look then asked weakly did i trouble you so so you looked at these messages and smiled definitely not then so ye edited his personal information he didn't move just changed the automatically added the author is lazy nothing too Scarlet Witch's husband. Wanda's eyes lit up immediately after seeing this. She immediately knew what Su Yi was doing. And then I saw that Su Yi had turned on, prohibit any non-following at, prohibit anyone from private messages, prohibit, etc. in the settings. Wanda finally couldn't help laughing. Su, are you good or bad? People like you are not only uncomfortable, but there is nothing you can do about it. Then I will see a good video in the future. I can also add below. Su Yi smiled happily. You're right. Obviously, Su Yi did it on purpose. Now. After Su Yi clears the background messages again, everyone follows Wanda to Su Yi's account. You can only pay attention to Su Yi's initial account. Any operations such as at, private chat, 
etc. are not allowed, and I also want to see the sentence in his profile. Scarlet Witch is old 130 male. You just say that hatred is not full. If this two years in the game, 100% want to be a main tank. But what Su Yi didn't expect was that. Wanda laughed suddenly after reading the new reply. Su, look quickly. Many people are already asking me who I am following. Many people have told me that your personal information has been modified. These people feel like they're on the verge of tears. Su Yi tilted his head and looked. Almost laughed out loud. So miserable. At the same time he glanced at Wanda's fans by the way. Good guy. This already has 950,000 fans. So fast. It's only been a few hours. If Wanda is playing the genre of faith becoming a god. This wave must not let her take off. Definitely. Belief in becoming a god is not exactly like this. Must be a believer. Next. Wanda threw away her phone and went to make dinner. No matter how important it is to show affection, that's what matters to the husband. And Su Yi came to the small universe. As soon as he comes in, I saw Gwen leaning against that kind of tree. She plants trees so fast. Wanda made her an extra large shovel. So Gwen shoveled a big hole. Then plant your favorite beech trees, apple trees, cherry blossom trees, ginkgo trees and so on. She doesn't care about seasons, breeds, heights, habits, or colors. In short, it depends on its good characteristics. Gwen rattled, can live anyway, see the effect later. And the apple trees that Gwen had planted before were already as high as a person's chest. Just for a while, it is estimated that the preparation results will be higher than others. Definitely not necessarily. The good location of the small universe determines that the trees here will not be limited by the land, so they can grow as much as they want and grow very large. Therefore, the distance between the Gwen species is relatively far. Then we can see the effect. The distance of planting can be changed but the density of planting is troublesome. After watching Gwen's persevering every second, he planted a tree for a while. So you beckoned. Gwen, stop planting, dinner is coming. Hearing that dinner was ready, so Yi came back. P.S.S.D. Tilda. Gwen dug the oversized shovel into the ground. Then he ran back and asked, how about Wanda's video? As she posted it, let me check it out. You can see it after swiping your phone a few times. Here, Su Yi's words. Gwen took out her phone, then downloaded TikTok to check it out. As expected, she brushed it casually twice and it really hit it. Only, follow the crowd to the living room. Wanda prepared the dishes after they came out. Gwen's dissatisfied voice was heard. Hello, Su. Wanda only cares about you. But why does your profile say that you are Scarlet Witch's husband? And me? Then Su Yi's helpless voice came. Wanda was exposed. So I wrote about her. If I add you, what if I cause you a lot of trouble? Then Gwen said after hearing it. Then I will also expose our relationship. I'm going to certify superhero Gwen right now so I can only post my Miss Spider creations. It just so happens that I still have a lot of pictures and videos of fighting criminals in my phone. I can post some more videos. After dinner, Sue, you and I will record it. Wanda was taken aback upon hearing this. Gwen is going to expose Miss Spider's relationship. Notice. This is about identity. In identity. Gwen is Gwen, Miss Spider is Miss Spider, so what Gwen wants to expose is her superhero status and romance. But it doesn't matter to me in reality, unless the person's appearance is exposed. So Gwen can do it this way too. And it makes people even more curious. Who is the spider lady in the battle suit? You want to be exposed too? Well, I'll take pictures with you. But you have to be careful, remember to check if your videos violate the rules when you upload them. Then I change my profile. Cool. Husband of Scarlet Witch and Miss Spider, how is it? Gwen thought about it. Miss Spider is a little out of place. Really? Compare that to Scarlet Witch. Miss Spider really doesn't quite fit the name. But Wanda stepped forward and suggested. Then it's called, how about, Husband of Goddess League. Gwen's eyes lit up after hearing this. Ah, the League of Goddesses only have Wanda and Gwen. Isn't the Husband of Girls Union the Husband of Wanda and Gwen? Think here. Gwen nodded in agreement. That's it. Yes, but Su Yi felt weird. Husband of the League of Goddesses? Is this a bit too BT? The Alliance of the Goddesses has become his harem. Definitely it was. But it always feels a bit too BT. And if the personal information is changed to this, you think about it. Husband of Goddess Alliance. Is it crazy? I took the whole league down. Think about it this way. Su Yi still felt a little irritated. Su, Gwen asked for advice. Su Yi finally nodded. Okay, that's it. Made it this way. Why can't he be crazy? Is he unworthy? If he doesn't deserve it. Who else deserves it? What's wrong with madness? Anyway, no one in common knows Su Yi, and they can't get in touch with him cough cough cough. So don't panic at all. Little Hala, who was playing games in the living room, snorted after seeing this. Childish. Can you be more mature like me? How old do you still want to play exposure and swear sovereignty? Like me? How nice and convenient. Isn't it a man? I hail a belly. Empty. Go to gulp. If it is full, forget it and wait for this absorption to turn into divine power. That's great. This is called maturity. Hala, it's time to eat. Coming. Heard it was time to eat. The Hala game is suspended immediately. Then go show off the rice. Wait until after eating. Gwen took Su Yi to the small universe to shoot a short video. No, to shoot a short video. And the general content is. She made a set. Tkfer, according to Wanda's template. 
but there is a difference, Gwen talks more. She had something new to say when she introduced herself. For example, Gwen was hanging from the roof of the building wearing a battle suit, then holding the phone. I went to swing in various buildings in New York by myself. He even ran to the Stark building for a walk. In this way, Gwen introduced herself while flying over the building from a first-person perspective, and revealing that he already has a relationship with a partner. That's all. Gwen went out to take a photo afterwards. I turned off the recording early and went home. After arriving home, so you watched Gwen's first-person self-introduction video. He sighed directly. You may still have the ability to be a director, Gwen. This mirror, this scene, and this damn introduction to the introduction. This video of yours will definitely go viral, and there will be a lot of people imitating you with special effects. When Gwen heard that, he immediately burst into joy. Really? That's great. I'm posting it now, so you can change your profile too. By the way, I want to pay attention to you too. Just follow you alone. All right. So Yi smiled helplessly. How to play this set are. Then Gwen started sending videos and certifications. In Nata, Sarah's preparations. Gwen quickly nailed it, and Su Yi also modified his personal information. Husband of Goddess Alliance. Seeing that the initial account has not changed anything is after changing the personal information. Su Yi nodded in satisfaction. Then he couldn't help but smile. This is really messed up. He didn't know that many people would want to scold this account. Think about it this way. Su Yi smiled happily again. Su. I followed you. Mutually closed. Then Su Yi and Gwen interacted with each other. He also clicked on Gwen's video to take a look. The prologue is on a glass wall of a mansion. Gwen looked at the road under her feet and the night scene in the distance. She turned to look at the glass wall. Gwen's figure was also reflected in the glass. Gwen first waved to herself in a mirror, then start introducing yourself with the first sentence. Hello, I'm Miss Spider, a member of the League of Goddesses, a certain boy's life partner, forever. After finishing this opening sentence, Gwen shot cobweb and then drifted through the city full of night scenes. She went to many buildings, floating through many alleys. When you encounter a crime, you can solve it easily. Then continue wandering in the city. During this process, Gwen told her own story and analyzed her daily life and so on. Definitely, she didn't say anything that would reveal her location and identity. Gwen just said that she has a family that loves her. She has a partner who loves her. She loves this world. Wait until the end of the video. Gwen flies to a leak in Stark's mansion in first person view. And the alarm and prevention and control on the Stark building were not punished at all. But it doesn't matter, because Gwen at the moment stood on top of one of the tallest buildings in Manhattan, and then said, while overlooking the entire New York, you call me Miss Spider, you call me Superhero, and the League of Goddesses, but compared to these, According to my partner's words, superhero, it's just a matter of interest, and the real thing is daily life, so I want to be his little Spider-Man more than Miss Spider, I want to watch the sunrise and sunset with him, I want to go shopping and have fun with him, I want to spend every day with him in the future. This is the real Miss Spider, I'm done, bye. After saying these words, the video ends with Gwen turning off the video. Then Gwen came back, so Yi nodded in satisfaction after reading it. Gwen, your creativity is really good and the sense of substitution is too strong. After watching it, Wanda also clicked the first like in her account. Great, I knew I would start with magic too, instead of a normal one. So he shook his head. No, everyone has their own style. Wanda's daily opening is more like a housewife style. Wanda thought about it. Right, after uploading the video. As soon as Gwen put her cell phone in her pocket, Mimi was happy. She doesn't even know why. With such an exposure, Gwen also felt at ease. It just feels real. To put it simply, if it is officially assigned, it is yes. One thought here. Gwen is also interested in recording daily life and making personal vlogs. So she took Wanda's hand and said, let's go back to the room and study together how to make a good video. Wanda's eyes lit up. She looked at Suyi, and made an expression that she would not go to work tonight. I went to the spare room with Gwen to rest. Suyi, it's broken. What will Nunu do if he has no fields to plow? Suyi lay on the reclining chair of Xio and fell into deep thought. Looking for Hela? Hela is not enough to fight. She was alone, and to Suyi. It was either a side dish or a dessert. Not a real dish at all. To put it bluntly, so ye can lift Halo up and walk without touching the wall, or using hands and feet. Is this a joke? Ask Halo to deal with so ye alone. Even if it's not deadly, at the moment outside the door of the small universe, Wu and Ling squatted at the door, and after looking at so ye in the small universe, the two had a heart-to-heart -heart communication. Master is alone, Ling. Gwen and Miss Wanda seem to be resting tonight, dancing. Then we, the two nodded. Then he stood up at the same time and walked in gracefully with his hands behind his waist. And before entering the small universe, Ling also closed the door intimately. But after Su Yi thought about it, playing with a pen, he thought for a while, as if he really had to use a pen. And the next moment, the dancer also just came over. Ling squatted on Su Yi's left, and brought a bottle of drink and snacks. Wu squatted in front of Su Yi and said softly, This is the meaning of the dancer's existence. After Wu finished speaking, Ling said again, Just rest in peace. The dancer will do everything. Su Yi. What else to say? Swing. Su Yi rested his hands behind his head, motionless, and began to bear silently, 
waiting to die. Dot. 174. Benz. Godzilla equipped with power gems. It has been changed many times, but there is no way. It has become stricter, so I can only write a little bit. Speak the truth. Watch the twin dancers dance. So Yi doesn't need to do anything. He just needs to lie there and watch. He put his hands behind his head. Watch the wonderful performance of twin dancers. The two of them are like flying butterflies, generally. Even if Su Yi sometimes thinks of participating by himself. But still, the twin dancers will continue to lie down and talk while pressing their chests. Leave it to the dancers. Listen to the voice. Su Yi has nothing else to say. He just needs to lie down. And the dancers are like two ballet dancers. They show off their dance ability to the fullest. The two danced lightly in front of Su Yi's eyes, dancing gracefully and Thun was gorgeous. The movements of ballet are extremely charming. Su Yi never thought that it could be used in this kind of place. It really enlightened him. Su Yi was a little shocked. It was as if Su Yi was about to be killed. This twin dancer's ballet template is a bit too powerful. Their waists are as flexible as snakes. Snakes move by twisting to generate thrust. The twin dancers did the same just now. But such words. Is the snake bone in the snake about to be twisted? Right. That is it. Hiss. Su Yi gasped inwardly. That's all. I do not know how long it has been. Su Yi was a little weak and randomly found a bedroom and opened the door. Then went to bed and rested. At the same time, in the depths of the universe. Um, in the solar system, the star Cybertron. After experiencing the Legion War, the King Kong civilization has nothing to lose by shapeshifting it. Although the descendants of shapeshifting King Kong are not without casualties, they are the fighters of this large-scale war. Only one-tenth of the total strength of the shapeshifting Congo army. Not even two. So this is a normal battle loss. It can even be said to be a big win. And Cybertron didn't celebrate like a normal civilization. The shapeshifting King Kong civilization made up for all the war damage in one day. Then let the two legions continue to perform their operations. This shocked Collector very much. He asked the elders. Don't the descendants of shapeshifting King Kong need to celebrate? You have defeated the strongest legion in the universe. Collector understands very well. For the outcome of this war, I believe that no matter which civilization in the universe is a record in the annals of history. Don't talk about singing and dancing. It's not a problem to change this day to Empire Celebration Day. But the answer of shapeshifting King Kong was even more unexpected to Collector. Victory in war is only one of the results of the development of civilization. It's not something to celebrate. It means test scores are just one of the inevitable consequences of your hard work. This is for sane shapeshifting King Kong. Not something to celebrate. For shapeshifting King Kong. They are like super academic masters one by one. Fraction? Just icing on the cake. What should be celebrated is when they break through one by one scientific and technological achievements, strengthen the legion, and develop civilization. With these, it will surely bring the fruits of victory. None of these. Hopeful victory is just a joke. Even with the mental preparation. But Collector was still shocked when he heard this. How can a civilization with such a mentality not be strong? There are no worthless people under the famous name. A powerful civilization is not made of mud. It is precisely because of the rapid development and hard work of the shapeshifting King Kong civilization that it has become so powerful now. Even the Thanos Legion can blast the hammer. Definitely. If not for Godzilla. Then the battle damage of the shapeshifting King Kong core may be 3-5. But now only 10% has been lost, and this 20% unnecessary loss, it's all in exchange for Godzilla rushing into the enemy army alone to attract firepower. It's not an atomic breath huddled in its own legion. It flies into the enemy's legion to inflict random damage. Then spin, jump, and spin around with your eyes closed and atomic breath. That is, under the efforts of Godzilla, the battle damage of the shapeshifting King Kong Legion was reduced to the theoretical minimum. Think here. Collector is really sighing. The creator is really God. Throwing any pet down can kill Thanos indiscriminately. And at the moment, a purple light wave suddenly came from directly above Cybertron. And the two are clearly far apart. But the planet Cybertron was still affected. Fortunately, the impact is not big. It is equivalent to a magnitude 6 earthquake. This is not a big problem for Cybertron's steel ecological planet. Even if there is a magnitude 12 earthquake on Cybertron, there will be no problems with the buildings on the surface of the planet. Definitely. If there are no fixed facilities inside, it will definitely be chaotic. But the key now, could it be that the experiments of the elders were successful? The collector looks up with the elders. At the moment Cybertron planet, there is a floating continental platform with a distance of 10,000 meters. This platform is for Godzilla. What are you going to do? Arm Godzilla. Because after the last war, the elders all realized how powerful Godzilla really is, and how much potential it has. So the elders immediately prepared to do what Su Yi said. Upgrade for Godzilla. In the light of the creator, Godzilla and shapeshifting Kong are inseparable from each other. No matter who helps others. He is helping himself. So one vote was unanimously passed. It is, creating exclusive equipment for Godzilla middle.1000 colon 0. Unanimous vote. So what is Godzilla upgrading now? No doubt, after Collector looked up, he could see Godzilla wearing an oversized metal necklace around his neck. This necklace is about 1000 meters long and tens of meters thick. At the bottom of the necklace hangs an amethyst gemstone. Logically speaking, 
Infinite Gems is not such a big tree, so Amethyst Gemstone is actually a special translucent metal of purple. It is bound by the ends of a metal necklace, and in the middle of it is the most kernel. They are infinite gems only a few centimeters in diameter, and it is the power gem. You can probably understand it when you see this. What kind of equipment does shapeshifting King Kong civilization make for Godzilla? Infinite Gems Necklace. Yes, this is exactly what Collector and the Elders came up with. The reason is, Thanos after being blasted away by Godzilla's atomic breath, the veterans watched the 30-plus shapeshift in King Kong backstage recordings with Collector. It turned out to see Thanos' Infinity Gauntlet paired with Infinite Gems, so shapeshift in King Kong Civilization feels copy. No, it is self-research, so Godzilla wears the Infinity Necklace, and on the necklace are Infinite Gems. Then the shockwave just now. In fact, it is caused by the moment the equipment is installed. At the moment Collector looks up at Godzilla. Godzilla glows purple. Its eyes emit a rich purple light, and the original blue light on its dorsal fin became mixed with blue purple light and began to charge. Beep tilde beep tilde beep beep, after ho ho tilde. Finally, roar as Godzilla soars into the sky. The floating continent sank a lot. Blue purple surrounds the atomic breath of lightning and thunder and shoots into the depths of the universe, and this laser is very big. Originally, Godzilla's breath had a file size of tens of meters in diameter at most, because Godzilla's mouth is that big, but it's different now. The laser is behind Godzilla's mouth, expand directly to a diameter of 100 meters before continuing to shoot out. That is to say, Godzilla's current atomic breath is much bigger than its head, and this is Godzilla's atomic breath without Super Saiyan state. If the Super Saiyan state is turned on, the power of that breath is unbelievable. But there is no need to worry about Godzilla not being able to hit moving targets. That's easy for Godzilla. It can still lock onto enemies. A long time passed like this. Wait until Godzilla's atomic breath is finished. Under Collector's shocking eyes, Godzilla lowered his head slowly, and its body is full of rich purple glow. It seems that the electric current of purple is beating on it. Collector looked at the instrument data. High energy value. Off the charts. That is to say, the breath of Godzilla just now has exceeded the high energy limit that the shapeshift in King Kong civilization can detect. It just exploded. XX3. Collector is extremely shocking. And there's nothing wrong with Godzilla right now. What does this mean? This means Godzilla can use infinite gems. And it looks harmless to use. There is no loss at all. But also right. Take this constitution of Godzilla. It should be able to withstand the influence of infinite gems. The power gem depends on the physical fitness of the user. And Godzilla's physical fitness is not too good. So Godzilla is a perfect match for the power gem. Works perfectly with infinite gems too. Just that breath. It's close to being a level single universe. As long as Godzilla is a little more used and familiar. It might be an atomic breath capable of killing the celestial group. Definitely. It has to be weaker now. That's all. With the infinity necklace installed. Godzilla has the strength close to the level single universe. At the moment. It is already the most powerful warrior of the shapeshift in King Kong civilization. None of them. Even the Star Destroyer Cannon of the Veteran is at best a level Godfather, that is, it can destroy stars. But if Godzilla's current strength is cholera in the solar system, then the whole solar system can't stand it. Its atomic breath can even blow up the solar system. So now Godzilla. It is really the number one of shapeshift in King Kong civilization. At the same time, somewhere in deep space, as the space here began to bump up and down sharply, crack tilde. It was as if a mirror had been torn apart. The space of the universe suddenly hit. Open a crack with huge amounts of. Immediately afterwards, several creatures squeezed their heads and wanted to come out. They are crowded and blocked. But even if they are squeezed, they are still swarming out. PSSD tilde. After the first creature was squeezed out, it is extremely ferocious, and its whole body exudes a cruel aura. And it is. Annihilate the zerg. With the first oblivion zerg out of negative space, the cracks linking the negative space are getting bigger and bigger. Then came the second, and the third. Soon. 100 will come out at one time, and 100 will be brewed. At the end there will be 1000, 2000. Wait until after the night has passed. There's already a whole oblivion zerg piled outside, and the cracks in the negative space have also been squeezed dozens of times larger. Immediately afterwards, an annihilating zerg wearing armor flew out, and then, even a head of purple sweet potato essence flew out. Annihilation bug king greed absorbs the breath of the universe. It looked around excitedly. And after seeing the galaxy, the obliterator's eyes are full of desire to destroy, and Thanos looks at space. My heart is full of thoughts about the return of the king. After half a sound, obliterator asked Thanos directly, which are the strongest empires in this universe? Thanos looked at his infinity gauntlet and said, Nova Empire, Skrull Empire, Kree Empire, shapeshift in King Kong civilization. Obliterator nodded upon hearing that. Which empire is closest to us? Zero. Thanos looked around and could only roughly determine where he was. But from this point of view, no doubt, Thanos looked in one direction and said, The closest to us is the Xandar Galaxy, the Novu Empire. Thanos finished. Annihilation said with a wave of his hand, You lead the way. We want to conquer every civilization and life planet that passes by. None of them will be spared. Thanos frowned. Kill all. Kill all. Thanos thought about it. You can also kill them all. If they are all killed, 
the resources of the universe will be useless. The goddess of death was probably happier seeing so many people being murdered. So Thanos nodded. Wait until all the warships that annihilate their Zerg come out. Thanos waved his hand broadly. Enter the battleship and enter the coordinates. And their goals. It's kill. The next day, wait until Su Yi wakes up. Only then did he realize that he was holding two lumps of flesh again in his arms. Look down. It's Wanda and Gwen. Um, didn't they change bedrooms and sleep overnight? Su Yi looked at the ceiling and the environment. Oh, it turned out that I entered the wrong door last night. He found Wanda and Gwen just by feeling. Don't blame him either. Now Su Yi's hands are not hugged and added by fleshy things. He even felt empty in his hands. Look at the time. 8.40. Q.O. I have to get up. So Yi pulled his hand out of the peach grapefruit. Then I got up and changed my clothes to take a simple Washington. Then let Ling order breakfast. And he took the dance and went down first. After arriving at the office, Su Yi lay down and Wu got milk tea. Tun Tun took a few mouthfuls. Su Yi let out a long breath. And Wu didn't return to her original position immediately today. She could see Su Yi's relaxation. So she walked behind Su Yi. Go around the two sides of the armchair with both hands. And then place them above Su Yi's collarbone to press the trapezius muscle or neck muscles and upper chest muscles. Who tilde? Su Yi relaxed his muscles and let Wu press them. Otherwise, he exerted a little force. Wu couldn't press it at all, and the relaxation of dancing is indeed very comfortable. It also made Su Yi breathe out comfortably. Wu also asked in Su Yi's ear, Master, out of 100 points, how many points can you get for last night's dance? Su Yi stretched out a finger. One point. Wu's voice was a little lost. Su Yi moved his fingers slightly and panicked. 11 points. Wu's voice was a little happy but not much. But, Su Yi shook his finger again. Wu kept his hands, but was slightly taken aback, and asked a little flattered. 111 points? N. Su Yi made a nasal sound and nodded. Wu was a little puzzled. The full score is 100. How can Wu get 111 points? Is this a bug? Who knew that Su Yi put away his hands, closed his eyes and leaned on the cushion and said, too lazy to move. Consciousness is. I can circle my fingers and compare it to zero. But 111 is simpler. Wu has no expression, but he is helpless and happy in his heart. Who told this to be her master? She likes to do it. Dot. 175. Tony also opened an account. Crazy exposure heat. Relax with the pressure of the dance. After a while, Ling came down with Su Yi's breakfast, while enjoying a delicious breakfast from Nora in the fridge. While sipping milk tea, Su Yi habitually turns on the news to see the latest events, as expected, exploded. Don't ask what's blown up. It was Wanda and Gwen's video yesterday that blew up. It was the same as the photo that was exposed and captured at that time. 7 8 out of 10 news stories today have to be about Wanda, Gwen, and that man, which is my own. So you looked at the title first. League of Goddesses opened a personal account. Do you want to know the life of superhero for the first time? Follow them now. Scarlet Witch blew herself up in love. Now she has become a housewife. I don't like the hustle and bustle of the city. I love my husband more. Miss Spider proves her love. She is still a superhero. But she also loves normal life more. Who is that man? He actually appeared in the video of the League of Goddesses at the same time. Why did he become the husband of the League of Goddesses? The famous director expressed that he wanted to use Miss Spider's shooting techniques to shoot new movies, and he highly praised Miss Spider's first-person short video. Call it a masterpiece, good guy. Too much, it's just too much. So Yi couldn't finish reading the news headlines. News about the League of Goddesses is everywhere. Discussing about love, discussing video originally, discussing video content, discussing superhero, discussing Su Yi. It can be said that it is discussed everywhere. This thing has been blowing up since the day before yesterday. At that time, everyone was asking who is this Jiba? Why was he hugged by two superheroes? As a result, Gwen and Wanda blew up their relationship the next day. This directly confused everyone. Don't you want traffic? Are you not afraid of losing your fans? Are you not afraid that someone will not want to? The answer is, it doesn't matter. This is the love between Wang 820 DA. Gwen and Su Yi, it's not someone else's. I blew myself up. Take care of your business. If the fans are gone, it will be gone. If they really don't have fans, they don't even have to volunteer. Moreover, Wanda and Gwen don't value fans. They're not homelanders. Losing some fans will feel distressed for a long time. For Wanda and Gwen, fan, if it's gone, it's gone. I finished reading the news. Su Yi turned around and searched the website of Goddess Alliance on the computer. There is now a chat room under the League of Goddess website. And there is also AI automatic management. If you want to chat, log in your own identity information. You can chat normally, but if you send illegal information, the degree of eradication will be divided into a warning once, and the identity will be banned next time. There is another one that is directly banned without warning. Su Yi entered the chat room to catch up. He doesn't speak. Just take a look, Cheng. 
The at the moment chat room already has dozens of channels. Each channel has an upper limit of 501000 people. Definitely not all chatting either. But the chat content inside is still scrolling rapidly. Damn it. Who is that man? Who has his true identity? I want to challenge him one on one. Damn it. Why would the League of Goddesses find the same man as a partner? I'm so jealous. Dot 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 so angry. I cried all night last night. I can't believe that the League of Goddesses is lying in a man's arms. Especially when they have the same photo on their video screen tilde. I know that photo. The right side of Scarlet Witch is Miss Spider's hand. The left side of Miss Spider is Scarlet Witch's hand, and the chest in the middle is that man's. Ugh, I want to kill him. Watching the wailing in the chat room, a happy smile appeared on the corner of Su Yi's mouth. Isn't this happiness coming? Although a bit cheap. But happiness is also true happiness. This is too happy. Su Yi flipped through other chat rooms. Um, basically they want to kill themselves. That is, want to kill yourself. Have a look. Do nothing enemy or people. What is the most powerful villain? Tactical retreat. After swiping the chat room again, look at the person who repeatedly wants to kill himself. So ye close the web page. Definitely there are other discoveries as well. For example, more women are more curious about Su Yi's real identity and facial details. The last snapshot only captured the side face. Most people can only see half of Su Yi's eyes, half of the bridge of the nose, half of the mouth and chin. So many women want to see Su Yi's full face. But it's a pity. I can't see it. Hey Tilda. Mysterious plus curious. In addition, Su Yi is the husband of the Goddess Alliance. So many women are already fantasizing about Su Yi's true identity and reality in their hearts. There's even a tendency toward mythology. Definitely. Myths are fine too. Because Su Yi is better than Shen Du. 10 o'clock. Because Su Yi didn't bother the two girls last night. So Gwen and Wanda got up early today. They made breakfast themselves. And wait until breakfast is ready. Gwen took her breakfast, fruit, and mobile phone and couldn't wait to run downstairs to find Su Yi. She puts breakfast on the table. Then he took out his phone and opened his personal account and handed it to Su Yi in surprise. Su, I gained a million followers overnight. This is crazy. The likes of the video are almost 10m. So Yi took Gwen's phone and looked at it. In the column of fans. Gwen's fans are 2m. What do you mean? 1m equals 100k equals 1 million. So 2m equals 2 million fans. 10m likes are 10 million likes. Gwen has only posted this video for a day. It was able to push the flow to such an extent. You are not a normal system push stream at all. Instead, the Avengers Alliance contacted official support and did so on purpose. But this is also normal. Personal account registered by superhero. As long as the official TikTok is not stupid. They will all know how much traffic and new users this will bring them. So TikTok officials don't even need to say hello from the Avengers Alliance. They themselves are pushing the stream like crazy. Now almost everyone who opens TikTok will see Gwen and Wanda's videos. You said that this push flow is not fast. Gwen is a star. So Yi smiled and returned the phone to Gwen. It's quite interesting. But it doesn't matter if you are a celebrity or not. I can share some of my daily life in the future and let them pay more attention to personal safety. Gwen dismissed the red dot prompt. Then look at the comments section. While eating breakfast, Su Yi nodded. Gwen was right. Wait for a while. The fan appeal of Gwen's account should not be too strong. Maybe New York officials issued a pass. For example, the city is too dangerous tonight. Citizens are requested not to go out at night at home. Who would listen to such words? It's not that it's going its own way. But Gwen said so. There are really many people who don't go out, especially children. Compared to Wanda, Gwen seems to have many more fans than Wanda. And there are all ages. There are also a lot of children. Oh, right. Spider-Man seems to be a big star no matter which universe he is in. The amount of suction is horrible. Part of Tilda. At this time, the door was pushed open by Wanda. Wanda also handed the phone to Su Yi and smiled. Sue, look at the comment section. It's really funny. So Yi took the phone and looked at it. Wanda has 1.8m fans and 8m likes on the video. That's 1.8 million fans and 8 million likes. Logically speaking, Wanda posted the video half a day earlier than Gwen. So it should be more than Gwen. But it turned out not to be like this. Because Gwen's video is more exciting, and the content is more exciting and immersive. And there are more people who like Gwen. So Gwen's video overtook Wanda. Oh Tilda this result seems a bit bad. Hope Wanda won't be sad. After reading the data, so Yi clicked on the comment section to look again. Turn out good guy. The first comment is, FK, tell me who this man is, the husband of the League of Goddesses, he really deserves to die. The second comment is, superhero should also have his own life and happiness, thanks to Scarlet Witch for helping the city. The third comment is, ladies and sisters, I want to know what the husband of the League of Goddesses looks like. Here are the top three comments, even the likes of the comments reached 1 2 m. But Wanda only replied to one of them. That is the third article. The third article is a female internet celebrity, and Wanda's reply was, sorry, I have to ask my dear for his opinion, and wait for him to agree to come, but I don't think he will agree. What a waste of time. Wanda knew that Su Yi would not agree, but she deliberately replied like this, 
just to show the intimacy between the two. So much love, too much dog food. Tzu Yi smiled helplessly after seeing it, then returned the phone to Wanda. You are really naughty. HMPH Tilda Wanda hummed twice proudly, then move on to her fruit and vegetable salad. As for Gwen's comment section, Tzu Yi took a look. She also interacts, but not much. Basically, I interact with some female fans, not with male fans. Um, Tzu Yi felt a little strange. Gwen, you don't only like female fans, do you? No no no. Gwen raised her finger, the problem is not men and women. But male fans are quite naive. Sue, you are already the best, why should I talk to them? A smile appeared on Su Yi's face when he heard it. Have to say, he loves to hear that. Gwen meant it. He was the best, the other men were average. So there's no need to bother. I said it all before. She doesn't necessarily need fans. Interaction is only for fun and happiness. Gwen is not a female fan either. She also only replies to comments that are interesting and meaningful. For example, a woman asked her, Miss Spider, can I be a superhero? Gwen replied to her, if you have a family, then protecting your family is doing superhero thing for you. Someone also asked, then will you reduce the crime fighting in the city in the future? Gwen replied to her, I will try my best to do what I can, but I cannot guarantee that everyone will get help. So Gwen basically just replied to that. And Gwen was being honest. That's how it should be. Doesn't sound like an official answer. That is to say, Tai Kai, such as what, I promise, God will, this, that, no and so on. Gwen's answers were all true. This also made everyone recognize the real Miss Spider again. Very nice. Su Yi smiled, then continued to browse TikTok to watch short videos. All clicked. I feel uncomfortable without brushing for a while. That's all. Su Yi swiped a few times. In some videos he didn't even watch the content. Then it went straight through. The result is in one video. Forehead. A familiar face flashed by. Even the sound was only half a sentence. Um? Su Yi raised his eyebrows. Flip the video back again. After seeing the figure inside, Su Yi was taken aback. Tony, Su Yi swiped to the right again to see the homepage of this account. It's clearly written on it. Tony middle dot stark middle dot superhero middle dot iron man. Oh really, really Tony? Um, and Gwen and Wanda were also stunned when they heard it. They looked up at Su Yi. Is it Iron Man Tony? Su Yi nodded. It's him. This guy also set up a personal account. Obviously, Tony's personal account is also just registered. The homepage has only one video, and the fans only have 9k. That is, the video has just been released not long ago. Su Yi swipe left to go back and watch the video again. The video starts playing. It started in the kitchen of the house. Tony held a 360 action camera in one hand, opened the refrigerator with the other took out an apple and took a bite, then go to the living room, go out the door again, outside the gate is the lake and lawn where they had barbecued before, and the mountains in the distance, then Tony came out and walked and dead and said, as soon as I came to awakening today, my dear wife reminded me to watch the news, after reading it, I found out that my good friend's partners have taken the initiative to expose their relationship, they also registered personal accounts to share their lives, so I also decided to register an account here to share videos of daily life, speaking of which, Tony went to sit on a chair by the lake, then he picked up the fishing rod by the lake, put the bait on it and threw it into the lake, Tony waited for the bait to sink before continuing, so I decided to follow the limelight, actually, I already knew about the League of Goddesses, because I and their male 4.2 are good friends, but as you can see, I want to protect my good friend's privacy, and you don't want to ask, I, Tony, will not reveal any news about my good friend, anything, for example, like the fact that he is much more handsome than me, even if you ask, I won't say it, speaking of which, Tony probably was afraid of laughing, so I took another big bite of the apple, then he continued after eating, anyway, that's how it is, the second thing is to tell me about my recent seclusion, how should I put it, it's really cool, sleep until I wake up naturally, I don't have to worry about any emergency tomorrow. I have too much money to spend, and I have a wife who loves me. It seems that inappropriate superhero is a correct choice. I heard that Hulk is also living in seclusion. His decision is right. As for the League of Goddesses, apart from Miss Spider, who doesn't have to worry about herself, Scarlet Witch has long been living a normal life with my good friend. Speaking of which, Tony saw his float move. He quickly took a few bites to finish the little apple. Then he said, while waiting for the float to sink. So what I'm trying to say is, superheroes are human too. Please give superheroes a normal life. The man in the League of Goddesses is neither a superhero nor an Avengers, but he secretly and silently helped many superheroes get through life's difficulties. So don't think that my good friend is not worthy of the League of Goddesses, but a girl dot 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 her, a man with a talent and a beauty. At this time, Tony's float sank, and Tony immediately put down the action camera in his hand. Then he said, while holding the pole with both hands, Okay, that's all I can say. I'll talk about more things in the next video. That's the end of Tony's words. The video ends with Tony being almost dragged into the lake by a fishing rod. It seems to be a big deal. Dot. If you like this audiobook, subscribe the channel for more videos like this. And join my Patreon if you want to support me. Link in the description.
Leave some comment and let me know if you guys like this story, or you have a web novel you like and want to hear its audiobook, I will be happy to create them for you. Please like, share, and leave a comment on the video.